Good luck. Good luck. Good luck to all of you and love to all. Mwah. 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 Good morning, jewelry makers all around the world. Jewelry makers unite. <laughs> Here they are! Breakfast Club. Breakfast Club, quite breakfast, literally. The breakfast Club pumpkin seed. <laughs> pumpkin seeds, flax seeds, chia seeds, uh, protein. Uh, powder. Powder. What's the liquid in there? Milk. Almond milk? I'm, or a, tra I'm a traditionalist. Just normal milk. Cow milk. Hello everybody and Merry Christmas. Oh no, it's tomorrow. No. No. I reckon, I re we, we, we were just talking about this before the show, we reckon that tomorrow's bonfire night, so as of Wednesday, it's then Christmas. Yeah, so you'll be hearing nothing but Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. I'm Jewelry Maker! Thank you, Michael. Um, so, um, producer Liam, producer Liam has already watched a Christmas movie. What have you watched, Levy? <clears throat> a new one on Netflix. With someone in it. Lovely. What about you? Uh, I watched one yesterday. Did you watch one yesterday? What was it? The Gingerbread... Uh, House? The Gingerbread Competition. The Gingerbread Competition. Ah, do you remember Sister Sister? One of the, I do remember one Sister of the Sister. Twins, uh, Tia. Tia was in it. No! Wow! Oh, Amazing. Oh, 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 oh. Amazing. That's fantastic. Uh, there we go. So, uh, there you go. Uh, so, what's your favourite Christmas movie? I like that. It's a good one. Come on. It's a good one. Mine would have to be National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. Probably. Santa Claus. The first one. Um, what about... Um, oh, what's that one? Santa Claus the movie with Dudley Moore in it. Yeah. Do you know the one? Yeah, that's a good one. That, that's a good one. Isn't it? Yeah, it's very good. Is that the one you're talking about, Liam? He's talking about another one. He's talking about another one. Tim Allen. Yes, OK. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lord. Yeah, OK, right. Uh, right, anyway. Uh, so, Oh, what about Elf? Come on, what about Elf? Elf is great. I mean, I've, I think I've probably seen it too many times. The Grinch, classic. Yeah, you're right. Texas Now, what's your favourite Christmas movie? I don't know. It's a Monday. It's a Monday. It's a bit pfft, outside. So uh, stay inside and just and just enjoy enjoy jewellery maker life. What's your favourite bonfire movie? What's your favourite bonfire movie? Yeah. Uh, v for Vendetta. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Great movie, hey. Great movie. I think I watched it once when I was coming down with a really bad cold or like a flu kind of thing. It's not the right movie to watch if you have any type of a fever because you will dream of it for about, um, yeah, about a week afterwards. Anyway, here we go. Today's, oh, well, see, I may as well just take everything off the tea bar, Liam, because Liam said, why don't we, why don't we have a look and see what we've got coming up today? Today's deal of the day. These are the most amazing aquamarine kites. They're flat Flat on the back and domed on top. They're absolutely gorgeous. I love, 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 love them. These are going to the most amazing price. Under 30 pounds. There's only 70 available. They are all going to be selling out today. Yeah. That's right, that's right. That's right, that's right. We've also got... We've also got rose quartz uh, coming up. These are amazing. The price on these, even, well, even now, absolutely amazing. These are going to be coming up. 115 carats on these beauties. They're coming up in the 11 o'clock hour as well. So we've got the deal of the day and you've got the beautiful rose quartz. We've also got, coming up at 10 o'clock, what I believe to be one of the best strands of tourmaline we've ever had in stock. It's a reorder. It's sold out completely. We've reordered it back in. Hasn't been seen for about, what, four, four, five months? 
This is coming up. Now, I want you to try and guess the price on this. Completely natural tourmaline, four mil rounds. Um, I want you to try and, oh no, five mil rounds. I want you to try and guess what the price is gonna be on this, because I'll tell you something. It's ridiculous. Uh, yeah, there's 150 chances available. It's a reorder. They're five mil rounds. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's coming up at 10 o'clock. Our last opportunity of the day today is going to be this. Now, I was showing you this on my Facebook Live. If you join me, hello, good morning. Um, and if you didn't, where on earth were you? Hmm? Every morning before the show, you'll see um, it, it's either myself or, or normally presenter um, Elle uh, doing a Facebook Live and we give you a little taste of what's going to be coming up on the show. And um, this is coming up. It's probably going to be our last opportunity today. The reason why I'm holding it like this, look at that clarity and that sparkle and that colour. It is amazing. I love, 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 love this strands. The price on this is ridiculous. I have got, we've got about 200 of these, haven't we? Yeah. Yeah, nearly 300 chances available for this one. That's another guess the prize, bad boy. It's ridiculous. And then I didn't show you this during my Facebook Live. Um, I don't know why. I just don't think I knew that we had it on the show. This is a strand of appetite, multicolor appetite coming up at midday today. It's beautiful, isn't it? You've got neon, yellow, uh, and beautiful sky blue appetite in there. And then to to kind of the uh, the little cherry on top of the jewellery maker cake today is this. Two carats of yellow diamonds coming up in just a couple of seconds, actually. It's our alarm clock deal. We're joined by guest designer Fleur. Uh, we're joined by guest designer Fleur today. She's got fold forming. We've got the German saw. We've got the saw blades back in stock. We've got the butane torch. We've got the fold forming DVD. We've got a partridge in a pear tree. We're going to be playing this in a couple of moments. But first, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's do something for under a... F what? Excuse do something for a fiver, did you just say? It's a for a fiver. What? What? Michael's on camera today. Good morning, Michael. Hello. 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 Lee Ham is producing the show. Good morning, Lee Ham. Uh, we've got uh, production manager Ollie on the uh, directing chair today. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Tickle. Will he do it now? Let's have a look. He's not going to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Is he not going to do it? Are you going to show us your lovely long arms, Ollie? Yeah, come on. <laughs> <laughs> and we've got Neary on uh, floor today. He's on a mission. Okay, fair enough. Labradorite graduated plane. Irregular bacons. So these are four ninety five. Which Michael? It's already under a fiver. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no no. We're gonna go lower because we love you. Uh, Two pounds sixty seven. Oh my word, for genuine natural Labradorite. Come and get involved with us today. Well done, everybody. Karen's already in. Melissa's already in. Susan. Oh, that's just made my day. Woke up. The first thing I see, Michael Wolf. That's me. That's you, mate. I'm Michael Wolf. You're Michael Wolf. All day long. We love Michael Wolf. You've just made Susan's day. First thing she saw when she woke up was you. Oh, Hopefully, Anna, when you were Anna, watching Jewelry Maker. Michaela's also messaged in. Best Christmas movie has to be It's a Wonderful Life. But the black and white one. Now, I'll be honest with you, I've never watched It's a Wonderful Life. I've never watched it. I am going to make a concerted effort to watch it this Christmas because everybody says it's a brilliant movie. Mary and Brian also watch... Uh, good morning, everybody. We watched It's a Wonderful Life last night. Not the first Christmas one. Or not, or, it's about the third one you've watched. Well, there is a thing going around Facebook about um, uh, about Christmas, Christmas, Advent, uh, Christmas Advent movies... Uh, so there's a move. There's a Christmas movie for every day of December. Of course, there is, obviously, and it lists through what they all are. And I heard this on the news as well. Um, uh, producer Lee Ham, the earlier you put your Christmas tree up, the happier you are. Do you might? Do, do you know what? I might. I might go and get a fake tree this way and shove it up. I might do it. 
Yeah, see, this is it. This is this is it. This is um, see, this is it. Ollie, uh, his uh, his daughter, um, her her birthday is uh, the sixth of December. So you can't really do anything. What? Not even if it's like a birthday Christmas tree. A birthday? No, I don't know. She won't let you. She won't let you put a Christmas tree. Oh dear. Right. Well done, everyone who came well, through to get that. <laughs> put a sheet over it. And when she goes to bed, take the sheet off and just. Oh, it's Christmas. <laughs> I love Christmas. I don't know about you. I absolutely love it. Should we stick with under five for a bit? Go on then, Lee Ham. Off we go. All the way down. Rainbow Moonstone graduated a regular. <gasps> um, Michael, what shape are these? A regular top jewel drops. Are they? Irregular top jewel drops. Irregular top jewel drops. Irregular, irregular, irregular top jewel drops. Irregular top jewel drops. Irregular top jewel drops. Irregular, irregular, irregular top jewel drops. Hey! Oh, that's what that leg thing was about. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I've done my back in. Oh, I've done my back. I've got 34 inch legs. Thank you very much. <laughs> You've got 28 inch legs. Have you, Michael? Yes, oh, legs. blimey. <laughs> and a very long body. And a very long torso. Uh, <laughs> 2.95. Well done, everybody. Keep coming through to get these. Well done. Uh, we are uh, bringing you some amazing deals today for under a fiver. I tell you something. We've got a couple of the items that I've shown you today. They're not going uh, much above about the old five pound note, just to let you know. Uh, 2.95. Well done, everyone. Gorgeous. Let's do it. Let's do it. Here we go. We've got the uh, yellow diamonds coming up in a in a few moments. What is this? Oh, is it black, black, black quartzite? It's very, very dark. Oh my word, beautiful. Gorgeous, beautiful strand there. Black quartzite, plain six millimeter rounds. Uh, should we take these under a fiver? I don't know whether they can go under a fiver, but should we just do it anyway? Let's do it. Let's take the price point down. Down, down, deeper and down. Here we go, how low can we go? We can go this low, £2.65, pence. there you are my lovelies. You get your 30 day money back guarantee with everything you get from Jewelry Maker Plus. You're only paying 3 pounds per order. Melissa, well done to uh, Regina in New York. Oh, hello. Karen, Shandy, well done to you, my love. Pauline, well done to you. Vernia, well done. It's gone, it's, it's gone, it's gone, it's gone, it's gone. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, it's so lovely to have you producing today, Liam. I was getting ever so bored of, um, of uh, producer Wayne. <laughs> oh, bless him. I hope he's having a nice couple of days off, bless him. Uh, we do love producer Wayne, but he needed to have a couple of days off, really. You could tell he was starting to go a little bit mad. Uh, so, uh, green colour dyed quartz faceted rondelles. It, I tell, this, this, I mean, this looks like it could be Russian dioxide, doesn't it, gang? Don't you think? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How much would it be if it was Russian dioxide? Exactly Mundo. Today, £3.50. £3.50. Absolutely amazing. I spent more on that when I was parking my car yesterday. Unbelievable. Good morning, everyone. It's not Christmas until my... Something makes us watch Scrooge with, uh, with Alistair Sim. I'm not aware of that movie. I know Scrooge. I don't know who... I don't, uh, the Alistair Sim movie? I like the Scrooge with um, Alec Guinness playing Scrooge. There's black and white one. Maybe about Alec Guinness, I don't know. That's very good. Very, very good. Christmas Carol, that's a great movie. Do you know it was Dickens, Charles Dickens, who introduced the... Uh, no, he's not. Uh, Charles... Is your, no, he's not your uncle. He's not your uncle. So, OK, so your, your mum's brother was Charles Dickens. Not the Charles Dickens, though. Okay, you're, you're, oh, gee whiz. Anyway, Charles Dickens was the, was, was, was the bloke who uh, introduced Christmas turkeys to the UK rather than Christmas goose. It used to be goose. 
you know Santa, Santa Claus and Santa Claus movie from Santa Claus movie. Yes. That's George C. Scott who played him. He played Ebenezer Scrooge in My Favorite Christmas Carol. Did he? Yeah, in 1984. I think it's, it's an old one. Whoa! It's, a movie, but it's, it's really cool. Okay, there you go. Got the alarm clock deal coming up in one opportunity's time, but first we're going to do this beauty. Here we go. Things are selling out already, just to let you know, everyone. Black quartz like gone. Beautiful. Black and green agate faceted rounds. Um, Ollie is voting for a Muppet Christmas Carol. I like a Muppet Christmas Carol too, but I don't think I, I don't think Michael Caine is the right guy. Scrooge. I don't think Michael Caine is the right guy. Scrooge is a great movie. Oh, Bill Murray yeah. is Bill Murray, isn't it? Um, Joanne and Kate, morning, Carol and crew. Thank you. I needed the top drill drop uh, drop song. Uh, best Christmas movie, Die Hard, every time. Yeah, my um, my 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 husband would say that for sure, for sure. But it's not Christmassy. It's just set at Christmas. Three pounds, black and green agate faceted rounds uh, for three pounds. Is Harry Potter a Christmas movie? No. It's always Christmas at the, in the Harry Potter movies, is it? Regina, well done to you, my lovely. Karen, well done to Miss. Hello, Miss in Nottinghamshire. Melissa, well done to you, my lovely. Fantastic. More people coming through. Karen in Essex, that's great to see. Well done. Check those baskets out. Three quid. The thing with the Breakfast Club hour as well is everything played in this hour is available for an hour after it's been played or until it sells out. So that's what you need to know. Hertrude's got two. Well done, my lovelies. These are about to go. They're about to sell out. Well done, everybody coming through to get these. Gorgeous, gorgeous qualities. Um, absolutely fantastic. Well done. Uh, things are selling out. Things are going. Well done. I've got a couple left on the Rainbow Moonstone, a couple of the green colour dye quartz as well. Absolutely fantastic. Well done. Uh, oh, yes. Light the lamp, not the rat. That's from a Muppet's Christmas Carol. That's from a Muppet's Christmas Carol. Yeah, and they light the rat's tail. Yeah. No, it's a great movie. I just don't think Michael Caine was the best casting for Ebenezer Scrooge. I like it when but a the great rats movie. ask him for um, some extra coal. He goes, no, and you'll get sacked. And they go, heat wave. Whee! This is my island <laughs> in the sun. Whee! Whee! Oh, alarm clock deal. Okay, alarm clock deal. <clears throat> no, I'm not going to be dressed as an alarm. I can't talk today. What's wrong with me? I'm not going to be dressed up as an alarm clock, but it's going to involve an alarm clock, me, and like a bed. Yeah, basically. Here we go. So the alarm clock deal, it is two carrots of yellow diamonds oh my word you have an hour to get this an hour um this is available for an hour or until it sells out yellow diamonds i kid you not two carats of yellow diamonds they are absolutely gorgeous stunning quality Beautiful faceting. Beautiful faceting. Beautiful quality. Look at that colour. Look at the luster. I love the uh, shape on these as well. I love, love, love the shape on these. They are gorgeous. Beautiful oval shaped barrels. They are gorgeous. Do you know what? These, these should be 149 quid. Do you know what? That's amazing. And I've got, I do have a decent quantity available, but you don't know what the price is going to be, okay? And you're already through. This is great to see. I've got a couple of people on the phone lines. Are you wondering how much it's going to be? Okay, so to show you we're not messing around, I'm going to show you this now. So we've got two carats of bright yellow diamonds they are absolutely pristine aren't they gorgeous gorgeous quality amazing luster 
Justine, well done to you. Should we show you where these last closed? <clears throat> these last closed at 99.95. This is where they last close. Now, these are genuine yellow diamonds. They've been heated. Uh, basically, when you heat a diamond, um, all that happens is, all that happens is, is they will turn the color that if they'd have been left in the ground for another few hundred thousand years, Mother Nature would have eventually turned these diamonds to yellow. You cannot heat a diamond and make it go a color that it doesn't want to be. It will only ever turn a certain color. Um, I believe with um, with um, with uh, yellow diamonds, it's the presence of nitrogen that gives you this gorgeous yellow colour. And a diamond will never go a colour that it doesn't want to be. You can heat it to all and sundry, but if you want it to turn blue and, and, and it only wants to be yellow, it's never going to happen. All, the, all we're doing is speeding up the process Mother Nature would have applied to these diamonds. They haven't been dyed, they haven't been irradiated, they have, certainly haven't been coated. We're at 99.95. Now, do you know what, Liam? You're absolutely right. If, you, if we were talking about Argyle diamonds from Australia, these would be four-figure diamonds. They are absolutely gorgeous. They're all the way from South Africa, which is where the predominantly um, the world's amount of diamonds are from. Shall we take these down to the lowest price that we can possibly do for these? For two carats of yellow diamonds, these will sell out today. 65 pounds. That is another 35 quid back in your pocket today. We are down to 65 pounds for two carats of gorgeous yellow diamonds here. You are, on the strand, you've got approximately 10 on there. Jane, well done to you as well. I've got people coming through on the phone lines. They could take all of these, but you've got to, got to, got to, got to, got to check out. Dawn, well done to you, my lovelies. Very, very popular. Well done. Check your baskets out. Helen, Joanne, check your baskets out. Well done. I can't guarantee, I can't guarantee these are ever going to be taken down to this price again. And let me just tell you, after eight o'clock this morning, sorry, at nine o'clock this morning, the price point will go back up to 150 quid. So you can either get these now at 65 pounds or you can come through and get them at, at um, oh, I don't know, 20 past nine this morning and the price will go right the way back up. Get them now. Pauline, well done to you as well. Collector in Gloucestershire, well done to you. Phyllis in the Shetland Isles, well done to you. There's loads of you there today. Two carats of yellow diamonds for £65. Canary yellow diamonds are the kind of diamonds where if these were natural canary yellow diamonds, they would be four figures fat for two carats of yellow diamonds. Well done. More collectors coming through. Half the stock's gone. Collector in South Yorkshire. Check your baskets out. Please do not leave these in your baskets. At 20 past nine this morning, the price will go back up to £150. And you can absolutely come through and get these if you want to um, at 20 past nine this morning, but the price will go back up. Well done. A couple of these in a pair of earrings, three of them in the centre of a gorgeous sliding class bracelet. You have got gorgeous canary yellow diamonds here. They are such a great size as well. Just the right size if you wanted to use them maybe in a solitaire or a trilogy ring. Gorgeous, gorgeous quality. 80% has been allocated. That's great to see. Well done. I need you to check your baskets out. You've got to do this today. You've got to do it before or basically 20 past nine, because otherwise the price will go back up to 150 quid. It's up to you. If you want to buy them at half nine, fine. It's better for us because, of course, you'll be paying, you'll be paying 150 quid or get them now for 65 pounds. I've got more in baskets than I've got stock available. You've got to come in through and get these today. You've got your 30 day money back guarantee. You're only paying your 3.95 p and p per order. I've still got more people on the phone lines there. That is absolutely your final price. These have previously closed at 99 pounds. We've taken an extra 35 pounds off that price point today and they're yours for 60 five pounds. We've got to move on now, uh, but massive congratulations to everyone who comes through to get that. That is, I don't think that's ever been seen before. 65 quid for two carats of yellow diamonds. Right, Herkimer, oh, one of my all-time favourite gemstones, this. One of my all-time favourite gemstones. I love Herkimer quartz. I've got two more in baskets. Well done. Check out though, because otherwise you will miss out, and I'd hate that to happen. Herkimer Quartz. Look at this. Oh my gosh. This is what is described as a double terminated quartz. It's got basically a pointy end on either end. I love Herkimer. It is 
one of my favorite gemstones. You get these incredible um, straight angular facets on here, which Mother Nature herself created. What you have inside these incredible Herkimer quartz are these really, really gorgeous um, rutilated inclusions. Um, they're sometimes called Herkimer diamonds because the clarity is so, so, so striking. Don't forget, you can have a gemstone with amazing transparency, but it doesn't have to have, uh, it doesn't have to be inclusion free. The transparency on these gemstones is enormous. It, it's, it, it's like glass. Um, and you've got these incredible rutilated inclusions. It's supposed to be a 36 centimeter strand. Let's get the ruler of truth and let's give it a measure. This is a 30, a 38 centimeter strand. How much is this? What? For Herkimer Quartz? How many have we got? 26 available, goodness me. This is ridiculous. Have a look at this, 11.95. I'm used to seeing Herkimer Quartz at kind of 20, 30 pounds. If you want the look of incredible diamonds, get your Herkimer Quartz because for 11.95, that is the most amazing price tag, well done. Jackie, well done to Elizabeth, well done to Melissa. Do you know what? That's a really good idea actually, producer Lim, um, to use it with the yellow diamonds. Look at that, it's really gonna make those yellow diamonds pop as well. It's gonna make that color pop. Yeah, look at that, Jackie. Well done to you, my lovely. More people coming through to get this, you're doing amazingly. 11.95, that's amazing. What a price point today. Are you right in there, Liam? You've gone very high pitched all of a sudden. They can't believe it, I know. Collector in Dumfries and Galway, well done to you as well. Bidders in Worcestershire. Uh, fantastic, well done everybody. Jane, Heather, well done to you as well. Oh, here we go, Joanne. The Alistair Sim version of Scrooge was the first one I saw. It was made in 1951. There you go. There you go. Well, that's fantastic. Am I right? It was Alec Guinness. Did, Alec Guinness did play Scrooge, didn't he, in one of the Scrooges, Christmas Carols? I think so. There have been a lot of Scrooges. Alec Guinness. What? Guinness. You like Guinness. Gee whiz. Yes, yeah, Scrooge. It was 1970 he played Scrooge. He played Star Wars. Wow. That is, uh, that is amazing. He played Star Wars, apparently. He also played... No, he also played, I want to say, Herbert Pocket in... Great Expectations. Is that his name? Herbert Pocket? Ah. Oh. to say Alec Guinness, Great Expectations. I think it was Herb, Herbert Pocket? It was a great movie with uh, John Mills playing uh, Pip. Oh, it's great. 10 yards of cocoa wire mesh. Coco, remember me. Do you know what? I was watching that yesterday with my, uh, with my children. Oh, it's a great movie, isn't it? Coco, it's a great movie. Oh, it's so good. Um, uh, it's 10 yards of uh, cocoa coloured wire mesh that you're gonna be getting here. Makes lovely, um, makes lovely ribbon going around Christmas decorations. It's um, a really, really useful material. It looks like material, it looks like ribbon. It's actually wire. It's actually made from little, beautiful, fine, thin wires. And it's a little mesh, it's gorgeous, isn't it? Um, this is the, well, yes, you can pull it a little bit. It's not like the, um, it's not like the other wire mesh, which is a bit thicker. You can, if you want to, you can make it a little bit wider and you can kind of form it into, form it into shapes if you want to. Uh, but the other stuff's a bit more, a bit more pullable. Uh, well done. It's yours today for three quid. There you go, everyone. Nice to get that, um, involved in your, uh, textile projects. I wanted to say. Number two, here we go. I love this colour. It looks really nice with the, uh, with the cocoa, actually. Go, go. Here we go. What are you doing, Liam? What do you mean, let's just do this price? I don't like it when you say things like that. Let's just, let's just try it out. Okay, we're going to uh, give you a bit of a price point today. <laughs> it is way too low, Michael, but uh, do you know what? It's almost Christmas, and I think that's uh, reason enough. 195. Have I done my Christmas shopping? No. No, I've done none. 
You've got half of yours. Oh my gosh, I've, I've done nothing. I've literally done nothing. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Uh, £1.95 pence for 10 yards of your navy wire mesh. One millimetre engage. Absolutely amazing, amazing, amazing stuff you're going to be getting here. It's got the most beautiful uh, feel to it. It's got a really lovely, fine, silky feel to it. I would be using this, you know, if you wanted to do a very simple plaited bracelet. It, it creates the most gorgeous uh, braid. Um, it's beautiful. If you wanted to twist it together as well, that'd be really nice if you wanted to twist it together. Look, if I just kind of get two of them. Look, look at the two colours together. That's really, really nice. Gorgeous. Be like a little bracelet, couldn't it? A little bracelet. Oh, my kids were, my kids were devastated yesterday to, to kind of get ready for, you know, first day back at school today. We had to take the hair braids out that they've had in all, all half term. We've had to take the, oh dear me, that was not, uh, that was not, that did not go down very well. Never mind. Can't wear them to school. Black obsidian twisted tubes. Oh, Michael, look at this one here. It's got some beautiful, uh, like almost like a chatoyancy. Oh, they do. You could have them all together. You're quite right, Leeham. Look at that. That's nice, isn't it? I love that kind of, would you say it's chatoyancy? I suppose it is, isn't it? I suppose it's like asterism, chatoyancy, whatever you want to call it. It's beautiful, isn't it? It's a lovely kind of twisted, um, don't you get licorice in these kind of shapes? Yeah. Mmm. I like red licorice, but um, the black, I don't like black stuff. You like the what? Oh, with the bobbly, what are you talking about licorice of all sorts? Very nice, yeah, the bobbly ones. Yeah, the other ones are, oh no, I like the, um, the coconut-y rings with the licorice in the middle, they're nice. I eat the coconut around it. Oh yeah, but other than that, <laughs> Uh, 9 95 Yeah, if you want to make some licorice jewellery that you can't eat, then this is what I would go for, Michaela. Scrooged with Bill Murray was another great movie. So funny. Yes, well, Bill Murray is just amazing, isn't he? Amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, yeah, he's great, isn't he? Oh, Bill Murray. He's been in some amazing movies, hasn't he? Very, very funny. Here we go. Beautiful. Well done. 9 95 for those beauties today. Well done. Moving on up and moving on out. Time to break free. Nothing can stop me. Ah, uh, here they are. Does anyone know what happened on Strictly last night? I didn't watch it. Or the night before. Who went? Emma. Emma? Who's Emma? Emma? Who's she? The, the lady. The lady. Who, who was she? Not the one from EastEnders. The one, with, the one with the nose and the cheekbones. The lady. Oh, no! Oh, dear, really? Mm. Fluorite hearts, here we go. 12 mil. Fluorite hearts. Oh, these are absolutely gorgeous. Oh, natural. Mm. Um, what price point should we do for these? Eight ninety-five. Go on then. Let's let's have a bit of that then. Um, well done. You could make some cheeky earrings, couldn't you? On the strand. Hang on. Let's just have a look, shall we? Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty, thirty-two, thir thirty-four. So you can make fifteen, sixteen, seventeen pairs of earrings. How much per gemstone? Fifty-two pence a pair. Twenty-six p each. That's amazing. That is that is proper proper uh, kind of pocket money stocking filler prices. That is amazing. <gasps> oh, how lovely! That's gorgeous. Well done to Melissa. Well done to Karen. Well done to uh, Regina. Well done to Shandy. You're doing brilliantly. Well done to Sadara. Gorgeous. Well done to Miss. <gasps> oh, Liam. I love you. Uh, I love you, Liam. Liam made Valentine's cards. Liam would make Valentine's cards for all the girls at school. Oh, mate. Did you get, did you get any responses? Did you get anyone kind of loving them or? After, after year six, you stopped. Oh, so when you went into secondary school, you stopped. 
Oh, dear me. Has anyone ever got, has anyone ever received a genuine Valentine's Day card and they didn't know who it was from and then you found out who it was from and it was really... Oh, I never found out who it was. was uh, I used to work at a restaurant like in Tamworth years ago. Yeah. And, and it was posted. And oh. Me, and it was like a, a long saying how much they, you know, liked me and stuff. I never found out who it was. Proper... Boy, yeah, Seriously? Yeah. I got I got a Valentine's card once. Um, and I didn't know who it was from for for weeks and weeks and weeks. And then I found out who it was from. It was from a guy. He was married. He gave me a Valentine. I was like, ah, uh, no, thank you. No, this is when I was I was twenty. No, I was probably nineteen, twenty. It's not very good, is it? Anyway. Ooh, this is a meter of pink amethyst. Oh my word. A meter of pink amethyst. A meter, Michael. A whole meter. Oh my gosh. The, the, yeah, this is going to be an absolute fortune. It's a meter, Ollie. It's going to be an absolute fortune, this is. I mean, it's got to be. It's pink amethyst. It's got to be. It's got to be. Lee Ham is naming himself the bad boy of JM. Bad boy, under 20 pounds. What you got to do when they come for you? Uh, we're 19. I know a meter is long. Thank you, Liam. <laughs> Gee, we're, a meter is long, you know. 1995. That is very, very, very long. Well, it depends. Is a meter long? A meter's long in the gemstone world. If, I mean, if, if you're doing the long jump, a meter's not very long at all, is it? Like, I think my six-year-old could probably jump a metre. Uh, but it, in the gem world, to get a metre of gemstones is incredible. Uh, well done to collect. <laughs> Can you imagine if they did in the Olympics the one metre dash? You'd just step, wouldn't you? That's all you'd do. Oh, man, Melissa... Me. Well done to you. Minley would have to like step twice. <laughs> <laughs> Glenda, well done to be a hop, skip and a jump for you, uh, Michael. <laughs> Glenda, Tina, Paula, well done. There's loads of you coming through. That's absolutely gorgeous. Well done. We're down to our last final. Seven, seven. Who's going to get, uh, is it going to be collector? Is it going to be Jeanette? Jeanette Marara. Is it going to be Tina? Who's it going to be? Yes, Michael. If that's two by one to five by two and it's a metre, it should be around about the 75 gems you get on there. If, if you're going to take the average immediately. 75? Yeah. Um, I don't know about that, mate. Oh. I think no, you're probably no, 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 getting no, 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 a few no, no. more than that, love. Or oh, is it 750? Yeah, more like 750. I'll count 10 for you, Michael. So, I'll count the 10 biggest ones just to kind of highlight two your five. two, four, six, eight, ten. That's 10, love. I think there's probably more than 75 on there. Oh, 20, 30, just, just a hunch. 50, 60, 75, just, yeah, just a hunch. <laughs> We're under 20 pounds. Well done, Diane. Well done to Angela, Anita, Olwyn. Well done. Oh, that's very funny. Awkward. Awkward. No, not really. It's never awkward. We're all, we're all... Oh, mate, no. Uh, we're all, we're all friends here. There's no... There's no wrong answers here. Well, no, there are lots of wrong answers, but you know, we won't make a, we won't make a big thing of it. Uh, Kyanite. One of my favorites. That is beautiful, isn't it? 158 carats of gorgeous kyanite all the way from Brazil. Um, beautiful, beautiful colours. Lovely silvery blues. I love this gem. So let's get that price point down. Down, down, deeper and down. All the way down. Here we go, everyone. £34.95. Oh, dear me. Sorry, I'm just thinking about something. Sorry. Uh, how many on here, Michael? How many, how many do you reckon? About 75? 12. <laughs> oh mate I do love you uh, well done everybody 158 carats of your genuine kind oh, that's great isn't it Chantal has messaged in hello lovely Chantal morning I love the night they saved Christmas oh, I haven't seen that but they don't play it anymore why not why not Oh, about a boy was on, wasn't it? Yes. I wasn't. I wasn't watching it. I was listening to it. 
Um, is it Hugh Grant? Yeah, thought so. There we go. Well done, everyone. Let's do number 20. Sunstone, love this. Love Actually is an amazing Christmas movie. <gasps> My favourite Christmas movie. Go on, Flip. I've got two. Go on. Well, I've got three, actually. Oh. oh. Die Hard. Die Hard and Gremlins. Gremlins? Gremlins is a Christmas movie. I love Gremlins. Is it a Christmas movie or does it just so happen to be set at Christmas? That's no, a Christmas movie. They're just like cute little Santa's helpers. Really? Yeah, it's set in Christmas, so I, I'm taking it as a Christmas movie. <laughs> <laughs> Guess the sign of Fleur. You can't remember what it is, but you like it. There's two of them. Two elves that go head to head. To try and be Santa's... Santa Claus the movie. Have you? Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah that's um, Santa Claus the movie. It's got John Lithgow in it. Yeah. What? Oh no! Oh no! What does he say? When oh, he yeah. when he goes. Oh, free. Free. Oh, free. <laughs> For free. For free. For free. And uh, Pierce Jules. <laughs> and uh, oh, it's just it's so funny. I love the movie. <laughs> yeah, John Lithgow is amazing, isn't he? I love him. Deck the Halls, I haven't seen that one. The Holiday's very yeah, good. good and uh, Bad Moms at Christmas, that's very good. Daddy's Home. Daddy's Home, no. Yeah. Right. Um, that's so the Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. That's my favourite one. That's, that's my favourite one. one. Sunstone graduated, faceted, Rondells. Here they are at £12.95. Well done to uh, Regina uh, coming through to get these, my darling. Well done. So much of your beautiful sparkliness there. Gorgeous, gorgeous quality. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Well done, everyone. Moonstone. Moonstone. Coated moonstone. Oh, still in the packet. It's that speciale. Come here. Come on, dude. Sorry. <laughs> oh, oh, there we go. There we are. There we go. I love this strand. It's absolutely beautiful. Look at this. Look at that. Oh, my words. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at that coated moonstone. Gorgeous quality, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, will you look at that? Elle in Gloucester Morning, Carol and team. I'm with Fleur. Gremlins is a Christmas film. Do you, do you see what I see? Loving the bargains. Yes, absolute monsters. There's loads and loads of bargains, aren't they? Lovely. We've got Shah, right? We've got Tourmaline. We've got Garnet. We've got um, Appetite. We've got Rose Quartz. We've got Amethyst. Uh, sorry, not Amethyst. Aquamarine. Shall we, um, shall we re-look at them? Okay, here we go. So, Tourmaline coming up at 10 o'clock. What price do you reckon it's going to be? Text him. Five mil rounds. Maybe it's born with it. Maybe it's tourmaline. It is a ludicrous price point. Completely natural five mil rounds of tourmaline. I've also got coming up at what time? Uh, 12 o'clock, thank you. Um, multi appetite. You've got um, neon, yellow, and sky blue. Oh, mate, I feel a little bit ill now after you said that. Uh, appetite coming up at 12 o'clock. You've also got coming up at 12.45. I'm going to hold it up like this again, Michael. Is that all right? Yes, yeah, follow me. Beautiful, sparkly, gorgeous garnet. Guess the price on that bad boy. Ah! That's going to be very exciting. Deal of the day, deal of the day, boom, oh. boom. You've got your cheeky, cheeky chops aquamarine aqua. That's amazing. 70 available, coming up at 11 o'clock. That is going to be on and gone. Very first time it's on. And we've also got the same, a slightly larger carrot weight actually, in, in Lowe's Quartz. 115 carrots, isn't it? Yeah, 115 carrots. Look at that bad boy. <gasps> oh! So that's coming up just after the deal of the day. So there's loads. And we've got a shower right thing. Shower right thing coming up. By the way, I bought you, my God, wait. Uh, by the way, I bought you this amazing strand of yellow diamonds. Um, I, I have got about five left. Most of them have gone. Check your baskets out for the two carrots of yellow diamonds. We took them down to 65 quid. They normally close at 99.95. We took it down to 65 pounds. Let's go and see some of your amazing pieces of jewelry on today's Wall of Fame. Hello. Hello. 
<laughs> well, I guess it's on a flare today. Yeah. Ten weeks. Twenty-eighth of August. I just checked. Seriously. Twenty-eighth of August. Oh, it's been saved up for I... today. <laughs> <laughs> I have. Have you actually been here then? Yeah. yeah. You just I worked working... with L for seven shows in a row. Oh, dear me. Ten weeks. Mm. Right. Well, let's let's do this Wall of Fame. You, are you? Are you? I don't know. I, I get the impression that there may have been some emails sent about not wanting to work with me. <laughs> no, because I don't think we were really naughty the first time. Last well, time, though. Yes. Well. Mm. <laughs> Number three hundred and eighty-eight. Goodness me! Wow! It's a it's an it's an essay. This is from Bridget. Hi guys. Made pearl earrings using a strand of lavender nucleated pearls I got from Joy Maker, and CZ hairpins. Um, the strand was luxurious, much more than I'd usually spend on one strand of gemstones, but I got them to make into several special gifts. An earring and pendant set for a winter wedding, another for a 50th wedding anniversary, and these particular pairs um, of earrings are going to be donated for sale to try and raise money for a local charity. Hopefully the buyer won't mind the ear wire part being homemade and slightly wonky. I'm sure they will be absolutely fine with it. You've got to get more. Oh, here we, here we go. She's telling us what we need to get. Uh, you need to get more of the three nine two five oh, three meter trace chain so I can finish the pendants. Some chains in gold overlay would be great if I can leave that little request to you. Be my guest, Bridget. Uh, thanks, Jane, for the beautiful product. <laughs> it's much more enjoyable to make gifts and try to find some uh, in your local shops. And that's from Bridget. Bridget, thank you, my lovely. Song and verse from Bridget. Absolutely amazing. <laughs> Best of luck. <laughs> I've got number 387, and this is from David Price. And it says, hi, all at JM. Please find a touch. My latest entry for the Wall of Fame. All the gemstones are abalone. All the clasps are made from 925 sterling silver and are handmade. The heart on the top bracelet is 925 sterling silver and also handmade. The original heart on the bottom bracelet was made using wax. A mould was then made using Delft clay, into which poured molten 925 sterling silver. Ooh. The seed beads are 925 sterling silver. The Beading thread is Flex Right 49, all materials purchased from JM. Please, uh, best wishes to you all and my fellow entrants. That's David Price from Manchester. David giving us all the details yeah, there. It's good though. The moon was in its second phase. There was a Y in the day of the week. <laughs> and I was wearing red underwear. Uh, this is number 390. Is. This is this is yeah. really beautiful, beautiful work. This is from Jane in Devon. Hello, all at JM and my fellow jewelry makers. Thank you for the felting inspiration, in particular from guest designers Mel Green and Gemma Crow. I was inspired to make this poppy brooch from my stash, which I got some time ago. I also enjoyed doing a bit of beading in the centre. Best of luck to everyone in the drawer. That's from Jane. That's beautiful. beautiful. Really, really beautiful piece. Well done. Pretty. Some beautiful earrings here. Number 389. This is from Christine Walker. It says, Dear JM, please find a touch to photo of my Wall of Fame entry piece. Featuring JM diamond cut stone silver ear wires, sterling silver wire and labradorite coins. I also used the pilot gold pen I recently purchased. I made a pair of hand cut leather leaves from scrap leather in my stash. And that's from Christine Walker. That's very Thank you, nice. My very mixed media. Beautiful. 392. This is from Helen Robbins. Hi, all at JM. Here's my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. It's one of the pieces that I made using Gemma's challenge kit. The tektite made me think of lava and volcanoes, hence the eruption of tektite and, uh, tektite and the wire flames below it. Good luck to everyone in the drawer. That's from Helen. That is amazing. Beautiful. Wow, gorgeous. These are a pair of earrings that I would, if I saw these on a, on a craft stand, I would buy them straight away. Number 391. It's from Sarah Potter in West Yorkshire. And it says, my Wall of Fame entry this week is a pair of tourmaline earrings. JM introduced me to tourmaline and now I'm a little obsessed. Oh, you're going to love a strand that's coming up later. Woo! I've used cubes and frosted drops in these earrings, which are rosary linked with 0.4 wire and tiny gold plated beads. Uh, the long and, uh, they're very long and dangly, but very lightweight. I love the colours of the tourmaline. I hope you like them. Sarah Potter in West Yorkshire. Gorgeous. Thank you very much. I'm just looking at this craft stall. Wow. There's a lot of jewellery here. Jewelry. There's some beautiful pieces. <laughs> this is from Ali. Morning all. I thought I'd share a picture of one of my tables at my coffee morning this week. Uh, all made with my collection of gems from Jewelry Maker, made over the years. Thanks, JM. And that's from Ali. Thank you, darling. What an amazing looking stand. That's gorgeous. Best of luck. I've got number 393. I think this is inspired by our lovely Linda. And it's from Angela Cannon wow. in Mel Mowbray. It says, good evening. And oh, um, here's wow. a selection of my babushka dolls I am oh. I'm in the process of making. I love making these. Um, so many thanks to the wonderful Linda. The majority of the items used are from JM, with the other few sparkly bits from my stash. 
thanks, Jane, for all the exciting things mm. you bring us. And that's from Angela. Yeah. They're beautiful, aren't they? They're gorgeous. Babushka, 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 yeah, yeah. I was listening to that yesterday, actually. Yeah. Um, <laughs> 394, this is lovely. Really, really lovely. Shirovsky with, with some beautiful um, uh, lapis. Uh, hello again, everyone. Uh, this is from Julie Dudley. Here's my uh, entry to the Wall of Fame. A cab prong set and wrapped in champagne gold wire with six mil bicone um, on the bale. Everything is from JM, as usual. Good luck to everyone entering this week. Love and best wishes from Julie Dudley on the Isle of Wight. There she is. What a beauty. And the last one I've got is number 396, and this is from D. Devereaux in Coventry. It says, good morning all at JM. I'm sending in some stretches I've been making, trying to make some, uh, trying to use my spare beads. Good luck to all, and that's from D. That's beautiful. Gorgeous. Amazing. Oh, mate. I don't know what the chat is. No, no. <laughs> it's just so, so bad, crazy. isn't it? Yes, I can reach it. Thank you, Lee Ham. We've got cake, have we, today? Yeah, this cake. And there's little, uh, like, trick-or-treat sweetie bits in there. Mm. <laughs> Here we go. Fluorite ovals. No, there's no help. Eh? No help, is there? No! Thing. Um, multicolour fluorite graduated plain ovals. 36 carats of multicolour fluorite. They are beautiful, aren't they? Absolutely gorgeous. £12.95 for your gorgeous multicolour fluorite. The most beautiful. Beautiful fluorite. I don't you love all the natural striations I, in fluorite? I absolutely love fluorite. I think it's just a, a beautiful gemstone. Look at this one here with a line going straight, you know, like diagonal lines. Yeah. So gorgeous. And I like the way that they've been cut so the striations aren't necessarily going uh, straight or, no. or, you know, it, it's just it's just they've just been cut, the gemstones. Yeah. And, and whichever way the inclusions are going, they're just going that way. They look a little bit like Easter eggs, some of these. Oh! Oh, I think that's a little bit early. It is a little bit early. Just a little bit Just early. Just a tad. <laughs> Just a tad. Although I'm sure... 26th of December, we can start talking yes. about Easter. Oh, I'm sure Michael said they're, they're selling Easter eggs in your local shop, aren't they? Easter eggs? Are they? Yeah. Did they get, did they get the wrong memo that Christmas is first? But e Easter eggs will be in shops in about six weeks' time, won't they? Like, like, oh, my like cable, throughout sorry. Throughout the whole of the country. Okay, here we go. Internationally and nationally. Oh, this is a really lovely strand of Chrysocola. Oh, this is nice. This is a really good strand. Oh, I love the vibrancy wow. of this one. The, it's a little bit lighter yeah. than, mm. than um, some of the Chrysocolas that we've done. But you're quite right. The vibrancy of those turquoise tones mm. is absolutely amazing. I'm used to seeing prices on Chrysocola of, what, £40 maybe? Forty nine ninety five, fantastic, well done, brilliant. Why do I get the feeling that uh, this is not the price and Lee Ham is on one? Oh my words! Come on, Lee Ham! Come on, Lee Ham! All the way down. <laughs> Dear me, £19.95. These are big Chrysocolas. That's mm. an amazing price. Chrysocola all the way from Peru. Fantastic. They are whopper cheekers, aren't they? Yeah. Can you imagine yeah. a stretchy bracelet made out of these? They'd, that'd be beautiful. That'd be really nice. But I could also see one of those on a leather wrap bracelet as well. Oh, nice. Oh, yes. Oh, that's a lovely idea. Well done, Collector in Gloucestershire. Well done to Beverly in Hertfordshire. Fantastic. Well done. We've got less than 20 chances remaining in the building now. Well done. What's Do check your those, baskets out. What's that amazing tea bar? That's all Charite. Is it? Mm. Is that Charite? You've got all, loads <gasps> of Charite. And Charite ranging in price from about 40 quid down to about 15 pounds. Because that would go beautifully with this. Because uh, uh, uh. the interest in those, those stones. Oh, yeah. Ooh, let's gra grab that one there. And look at those colours together. Do you know what, Flair? You're absolutely that is right. That's beautiful oh. together. That's amazing. That is gorgeous, isn't it? I love that. Absolutely beautiful. So yeah, the Charite's all coming up in the 10 o'clock hour this morning. We've got loads and loads and loads of it. Um, yeah. Brand new loaf for the rondelles today, coming up in the 10 o'clock hour. So if you get this, you may as well get the beautiful uh, Charite. Coming up in the next hour, oh my word, we've got loads. We've got um, loads of tools coming up in the 10 o'clock hour. Um, are, the tools coming up, are the tools coming up in the next hour or are they coming up in the 10 o'clock hour, Leeham? 
Next, next hour. So we've got the butane torch, we've got the saw, we've got the saw blades, we've got the full forming DVD, we've got your amazing kits as well. Yep. You've made some beautiful pieces. Yeah, I've really enjoyed working with these. Oh, well, I love metal, but... She's very yeah. clever. Have a look at these bad boys. Check your baskets out. A lot of items have already sold out, out in the eight o'clock hour. Don't forget all items played in the eight o'clock hour are available for an hour after they've been played or until they sell out, particularly those gorgeous yellow diamonds that were 65 pounds. So um, do make sure you check all your baskets out. We've got loads coming up in the next hour, um, including the full forming DVD. Yes, of course, the DVD. It's gonna be amazing. I filmed that one with you, didn't I? You did. There you we did. go. We're going to see a little, something a little bit different today, and I love it when we do different, uh, thank you, Michael, different mediums here on Jewelry Maker. It's really nice to do something um, which is, I think, it, I mean, it's alchemy. It's absolutely amazing stuff. And your DVD's coming up uh, in the next hour. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, see you next hour, Neary. There he is. We love him. Yay! See you in a second. <laughs> what was that? Buying with Jewelry Maker online couldn't be easier. Just head over to our website, jewelrymaker.com, and click on the register link. Simply fill in the required fields and you can shop 24 7. You'll also be privy to a faster checkout and personalised offers. Jewelry Maker, your one stop shop for all your jewelry making needs. Jewelry Maker course gift vouchers are now available. You can choose from a bronze, silver or gold voucher. Each voucher is worth a different amount that entitles you to book towards a course of your choice. For more information, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always making improvements to give you a better shopping experience. We've recently upgraded our website to make it more user-friendly and easy to navigate around. We now have the Guest Checkout function, which allows customers to check out quickly without creating an account. Our homepage now informs you with what's currently live on the show, recently aired items and today's deal of the day. We've improved our website navigation and added new categories to help customers quickly find the products they want. Our online range is growing fast with over 7,000 products available for you to purchase. And don't miss out on hundreds of brand new clearance lines with more added every week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Create, wear, share. The Jewelry Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewellery designer. Each week one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their account and the runner-up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewellerymaker.com or you can post your photos to Jewellery Maker Studio, Ivy House, Henley Road, Studley, B80, 7DU and make sure you don't forget your customer number. Get making and good luck. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. If you'd like more information on up and coming shows, you can view the programme guide on our website. If you have a question or a query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. Hello everyone, hope you can join myself and presenter Eleanor this Tuesday for the morning show, the 5th of November, for the second part of my Symbols Findings launch. This amazing range of findings has really caught everyone's imagination. And this Tuesday is all about the super duos. So we've got four different colors, we have got six different findings, and would you believe it, 16 brand new super duo colors. So that's this Tuesday, the 5th of November, myself and Eleanor for the morning show from 8 a.m. We'll see you then.
Hello. We are back. Fleur. Uh-huh. I, your, um, in your messages yesterday, you said you have been in your happy place. Yes, I have. Yes, in my happy place with metal. Yeah. You love this, don't you? I really do, because it's just amazing what you can, what you can make from one small... Sorry. <laughs> can we keep the noise down, please? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> We're live, Michael. This is live. <laughs> Tom, no, don't. Leave him alone, mate. This is a live show. Reunited and it feels so good. Reunited. Ah. There we go. So, uh, yeah, reunited. All right. Can we get on with the show now? Because Fleur was in the middle of telling us all about lovely fold forming. Right. Off you go. Thank you. <laughs> Carry on. No, just, just that copper, well, any metal, um, any metal work for me is just really really interesting mm. because it's amazing what you can actually make with metal you can take one flat sheet of metal and make it into something very three-dimensional very um interesting lots of like like that you know just with a, a little twist and a turn around it's a beautiful. mandrel and you could create something like that. and then because it's copper as well it's just got it's such a beautiful beautiful metal to work with when I filmed this dvd with you Flair, I was genuinely astonished at what can be achieved using using tools and and using your um, sheet metal? I was absolutely, I was absolutely amazed. The DVD. We're going to bring you the DVD now. Looking at these pieces, for me, I think we're we're, we're playing these items at just the right time because for me. All of those pieces there are Christmas presents. Yeah, they're yeah. Christmas presents. They're gifts. Yes. Yeah. Um, on the DVD, one of my favourite designs is this beautiful kind of curled leaf that you make, we're which going is to a do beautiful. One of those later. Oh, really? Yeah, we're going to do one Oh, of those fantastic. Later. It's a beautiful yeah. sculptural piece just on its own. The bangle's absolutely gorgeous. And can I just say, all of these pieces are achievable. To look at, they look like pieces which should be in a gallery. I know they look like pieces which should be, uh, which which are in an artist gallery that are probably unachievable to anyone who hasn't worked with metal sheet before. But because of course Fleur is such a fantastic teacher and because of the DVD and the way that she breaks all of the, all of the tutorials down, it is, it is amazing how simple these pieces are and the scope and how far your metal sheet goes and um, and how different and how personal each one of these is. It's a fantastic medium to get into, isn't it? Really it really is, yeah. And you don't need to be um, like mega strong no, or, no, or no. anything like that to be able to do this. So this is the one that we're going to do the demo on oh, um, in the 12 o'clock hour. So you can see it's like a piece of metal. It's amazing how with hammering and heating with Copper is such a forgiving metal mm, mm. to work with. And I have got a few nerdy copper facts, if anybody's Perfect. interested. Perfect. Yes, please, bring them on. <laughs> the DVD... Now, now, this is one of the mediums that I would say, when you do get these kits home, before you use these kits, please yeah. watch the DVD. Yeah. Be please, please, please watch the DVD. Especially yeah, from a safety point of view, it's really important, it. We went through it? about 10 minutes worth of safety. Yeah. Um, yeah. And not only safety, but how to anneal your metal as well. So we're not going to do annealing today, because I did it um, at the beginning of October. Yeah. We showed how to anneal metal. So it's it's got kind of, um, like you say, those like, do's and don'ts before you start, and mm. then it's just fun uh, yeah. of and, how and, you can... And it, gen and it genuinely is, but I would definitely say to you, anyone who's going to be trying this for the first time, get the DVD and watch it. It's a really entertaining DVD, and it's the kind of DVD that you come away thinking, do you know what, I reckon I could actually have a go at that. I reckon I could, I could potentially do that. Not to mention which, Fleur is very, very active on Facebook. So if you, if you do go to her guest designer page and ask her any questions that you've got about any projects or, or, or what you want to do then um, um, uh, with the uh, full forming, then she'll be able to answer those questions for you. So it's just 4 95 for the DVD. I've got loads of people coming through to get it. Well done, which, is, which bodes very, very well, of course, for the kids. Do you, know, um, do you know the other thing that this is this is really good for? Mm. If you've got a partner that doesn't like you watching jewellery maker, <laughs> but they may be a little bit crafty or doing like carpentry, yeah. anything like that, get them this DVD. Yeah. Because it's it's not 
you, you can make delicate jewellery with it, mm -hmm. but you can make, I mean, I've made this piece with, I love that. Yeah. with one of the um, sheets of metal. This, this is what we like... did on the 6th of October. So if you want to learn how to do this, we did this on the 6th. Oh. Um, it's on YouTube. Yes, yeah, so And then and we showed it. you how to colour it and everything else. So mm. you, but you can see how one sheet of metal can turn into something like this, or it can turn oh, into a piece of jewellery or, it. you know, anything. And it, because it's metal, we can use other mediums like our F colour, our yeah. stamping. Of course. You know, there's lots of other ways that we can sort of like work together with uh, with other pieces yeah definitely it really is a fantastic medium and you can make your pieces as 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 Fleur quite rightly says make look very very sophisticated or you know bigger yeah. and kind of more um, and more structural really really fantastic DVD well done I've got quite a few of those in baskets do check out when you can so kit um <laughs> This is a really, really lovely, lovely kit. You've got your wire, you've got your sheet metal, and you've also got some beautiful little pearls as well, these lovely kind of lavender, silvery pearls. Let's have a look at the wire. So you've got 10 meters of 0.4 and 10 meters of one millimeter gauge copper wire. So you've got your structural and you've got your finer, um, your finer gauge um, uh, weaving wire, rosary linking wire, whatever you want to use it for. Two really useful gauges to have, aren't they? Yeah, they are. I mean, I've used the one mil wire. I haven't used the the, the point four, so that's like a little bit of a Brucey bonus as well. Yeah. Um, but I've not used very much of it. So if you're a, if you're a um, a wire worker and you want to add a little bit of metal in, mm. then obviously it's perfect for that as well. Brilliant. You've got your genuine freshwater culture pearls. Lovely colours on these. They're like a. I can't decide what colour they are. Are they kind of purpley blue? Yeah. They're described as silver grey. Mm. I think they're more bluey, yeah. purpley than that, yeah. don't you? They've got like, yeah. They're nice. They're very, very luminous, aren't they? They're really, really nice. Um, I do like the colour that you're getting on these pearls. They're very, very nice indeed. And it goes beautifully with the copper. Look at those two together. That is a really, really mm. lovely contrast, isn't really it? Really beautiful combination, yeah. Very now, beautiful. give us an idea. You've got your, you've got your copper sheet. Mm -hmm. The the sheet that you're going to be getting here. Give us an idea. How much would we be able to make using this sheet? So I've used. Um, not this one, but I've made all of those pieces and obviously had lots of little bits left over Goodness where I've cut me. out the circles, things like that. So the one on the end, um, I, would, I nearly put that as like a, a bowl. So I've got one of these mm. at home that I've made a mm. bigger piece and I've made it into a bowl. Oh, like, wow. So you get like a little bonbon dish or something like yeah. that. But that's, um, that's a really cool fold form technique, which we'll do next time because we want to do another DVD of like different techniques with the air chasing and those um, four point stars. Um, but you can get so much out of it. I mean, yeah. you just have to map it out a little bit. You know, you can sort of like use it. But because it's copper, you can use it as well. Um, you can sort of like really... Um, if you've got any any scrap pieces, then you can use those and uh, trade them in as well. Perfect. Because obviously it's a Perfect. you know it's a metal that people can buy scrap. Yes, yes, absolutely. Um, you're getting you're getting a lot of it now. <laughs> When we looked at the price of this kit this morning, we want to make this as, 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 as um, achievable a price point as possible. This kit was going to be over £30 today. We've taken it down to £27.95. Wow. So under 30 is, quid, that's amazing. Because you've got the wire as well. So if you're, um, if you're a wire worker, you know, you, and you've never used metal, uh -huh. this is the perfect kit because you've got, you know, that, that piece of metal there that you can start to have of a course. little go with. We've got the tools coming up, you know, to help you cut that metal, um, whether it be with the saws or with the, with the snips coming up. So, yeah, you have got, like I say, the copper sheet itself, you know, if you, you, you know, scrap metal, you can scrap copper, you mm. know, because it is a, a natural metal. Of course you can, yeah. Do you want my first fact of copper? Yes, please. Okay, so, copper was the first metal to ever be found in the earth. 2000 BC. No. no 8000 BC. So 8000 BC? Yeah, so it's been used for 10,000 years, with 95% of it being used in the last 10 to 15 oh. years. So if you think of all the churches that have got copper roofs, oh. you know, everything else, if we were to use copper, like we have done for the last 10,000 years, do you know how long copper will last? No. Have a quick guess. Oh, I don't know, another 600 years? Go on. 
five million years. There's no! that much copper in the earth. Some of it is um, it's not achievable to get out of the ground because it's too deep. So mining and everything, we can't get it out. But there's enough copper to use the same amount we've used for the last 10,000 years for another five million years. Wow! Is it different? Is... I mean, copper is one of the most amazing things because we had a copper age before we had a bronze age because... Mm. Bronze is copper and tin alloyed. Mm, mm. You know, and brass is copper and zinc alloyed. So we use it in so many things. Use it in silver. So many things. It's, it's an amazing metal. It's, it's so forgiving to work with as well. Oh, how wonderful. $27.95. Fantastic. Well done, everyone coming through together. By the way, if you get the kit, you've got to get the DVD. Um, now, I've got two copper sheets. I've got two copper sheets. So that was 0.8, the uh, the copper sheet you're getting there, which is a really lovely, quite a thick uh, copper sheet, which has its incredible. And don't forget, not just with fold forming, but cutting these out, punching yeah. these out into shapes, yeah. into the copper um, uh, um, uh, pieces that you've made before, yeah, like Santa pictures. Slay and yeah, things yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, the Santa Slay one, yeah. yeah. The, what I'm gonna bring you now very quickly is a pack of um, copper findings. So you've got a 21-piece findings pack here. So this is a rose gold-plated base metal. Um, so you've got earrings, you've got your toggle clasps, you've got your chain, jump rings, and you've got your uh, crimp beads and crimp bead covers as well. Then you're going to be getting this. Now, you're getting two of these mm -hmm. copper sheets. Now, these two copper sheets you're going to be getting here are 0.4 millimetres thick. This is some of the thinnest copper sheet that we do, isn't it? Do we yeah, do, we do a, thinner? Yeah, we do a... 0.32, mm. which is almost like um, you could do like origami folding with that. It's so malleable. Oh, wow. This is very, very malleable. We still anneal it if we want it, like with the fold form. Of course, like yeah. Um, but yeah, it's very, very malleable. You can cut this with um, your shears, no problem. You don't need the saw at all. You don't all. need the saw, yeah, um, perfect. But obviously the saw is more of an accurate cut. Of course, yeah. Um, very, very, uh, I mean, you can really feel the difference between this and the other, and the other um, uh, copper sheets. The price on this is absolutely brilliant. It really, really genuinely is. 19 wow, is pounds, good. 95 yeah, pence. I would be, I would probably be getting this kit and the other kit. The other kit for the pearls and the wire. And mm -hmm. if you're having a go at fold, forwarding, fold forming for the first time, I'd get this kit because, of course, this is going to be much, much, much easier to use, yeah. this um, copper sheet, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's a lot easier for fold forming. Point eight is a very difficult metal to fold form. Mm. Um, because it's a lot thicker. Mm, of so when we when we have to move the metal, and we'll talk about it a little bit more in the twelve o'clock hour, how we spread the metal out to make it yeah. thinner and obviously to make it bend. And um, the point eight can be a little bit more difficult. It's not unachievable, mm -hmm. but it is you know a little bit more difficult. This is perfect. This is absolutely perfect. Like, and you get so much stuff, of it as well. It? You know, if you were to think of like cutting yeah. out just like even just like little circles. So if I just put that circle mm. next to there, look how many of these flowers we can get. You know, we haven't used yeah, look hardly that. any. Yeah. You know, so you could, if you wanted to make all those flowers like yeah. we're going to do in a minute, you can Huge cut out lots amounts. and lots of flowers. Yeah, fantastic. Well done. Lots and lots of people coming through to get that. So I've got one more. Um, oh, wow. So I've got one more sheet to bring you and then we'll get into the demo. This is a 0.5 yeah. millimetre sheet. Yeah. This is a really, really, really big sheet of, um, of copper sheet. I've only got 25 of this available. Now, 0.5, what am I going to do with this flare? So 0.5 is perfect for using with your shears and your saw. So oh, you could, wow. So some of the pictures that I've done in the past, you know, when I did Marilyn Monroe and oh, Elvis yes. and all those, yeah. um, that's on a 0.5. It's very, very nice to cut out. You can use one of your fine blades to cut out with mm. it. It will still work with your disc cutters. You can still um, mm -hmm. fold form with it. You're going to create really beautiful fold forms. Um, you get so much of it as well. Mm. You get a lot more of this. So if you wanted to do bangles, this is the one that you'd use for the bangle. Brilliant. Because the bangle typically is six, uh, six inches long. Yes. So I've got a bangle on at the minute. You can see that it doesn't do up. Um, it's an open bangle. Yeah, of course, yeah. So with an open bangle, they tend to be six inches long, so you can get so many six inch bangles out of this. Is this is this kind of coated or is it or is it bare? No, this is it's it's like copper coated copper yeah but as soon as you anneal it you will take off that very shiny mm. but you can get that straight back you can shine it back up as yeah. well okay. yeah okay okay um so we're under 20 pounds for that you're going to get a huge amount out of that i've got 24 available gosh there's loads of people with this in baskets collector susan debbie nicolette candy karen uh kerry anonymous bidders well done would you get 
three bangles out of that, maybe? Oh, no, because this is nine inches long, so they'd be coming across this side. Oh, so you'd probably wow. get. Well, usually, one of the bangles that I make is typically about an inch and a half wide. Mm. So five. One, two, three, six, four, five. Yeah. Six. Six bangles. Goodness me, that's so amazing. If you wanted to do the one that's on the front, then probably you get like four, because that's obviously got the fold in the middle, so it's a little it bit thicker. Um, but you definitely get three, three, four bangles out of that. And yeah. you think one of those bangles is worth more than £20? Of course it is. Goodness gracious me. Um, it's wonderful. Uh, so, Candy's missing. Good morning. Uh, could I use the 0.4 copper sheet for soldering bezels? Yes, you can solder Ooh, your bezel wire nice on today. Yeah, with them, with the back. When you're making um, a cabochon setting, mm. so the back plate doesn't need to be very thick at all. Okay. So you can solder onto that. Now, you, if you want to copper solder you can get copper solder but a lot of people use silver solder and then just clean it up um but yeah you know definitely you can use the point four for your for the mm. backings of your cabochons mm. okay perfect thank you right demo uh flair what do you want to do for so us i'm going to show you how to make these little these little um flowers because i think they're quite cute and they're they don't take a lot of um making if that makes sense they, they, they're quite easy to make so it's Brilliant. quite a good um, introduction to metal working so the first thing we're going to need is we're going to need some circles so we can either cut these out by hand with your shears or you can cut them out with the saw just use a little template and um, just draw a circle cut around it um, if you've got a disc cutter you can use the disc cutter so that's mm -hmm. literally where you just put the metal in and you just hammer down on top of the disc cutter and it will cut out these little discs for Perfect. you so depending on how big you want the flowers to be depends on how big you you'd make the discs now these discs have been annealed so they're a little bit more bendy so you can see with this one i can actually shape it this is how amazing copper is just by putting a little bit of heat onto it I can actually shape it so if i was to put a little drill hole through the middle and have that as like a um uh, a bead cap or something like that you know in between some of your rondelles mm. this would be perfect for that so when you anneal it you take it to that dull red and you're going to just let that those crystals relax so all um, copper is made of crystal structure so the crystals are very very tightly packed when it's um, work hardened mm -hmm. by heating it you're just relaxing them so if you think of it like a block of cheese when you heat a little a hard block of cheese it starts to become more malleable mm. okay so once we've got one of our little discs what we're going to do is we're going to take our round nose pliers okay and using just our round nose pliers just on this top quarter so if we just look at the the top section there we're going to pop our round nose pliers in and we're going to just bend one side and then we're going to take our uh, round nose pliers to the other side lovely and we're just bending you can see how malleable this is and if it's all right with you carol just so that everybody doesn't think that i'm just some sort of like she-ra yeah could you have a little go as well oh gosh really um, just to bend it just to show okay. that yeah, it's, sure, um, it's not something that you have to be incredibly <clears throat> strong to do so you're just going to pop the pliers just in the top corner, just to show you that, you know, yeah. you don't need a lot of strength to be able to do it and just roll it towards you. Oh you see gosh, how easy? That's really easy. It's almost like working with hard cardboard, isn't that's it? It's, it's not It's not that difficult to no. move. So what you're going to do is you just bring both ends in so you create mm. like a little, um, like a snowdrop actually, isn't oh. it? Yeah. So you don't need to do anything else than that, okay? So once we've got it into this little shape, what we need to do is we just need to tighten this top area up here. Mm -hmm. So all we're gonna do is we're just gonna pull it from either side till it meets, okay? Now you can get those to cross over if you want, or you can leave them slightly mm -hmm. open. But I, the, also, the other thing I thought about is um, little angels. Oh yes, definitely. So you know, if you yes. wanted to make little Christmas decorations, if you just put some of the little angel wings that we do, or mm. cut some angel wings out, with your, uh, you know, with your sheet, yes. and then etch it with the Dremel, oh, just into little rings, oh, that's a lovely and then idea. just pop in, you know, just some pearls at the bottom for her legs, oh. and then you know she's got her little wings and make some yes. arms and then her head. So what we're going to do now is we're going to use something that we call a buff stick. Okay. Oh. So <laughs> what it Why is not? basically is a paint stirrer. Okay. Do you know? So if you've got a little bit of wood at home, like a paint stirrer, if you haven't got anything like this. Uh, a ruler will work as well, okay? So all I've done is I've taken some 600 grit sandpaper, wet and dry sandpaper, yeah. and I've wrapped it around this stick, 
and then I've just put some masking tape at the, at, at the top and the bottom yep. just to hold it in place. Now this works like a file now. So we don't want to file these edges because yeah. we've got nice clean edges. But what we want to do is we just want to take the um, the sort of like the uh, sharpness off of them if yeah. there's any sharp bits. So what we're going to do, oh. ooh, we can chuck it away or you can pick <laughs> it back up. And all you're going to do is just go all the way over it. Now, if you want to get that lovely shine back, to this, we need to take this to a, a level where we've got no scratches in it. So okay. this again, we'll take that to that nice shiny, um, shiny uh, copper look. But it also will give it like a, a brushed finish. So I don't know if you remember, we used to do some copper sheets that had a brushed finish to them. Uh, so you can oh see yes. Now, yes, yes, yes. Pick the other one up that you did, Carol. Can you see how you've got one that's shiny yeah. and one that's got like a matte finish, yeah. but it's like a, a satin sheen to I it. I like that. So you're just going to go all the way over it. Because they're earrings, we don't want them to sort of like be any sharp edges or if it's going to be a pendant. Okay, so we're going to go all the way around. And if you have got a Dremel or something similar, you can now take one of your polishing wheels and you can polish all this copper back up to it being nice and shiny. Or you can use your liver of sulphur. And have we got liver of sulphur, Liam? We do, lovely. So we've late. got some liver of sulphur coming up. So when you're working with liver of sulphur, when we've got things like pearls or any gemstones, um, never put your gemstones in the liver of sulphur. So do everything to your piece first mm. before you add your mm -hmm. gemstones. Okay. So um, the copper wire that we've got in the, um, in the kit is mm. not bare copper wire. That's copper coated yep. copper wire. So that won't actually... Um, liver of sulfur yeah. but this definitely will because mm -hmm. it's, it's that raw material so with your liver of sulfur you wanted to get some nice colors on there we did um a little bit of a on the on the 6th of october again we talked about how you can use black coffee with oh, your liver yes. of sulfur to get the reds and then mm. if you put a little bit of washing up liquid on there you get blues or <gasps> salt if you just drop salt onto here like just um not table salt like rock salt yeah, uh, or uh, sea salt yeah that mm. kind of thing pop that onto mm. there let it settle and then just paint on your liver of sulfur solution where the salt's been, you'll get greens <gasps> because it's obviously like a, if you think about oh. boats and things like that, I've got yeah. copper in them. When it comes out of the, the sea, it goes green. That's amazing. You will. I've had a bottle for um, about three years, and I bet it's only just down to here. <gasps> it will really? last you a long, long time. And because it's the gel, because usually I used to buy liver of sulfur in flakes, mm. and they can they're really smelly. Yeah. And it goes off. This is in a sealed container. It's like sulfurous, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's very sulfur. Um, mm. Very, very sulfurish. <laughs> do it with the, the doors and the windows open. Right. Because it's, yeah, and don't do it at the beginning of the day because the whole house will smell. Ooh. Do it at the end, probably outside. But yeah, just all you need to do is just pop it in there. It doesn't take long at all once it's in the, the solution. A couple of minutes of dipping it in and out and in and out, and you'll get the, um, oh, the colour. Oh, fantastic. Six ninety five. There's only forty of these available. Um, wow, have, is that have, all it is? Get this, and um, it will last you an absolute age. Apply patina finish to silver, copper, and some bronze, brass, metal, uh, metal leaf, and metal clay alloys. It's absolutely amazing. You use such a tiny amount of it. Um, and presumably, if you mix this with, you know, and you do your heat patinering as well, will you get something different again or you, not? You can do, yeah, you can. If you've got... So metal is so amazing. So if you if you use pickle at home, so like mm. a citric acid to take the fire scale yeah, off, yeah, yeah. and then you don't wash that off and then put the liver of sulphur in, it goes purple. Oh, my because gosh, it all, that sounds amazing. it all amazing. has reactions. Um, there's lots of things online about how to use this. So if you've got things like... Uh, if you use ammonia at home, you mm. have cleaning products... Mm. This works amazing with cleaning with with the cleaning products as well. So anything acts as like a resist, and because it's sulfur, it will react with other chemicals to create. Some of them you have to do them outside because you should be in a very well ventilated area, mm. especially if you're using things like ammonia and obviously yes, I can cover imagine. your hands that kind of thing. Because this will stain your hands a little bit as well. Mm. So just a pair of rubber gloves and then just take that. Take it on and not, you know, take it in and then let it settle. Some people say you have to pop it into bicarbonate of soda to mm -hmm. stop the reaction. Mm -hmm. I don't tend to do that. Mm -hmm. But what will happen is over time, copper naturally reacts with the air all the time. Of course it does, yeah. So whatever colour you're going to get with your liver of sulphur or your heat patina will slowly get darker mm -hmm. over time because mm -hmm. oxygen is still attacking the surface of the copper. Mm -hmm. But you can put things like Renaissance wax. Of uh, course, to seal it. clear, things yeah. like that on there. Mm. I mean, I've even sprayed things with hairspray before. Just, just to, to seal just it. Just to seal it. Yeah. But yeah. no, it's, um, it's amazing. If you get a result that you don't like, 
pop it in some lemon juice and water. And that's a great Take thing, because that's yeah. what I was going to say. If you if it goes too dark or the, or, or, or it's a colour that you don't like yeah. or, or it's too much, you can always scale yeah. it back yeah. um, and start again. Yeah, start again. But it's, it, it is alchemy. It is it is yeah. what, what we're doing here is a chemical reaction, obviously, mm -hmm. with that beautiful metal. If you file your copper pieces down, let's say you're making a bangle. Yeah. If you file it down using your um, your buffing stick or whatever yeah. you called it, have you then essentially got bare copper? Yes, completely. So people who wear the bare copper bangles for medicinal purposes, for rheumatic um, arthritis, to alleviate certain um, 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 symptoms of that, if you wanted to make a load of those bangles, because people do swear by them, yeah, they do. Then, yeah. then yeah. by all means, you know, use yeah. use this copper sheet in that way. You know, maybe make a lovely bare copper ring to wear close to somebody's joints if yeah. if if they suffer with arthritis of the hands. Um, a lot of people swear by it, that's what yep. I'm saying, but you, are, you essentially can make your bare copper if you file it back. Yep. Um, and it's a lovely finish, but yeah, this, this stuff is absolutely... <laughs> <laughs> Don't take the lid off. Oh, oh my no. gosh. Is it really bad? Does it really smell? Really bad. Like, it's just like, like it's rotten, rotten eggs. eggs. It's just, that's all it is, is rotten eggs. If you've yeah. ever been to like a, a natural water spring to um, oh, yes, wash your car... Sulfur. Oh, it stinks, doesn't it? Or ge ge water. Um, geezers in, <laughs> yes. uh, in, uh, in America as well. Yeah. Oh, they absolutely stink. Not, it's not nice, but it's, um, it does mm. create the most beautiful look to, to your pieces. <laughs> yeah. Do it outside or in a well-ventilated room. So Not just before you have friends over for dinner or something like that. No, 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 no. no. Unless you don't want them to stay. <laughs> yeah. oh, God, God. If you've got anybody that you don't want to stay. Leave the car running. Yeah, yeah just get the livery of sulfur out and say, sorry, I was cooking. <laughs> I was cooking. <laughs> Do you want to stay? Great <laughs> They'll stuff. They'll soon be gone. <laughs> Fantastic. Well done. So that's gone very, very well. Absolutely awesome. Well okay. done. Right, okay. So what we're going to do now is we're going to make these little head pins. So I've just used some head pins, mm. but you could use, if you wanted to, you could use your, um, oh, sorry. Other way. There we go. <laughs> to the way. <laughs> um, you could use your 0.4 wire and you could make little head pins if you wanted to. So Lovely. with your 0.4, if you've got bare copper wire, you can just um, put that into the heat of the butane torch and it will make these little ball head pins. But because a lot of people are a bit frightened of the heat, um, if, you, if you haven't got that ability, you know, the, the tool to be able to do that, yeah. just use your head pins. And what we're going to do is we need to make three different sized ones. Mm -hmm. But they have to sit. So the first one, the first one has to be the same height as the inside of the, the top bit. Okay, yeah. so don't have them too small because they're not going to be able to be seen and they're going to move. Of course. So yeah. I'm going to make this one slightly longer. So all I'm going to do to make the, the longer one is take my head pin, mm -hmm. take a 45 degree bend into it. So I've got a nice bend there. Trim off to about a centimeter away. And we don't need big loops for these pieces. And then all we're going to do is using our round nose pliers, Lovely. we're just going to make a simple open loop okay so we do that mm -hmm. three times until we've got three different lengths yeah okay so i've uh, just bent that one a little bit let's just bring that Don't a bit worry. straighter there we go so now what we're going to do is we're going to take a section of our one mil wire Lovely. okay and we're going to do exactly the same to the end of the one mil wire so we're going to put our little 45 degree bend just trim it so that you've got a nice flat edge and then bring that round Lovely. Okay, mm -hmm. now you can either pop these on at this point now before you close that circle up. Okay. So what we're going to do is just add them on onto there and then just finish that circle just to close them around. Awesome. And just, there we go. Lovely. And then what we're going to do is take the end of the wire through the little piece. Isn't and that gorgeous? I'll just turn that around so they're all facing Stunning. there. So you then... You can see now how oh, they so just sit sweet. in there and they've got a little bit of movement in there as well. So the tighter you do the wrap at the top, mm. the more static these will become. Yeah. So this one is a little bit too long. So what I could do now is because it's only open loops, I can take that one off, make it a little bit shorter. But because it's uh, a demo, we're just going to carry on with yeah, it. Yeah, OK. So all I'm going to do now is take my round nose pliers again and I'm going to make a simple wrapped loop at the top. And like I said, all we're going to do is we're going to just wrap this down to the end of the copper. So we don't want to tighten it too much. So it's just a normal rat loop. Now you can see when you get to this point, just make sure that these are still moving, that they're not, it's not too tight there. Because we're going to put a little spiral over here anyway. So we can see now these are still moving. Yeah. 
Okay, so then all I'm going to do is Gorgeous. take my end of wire, and I did cut quite a lot of wire here. Do you know what the shape reminds me of ever so, ever so slightly? And it, it, is um, I think you'd have to change it ever so slightly, but it reminds me of mistletoe leaves yes. with mistletoe berries. Yes, I reckon you could in be. incorporate these maybe into your seasonal wreath or just have some hanging above yes. your door maybe. Oh, they'd be beautiful on a wreath because if they're outside as well, mm. in the in, in sort of like the atmosphere, yeah. the copper's going to oh, go absolutely yeah, beautifully coloured. it will, won't it? It'll go absolutely gorgeous. So I thought about that. Do you know the twisty, t the, the twirly whirly one, the one that looks like yeah. um, a piece of chocolate? A piece of chocolate, yes. Um, that one, you could do that and hang them from your trees as well. Oh. Wouldn't they be beautiful? Because You know when you curl chocolate, them. Liam, I think that's what we're... Yes, he's getting confused. Yes. Okay, so oh, that's beautiful. Oh, you can see now. I've wow. just done a little little spiral at the top, and you take a little bit more time than I have just to make that spiral nice and neat. But that's going to cover then the top of that little so element simple. there, and then all you do is pop on your shepherd hook. Yeah. And you've either got or, or a jump ring. If you wanted it to be a pendant, and you wanted to use it as part of like a, a rosary link, all you mm. do is move this um, this circle, the loop, vertically. Yeah. That's all yeah. you would do. Yeah. But there you go. You've got. Very, very quick, very simple oh, little pair stunning. of earrings that if you've got a, like you say, a Christmas fair coming up, yeah. you probably wouldn't see anything like this. Not that you've made from start to finish by yourself and you used a tiny little bit of your copper. Yeah. And it's all achievable stuff. It's yeah. so effective, though, what you're making. Uh, but even the most, you know, as an entry level piece of, of, of metal sheet work, it yeah. really, and it really is entry level. You've seen how easy it is and how quick it can be as well. Um, fantastic. Well done. Can I show you what's coming up in about um, half an hour's time? Oh. This is amazing. We've had a lot of people um, texting in with guesses for this strand. $49.95, $34.95. You are nowhere near. $29.95, someone's texting as well. That's a little it's bit not, cheeky. Not that close to Christmas yet. A exactly. Not Monday. Gift yet. <laughs> well, come on, we're not miracle workers. <laughs> but get your guesses in. This is, I'm not repeating that, mate. No way. Get your guesses in. It's the bad boy of JM in it. There's so many things which are grammatically wrong with that sentence that you just came out with then. It's the bad boy. So you're referring to yourself in the third person. It's the bad boy of JM. That's false, by the way. In it. Anyway, get your guesses in. How much do you reckon this strand of five mil round? <laughs> oh, dear. The closest person to the price will win the strand. Really? Come on, so, and, can we do that, Liam? And okay. let's, let's chuck a, 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 should we put a, 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 a necklace or earrings? Twirly whirly necklace, earrings. Seriously? Yeah, go on, it's nearly Christmas. Oh Which my one? gosh. You choose, necklace um, or earrings? Earrings. Earrings. The closest person are you going to get? If it guesses the price on this strand, the first person to send in a text with the closest price to what this strand is going to be is going to win that pair of earrings and the strand. Oh my gosh. Send your customer number in with it. We won't show the customer number on air, don't worry. We will, we will. Uh, so the first person to text in with the price point that's going to be and um, uh, their customer. Say again. Dawn just said 37.65. No. 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 Shall we do a star by? Let's do the. Please say that word again. <laughs> it's a star by. It's a buntane torture, apparently. For everyone else. So for everyone else out there on planet Earth, it's butane. Buntane. Emma Buntane. <laughs> From the Spice Girls. It's her torch. Fiery Spice. <laughs> Emma Buntane. Uh, this is a butane. Have we had a torch in before? We've had a torch in before, yes, we have. haven't we? Yeah, we've had two in before. That was like out of stock. 
for about 17,000 years. Yeah. Yeah. This came in last month. Yeah. I've got 66 available. Yeah. It should have a little stand with it as well. Yes, I, I was got just about to say stand. that, actually. Um, so the Here it is. You got it. There, yeah. oh, it's a little black stand. There we go. So, yeah, so you've got the Point stand fixed. on there as well. So it's nice and safe. Yeah, it's, it's a perfect perfect little torch to, to use for all of your copper work or mm. even your sterling silver work. This is hot enough to solder your, your sterling silver as Absolutely. well. Absolutely. It is a torch which, of course, you use with your, you know, you can use with your fold forming, mm -hmm. but it has so many different uses. Um, if you wanted to use it with your um, metal clay, you absolutely yeah. could do. If you wanted to use it, obviously, with your um, fold forming, with all sorts sorts of um, uh, metal work than you absolutely can do. If you want to with heat the your work. Brulee. With your creme brulee, with yes. Your creme brulee. If you want to get the top of your creme brulee and give it a good, uh, good old going or over. Or your marshmallows. Oh my word. Toast or your, your um, marshmallows. Or your cauliflower cheese. Get a bit of, get a bit oh. of a, get a bit of a, get a bit of a brown on your. See, um, I, I don't like cauliflower. Broccoli cheese. Oh, yes. Broccoli and leek mm, cheese, broccoli. maybe. Oh, leek. Broccoli and leek. Why not? Oh, I'm trying that. Shove a bit of leak in there. Trying that. $34.95. Now, for obvious reasons, we can't send you the butane no. uh, because it is flammable. We can't send flammable things in the post. For obvious reasons, we're, we're bound by kind of, we're bound by the law. But if you go to your local, um, if you go to your local um, uh, news agents, if you go to your local supermarket, they will have canisters of butane. Yeah, and of course, you fill it up um, just from bottom there. Well, um, I would so say with the butane as well, if you can afford it, go for the more expensive branded one. Oh, okay. You know, the one with the nice swan on the front. Yes, why? It, it heats hotter. Oh, okay, perfect. Yeah, it heats hotter, so it doesn't burn as fast. Yes. So you're not, you're not quickly filling it up Brilliant. all the time. Because okay. obviously if you've got a big piece of metal that you want to heat, you've only got this much gas that's in there. And that is, in, I mean, you would only fill it up probably. If you were even going to fold form all day, you'd probably fill it twice. Oh, okay, so it's Brilliant. Not, it doesn't take a lot and it fills with the hole that's in the bottom. Yep. So you turn it upside down and then like you would uh, an old fashioned lighter, if you like, that's yes. how you fill it up. Um, you know when it's getting towards the end, because obviously we don't want the butane to spill out. Mm. Um, so when you feel the canister that you're holding go cold. Go, go cold, It goes yeah. cold yeah. and then just, and then just stop. Uh, Steve, okay. Could you also use it to burn your desk if you feel like it? My Banksy. I'm gonna sign it. I am gonna sign it. That was Jenny Cleary's fault. She was talking too much. It made me laugh and I literally moved. looks like you've just uh, come on and just had a quick uh, had a quick uh, had a quick fag and <laughs> flicked you. <laughs> Oh. So, we're going to read these texts out because a lot of them have got customer numbers on. So, Dawn said 37.65 for this strand. Maria said 19.95. Marie, you are, you are, yeah. Dana said 19.95. Lily said 19.99. Mary and Brian, 14.95. No way, love. Lynn says 1495. We'd have to gift wrap it at that price. Mm? We'd have to gift wrap it at I that know, price. That's, yeah, <laughs> absolutely. So, Mikey B's gone 1495. So basically, the first, the first person to text in with their customer number and the correct price as to what this is going to be going to is going to get the earrings and you're also going to get this incredible strand. One. Yep. What, the blue one, you mean? The blue one. The Paraba Indicolite one. Mm. 2295, Susan says, a girl can dream. Has anyone come up with has anyone come up with the right answer yet? Not one person's come up with the correct answer. So uh, someone in Hertfordshire, silly from Hertfordshire, says fourteen ninety five. Basically, you're all wrong, and the first person to text in with the correct answer, with their customer number as well, uh, will win the strand and the earrings. If no one if no one gets the price, then we'll do it to the closest person. Amazing. Saw and the blades coming up in about 10 minutes time. Um, there we go, saw and blades. There we go. Uh, right, what are we doing? Well, what else do you want, how else do you want me to show them to you? It's a saw and a blades. You could jazz hands them. Okay, coming up in 10 minutes time. <laughs> 
I would give you a shimmy, but I, I think my top, I'm not sure my top will warrant that today. No, I definitely won't shimmy. Perfect, 10 minutes time. Right, what we're doing, number two, the jaw bending pliers, or the wire eaters, I like to call these. Yes. Oh, um, nom, 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 nom. Oh, nom, nom, nom. Nom, 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 nom. Do you know if ever they want to bring Cookie Monster back, you should go for that job. I, I definitely would. Because you are, you sound just like, and your bag's the same colour as Cookie yeah. Monster. Tea is for Cookie, my favourite thing. I love Cookie. Yeah, <laughs> Cookie Monster's amazing. Uh, so you're, a, a customer has texted him with the correct price, but it's given you no name or account number. Okay, so you need to reply back with your name and account number, basically, and the price that you text in with. Otherwise, you're not going to get nothing. Uh, so <laughs> you're, you're going to get absolutely nothing. Uh, so your wire, jaw, bending, whatever they're called, pliers, amazing. If you are making things like, oh. Okay. Nom, nom, nom. Go on then. Nom, nom. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, um, um. No, oh, <laughs> didn't get it then. <laughs> but basically, give me the wire. Basically, uh, it bends your wire. And if you bend it all the way, then what you end up making is a beautiful bangle. It's the best, the best tool to use to bend yeah. your wire, isn't it? And you can use it on your copper sheet as well. You don't just use it on your wire? No. Yeah, you can use it on your copper sheet. Um, really? Hey, I've got one here that we can... Let's open this one. Made a bit of a mess there. Let's, uh, oh. oh, she's opening a new one. It's me. Charlie says 32.95. This is not cut into a um, strip. Into a strip, but oh wow! So can you see? Oh my gosh, that's amazing. So you can just bend. See how it's just forming. That is amazing. Mm -hmm. Oh wow! Delicious. I was seat. just going. Nom nom. Nom 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 nom. Oh, you nom nom. There you go. Oh, yeah. Ooh, 12.95 for your amazing tool today. That is amazing. That's going to take all that's going to take all the um all the pressure out your hands. I thought you said the Smiths and I was about to you mean snips. Oh. Oh, I don't, I'm thinking about the Smiths now. Uh, so, um, these are amazing. These are, these are wonderful. You use these a lot, don't you, Fleur? Yeah, so mine are very slightly different, um, but they're exactly the same. Yeah, they are. So you yeah. use, how you use these is you, they, they don't have a spring in them. So they're better when you don't have a spring because you've got more control yeah, over absolutely. the cut. Yeah, absolutely. So you use them with your, your, your sort of like your hand in the middle and you just open and close them. That's it. Yeah. But they'll cut Brill. if I use those ones actually. Yeah. So you can look see. Look at this, just, look at this. It's literally like she's cutting a piece of paper. So you can see, you just go all the way along. And this is 0.5. This is 0 0.5, wow. so it just cuts so easily. And then if you wanted to make a ring, can we just get the nom nom pliers back? Nommy, nommy, nom 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 nom. I can show them properly then. So if nom, you wanted nom, to nom, make nom. A, a lovely ring, this is a bit too wide, but. I've got a ring that you made me using this exact technique at home, and I absolutely love it. It's a lovely kind of folded. It's like this one. Yes. So you can see, we can just start to now curve that around. And then we could use a ring mandrel, and what we oh, could do is wow. we could make that side go there and oh, that side yes, go there. Oh, yes, yes. And we just keep folding it around until we can make folding. a napkin ring. Make a napkin ring. I love that idea. £4.95 pence for your gorgeous snips. Well done. Absolutely amazing. Oh. They are fantastic. And... and these are my preferred ones. I know we do the red-handled ones as well, but these ones are yeah. my preferred ones. Yeah, yeah, now, yeah. what I would say is when you're using them, never cut to the end of the shears. Okay. If you cut to the end, so if you cut to the end and then move again, you get a burr. So oh, can you see? You don't want the burr. Don't want no burrs. Feel the burr. So you can you see it's just dense it a little tiny bit. It's just yeah. there. Okay, good call. Good call. So just use them and just nibble along. Nibble, nibble, nibble. Nibble, nibble. He's charming snips. Okay, so, um, four ninety-five. Fantastic. Well done. What would life be without the snips? Oh, so, 
Hey. Life, life without the Smiths. Be better, a lot better. Do you not like the Smiths? Do you not like Morrissey? Oh no. He has got a rather. He has got a very. He has got a very acquired. Uh, it, it's it's an acquired taste, isn't it? His voice, but um. Anyway, I've got the vice. Okay, you ready, everybody? Michael, are you ready? Yeah. Table vice, table vice. Every morning you greet. I'm trying to undo this. <laughs> Me. Uh, basically, it is a deal. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> table vice in the style of Morrissey. Oh, what have you Let's done to do it? That. I don't know, love. Oh, come in. 8.95. Yeah, Michael J. Here. Wolf, on, here he comes. <laughs> come on, Michael J. Wolf. The table... Oh, gosh. Oh. Just to twist it. Uh, so we've had some guesses <laughs> in for the price of the tourmaline. Just ignore them. Uh, we've had Dawn said 27.95. Heidi says 16.95. Norma said 17.95. Get your hands in there. Julie's gone 1895. It's tightening it that way. Susan says 3295. Julie's gone 1295. Lisa said 995. Well, that's just ridiculous. We have had a correct answer. Someone's correct. Lana says 2995. One correct answer we've had, so stop texting in now, because we've had the correct answer. Uh, but yeah, the table vice. Yep. It's an amazing tool. It's fantastic. So it's what I use to make air chasing. <gasps> right. Okay. So this is what we use um, to, to create this kind of look when we sort of hammer down into the metal and create amazing. lots of different textures. Mm. But this one is absolutely brilliant because not only is it um, forward facing, but you can see this bit spins all the way around as well. So no longer do you have to sort of like take your metal out and move it into a move different position. Around. You can then just move this around. And the other thing is you've got a groove. I don't know if you can see in there, mm. you see that groove. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. That if you want to if you want to put one of your discs in there, that will sit into that groove there and hold it tight. Yeah. So it's going to not move around in there. But these these are perfect for drilling your metals, for for sort of like moving your metals around, and it's not. I mean, my my vice at home is like four times the size of this, and yeah. it just takes up too much room. Yeah. This one's perfect. Great and If it size. is a little bit too um, stiff when you open and close it, just spray it with some like four in one oil. Is it a little bit? Is it a little bit uh, heavier than our other tools, Flo? Oh yeah, it's really heavy. So so we're going to be paying more in P and P. Yeah, yes. we're going to be paying uh, ten pounds in P and P. I was I was going twelve ninety five. <gasps> no, it's just one P and P of three ninety five. That weighs a lot. It weighs and, a ton. And um, you are. Not paying any more in PMP, it's no. still just three pounds and ninety-five. Um, and it will for your come with some oil on it as well. Just wipe it down with a, a kitchen roll. Oil. Right, let's go straight to the saw blades and the saw and the whatever saw. It's a German saw. It's a German saw. So it's a <laughs> goodness me. Um, it's a three-inch German saw. So the German saw, meaning the um, <laughs> heavens alive. Uh, the uh, physical design of the saw. Yes, yeah, so it's the um, what we call the throat, this section here. <laughs> Fantastic. There so, yeah, you so, yeah, go. It's, it means that you can get um, that amount of metal into there before you need to sort of like take the blade out and turn it around. Okay, perfect. The so uh, the the throat part is three inches yeah. in length. Perfect, yeah. okay, brilliant. And the best thing about this saw, if you went to all jewellers workshops, you would see this saw. You'll see this in all around the world because this is one that we all use because it's fully adjustable. So your blade goes into these sections here yeah. and then you can either tighten it with this wing nut here or mm. you can use that to shorten this. If you break a blade, ah. you shorten that little section there. So if you've broken a blade and it's sort of snapped sort of like a little bit further down, you can um, shorten it up a little there bit. There you go. Oh, it hurts, see? <laughs> so if you break a blade all yep. the way down to kind of this length, it, you yep. can, you yep. know, pop it in. Yep. Perfect. It's only seven ninety five. We hardly ever have this in stock. We hardly ever have the, uh, the saw in stock. One thing that I can tell you we almost never have in stock is the blades. Now, these blades are one to six. Yep. 
Mm, no, no, it no, can't they, be just, they just called one just to one six. six. Yeah, so it's a sliding um, scale. So perfect. one is the thinnest, thickest. Six is the thickest. Go, 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 go. Uh, there's uh, 200 available. You've got 144 uh, saw blades here. Sizes one to six. Uh, you've got 24 in each one of these different yeah. sizes. From fine to much, much, much thicker. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We're going to take these down to about four pence each. Yeah. And you will break a lot of blades when you first start. And you'll you still will. keep breaking. I mean, I broke a couple of blades when I was making a, a few bits um, at the weekend. You know, so you're always going to break blades. They're always going to snap on yeah. you, especially if you um, use them a lot and it's not, because it's obviously going to wear through and the teeth are going to wear down as well. So of to course. have all these different array of blades is fantastic. So, you know, you can use the number two, possibly the number three, you know, for your 0.8 sheet, you know, to cut. Yeah, so lovely. The, the finer the blade, the less clean up you have to do, mm -hmm. if you like. But no, these are perfect for practicing with and perfect for all of your, all your copper and silver work. Brilliant, fantastic. Five ninety five for the blades today. You will. It's always worth. It's always worth getting more of these. And the reason for that, obviously, is is because, as Fleur says, you will go through a lot of blades when you first start making your pieces. So you, but you'll very, very quickly get the uh, um, uh, get the hang of it and get hold of kind of what blades for which kind of projects and which kind of metal sheets. Well done. Loads of people coming through. I need you to check your baskets out. We don't have uh, a huge, huge amount of these. Almost fifty percent um, has gone. Well done. Five ninety five. Um, fantastic. Coming up in about ten minutes time. We've got the uh, tourmaline, of course. <gasps> oh! So I, I miss that. Did the as the uh, as the prize gone? No, not yet. Oh. But we have had a correct answer in. <gasps> oh. So yes, um, we will we will we will be telling the person who they are. Irene, wrong answer. We've had a correct answer. Stop texting in now, everyone. Well, stop texting in with the uh, with the prize. Uh, but yeah, fantastic. Well done. Right. Okay. Um, Keep coming through for that, that's awesome, well done. Let's do the whammer. Oh, now this looks like a very pleasing tool to use. Oh, oh yeah. I'm not getting blamed yeah. for that broken desk. Yeah. You are. <laughs> I'm not getting blamed for that broken desk. <laughs> <laughs> this is your wire whammer tool. Yeah. So, essentially what you've got here is a, is a hammer with a nylon head on it. Mm -hmm. Why has it got the nylon head flare? So nylon doesn't mark your metal. So ah. nylon and leather are the two things that will work hard on your metal, but not mark your metal or not stretch your metal. Mm -hmm. so it Perfect. won't stretch at all. Perfect. So you've got your nylon head on here, Woo! but you've also got this head as well, which is like a, um, a ball end yeah, on here. Yeah, ball peen hammer, this one, yeah. And yeah. this is for um, dappling your work? Yeah, texturing your work, so you can actually texture all your metal with this, so it'll get that beautiful, um, like you say, dappled effect to it. Yeah. Um, it's a great little tool to, to sort of like be able to work in small areas as well. Absolutely. Great, great, great tool. These are specifically made for jewellery making, just to let you know. And that's a great thing. If you tried to do this kind of effect with a with a hammer from your local DIY shop, it just it just wouldn't work. It's not fit for purpose. It's you know, it's a much, much, much bigger tool. Whereas this is just exactly the right size, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, and this end here, this this domed end here, this is your almost like your chasing end. Oh, okay, lovely. So this is where you can spread metal in all directions. Mm. But also as well, you can flatten metal with that as well. But you will work hard and you will mark it as well. But when you're using this hammer always have one of the other ends on the other side so it's perfectly weighted ah right so don't just use it without without yeah without so it's been designed it's, be, it's been designed to be weighted perfectly yeah with either of those ends that are on there yeah absolutely oh yeah they're exactly the same weight actually that's really interesting um it's yours today for 19 pounds and 95 pence brilliant brilliant tool if you if you get this chances are you're probably going to need your steel block you are now, can I just say for anyone who's going to be coming through to get all these bits today, um, it's still 3.95 P&P per order. This is a steel block. It's a block made from steel. It's very heavy. I've got the sandbag coming up as well. In fact, let's get the sandbag out. Let's get the old sandbag out because it is a great, great sandbag. Yeah. Get the old sandbag out. Um, and you hammer onto, you hammer, your, you put your metal on here and then you hammer, hammer onto, onto it, don't it, you? Yeah. So, you need this, so metal will only stretch or mark if you're hammering onto steel. Ah. So if you hit metal onto metal or, or sort of like the nylon onto metal, if you're hammering it onto something else, it won't actually mark the metal, it won't actually stretch the metal. Ooh. So you always need it onto metal to stop the reverberation mm -hmm. going back through. This metal block is so much nicer than my metal block. This is mine, so ignore all the, the marks on it. But can you see it's thinner. It's much mine's thinner. Mine's thinner. And also mine's got quite sharp edges. 
Do you feel that there? Mine's quite sharp. Oh, it is, isn't it? This one's beautifully rounded. Yeah. So you've got lovely rounded edges. So if it's in your work bag, it's not going to damage your work damage bag Damage other like this. things, yeah. Um, something to always... Um, keep into consideration is um, this surface has to be clean. Any marks that are on this surface will go onto the underneath of your metal. Ah, okay, right. Okay. So you can see, if I just show you mine, I've got this one I need to um, sand back down because I've got some marks on there. So you can see there, it's just got some little marks. If I was to put a nice clean piece of copper or sterling silver on there and hammer that section there, all yep. those marks will be popped on the back. Transferred. Ooh, yeah. No, so you, don't you want need that. to keep it nice and clean. So your metal block, you have to, you have to. If, if you're going to be doing any kind of hammering uh, on your metal sheet, you're going to have, you've got to yes. get your steel block. Yeah. Otherwise, it just won't work. Yeah. Uh, but Things absolutely like fantastic. Stamping as well is perfect for this as well. You know, mm. using your stamping, mm. um, and it works perfectly with the sandbag. Absolutely. Now perfectly. the sandbag. What is this for? So the sandbag can be used for lots of different things. So it's used to dull down the um, the sound from hammering onto your steel. So when, when you're hammering steel onto steel, it can be quite noisy, noisy yeah. as we'll find out in the twelve o'clock hour. Probably Woo! take the mic yeah. out. Um, so this will dull down the noise, but. The best thing that I use my sandbag for is when they first come, they're quite tough. Mm. The more you use it, the more it will bed in. Yeah, lovely. So what you can do is if I wanted to um, hammer, let me just... Can I borrow the whammer for a second? Of course you can, love. So if I wanted to put a gentle bend into here, if I just hammer into there, can you see how the sandbag is starting to oh. move into the area yeah, yeah, yeah. where I'm hammering? So I can start to sort of like raise, and this is, how we, this is what we use to like raise a bowl oh, or raise, wow. raise a plate or something like that. So we can start, so what we would do is we would start in the middle and this would then depress into the, the sandbag and mm. it would start to then come up into so the like bowl. So the more you use your sandbag, the, 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 kind of the more it, the supple it will become. Yeah. And at £4.95, now there are other sandbags on the market that are leather and they're about £60, £70. Pounds. No. Yeah, the bigger, this one's perfect. See, I always say this when we sort of like do these kind of tools, you can have like a really big sandbag. Mm. If you're using it every day, then obviously it's, you know, you use it for different things. But this is perfect because we're not, when we're making jewellery, we're never going to work in any really bigger than this. Mm. So this is absolutely perfect. So yeah, keep using it. The more you use it, the better it becomes. There's only 12 of this left. So please do get it. 4 95 Well done, everybody. It's a really, really brilliant tool. Um, the moment everybody has been waiting for, which of course is this incredible strand of tourmaline. We do have a winner who has correctly um, guessed what the price point of this incredible strand is. Believe you and I, everyone who said 37.95, 34.95, 29.95, rightly so, but you were a mile off. It is absolutely incredible. It's coming up in just a couple of seconds. The most amazing strand of tourmaline. Don't go anywhere. Our brand new Get Started with Jewellery Maker page has been created to provide help and guidance for jewellery making newbies. If you need design suggestions, hints and tips, or help with perfecting your jewellery designs, we're here to help. Head over to facebook.com slash getstartedwithjm where our talented in-house designers are happy to answer your jewellery making questions, offer inspiration and get you started in your jewellery making journey. Jewellery Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewellery Maker. Jewellery Maker. Create. Wear. Share. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewellery Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join a community of over 65,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions, send photos of your designs and enter our Wall of Fame competition. Or if you need any help or advice, you can email our friendly help team. Make sure to get involved and stay up to date with Jewellery Maker. Jewelry 
Memory Maker have an extensive range of DVDs for all abilities. Each of our mediums has an introductory DVD to help you get started. If you're already an experienced jewellery maker, we have a collection of projects and more advanced DVDs to take your designs to the next level. We are always filming new DVDs with our specialist guest designers, so visit our website for more information. Hello everyone, hope you can join myself and presenter Eleanor this Tuesday for the morning show, the 5th of November, for the second part of my Symbols Findings launch. This amazing range of findings has really caught everyone's imagination. And this Tuesday is all about the super duos. So we've got four different colours, we have got six different findings and, would you believe it, 16 brand new Super Duo colours. So that's this Tuesday, the 5th of November, myself and Eleanor for the morning show from 8am. We'll see you then. You can now book Jewellery Maker workshops online. Just head over to our Jewellery Maker website and click on the workshop link. We have a wide range of workshops from beginner to intermediate covering a variety of mediums. Once you've found a workshop you would like to attend, simply click on the book now button, fill in the required fields and then press continue. This will take you through to the payment page. If you have any questions, you can contact our workshop coordinator at any time by emailing workshop at jewelrymaker.com. We look forward to seeing you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Oh my word. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, I am so excited about this. Sorry about that, everybody. Oh, dear me. Hey? I'll tell you more in the next break. <laughs> this is amazing. Um, this is um, uh, this is one of those strands that you look at and you just think, well, that's going to be that price, and then you find out that it isn't. And gemstones have got to be pretty amazing to take us all by surprise here at Jewelry Maker because we work with gemstones every day. So for something to universally be uh, a strand that we've all looked at and gone. Do you know what? I don't see how on earth we can do the price that we're going to do. It's got to be a pretty amazing deal. Myself and Fleur were completely and utterly bowled over this morning. Liam, I think if you had to pick a strand of gemstones today to really kind of hang your hat on, it would be this strand of gemstones. It is like the strand of, it is the strand of the day. It's one of those incredible gemstone strands that you look at and you think, how on earth did we manage to do a deal so good for this incredible strand? Because this is natural. This is tourmaline. This isn't dyed. It's not, it's not lab created. It's completely and utterly natural. Looking through this strand and looking at these incredible colours, Flo, you've got something for everyone in here, yeah. haven't you? And you've even got some of the most, <clears> like, <throat> rarest ones you've got your bicolors tourmalines in there yeah. as well i mean you've got those those colors that we sort of like know the names of you know as, as certain gemstones obviously all underneath the tourmaline family but you've got things that are very reminiscent of rubellite of your <coughs> indicolite oh definitely you know, you've got something of everything and i think this is it's probably one of the most um grown up strands of colored gemstones yeah. you will ever get of the same yeah. gemstone if yeah, you know what yeah, I mean. yeah yeah such a sophisticated palette yeah. you're going to be getting here flair's absolutely right you've got your indicolite and paraba kind of blues going through here you've definitely got your rubellite reds you've oh it's just absolutely gorgeous now, um, we did have a correct guess in for this. A couple of correct, uh, but we had about 100 texts in. All of you were wrong, apart from about three of you. Now, the first person to text in with that correct answer was Julie. Oh. Julie, um, many congratulations to you. 
you have guessed correctly the price point. So you are going to win this strand and the earrings. That's a good Monday. That's a good Monday deal for you, isn't it, my lovely? So I'm going to give you a minute's clock. And after that minute clock has uh, finished, the graphics are going to be live. I have 100. Uh, well, we did have 150. It's actually going to be 149 now because, of I course. I think we'd know who Julie was because <clears throat> when Julie sees that she's won the earrings and she knows the price, she's going to buy about four of these. You're probably right. <laughs> You're probably right, Fleur. I would, I would be multi-buying. Mm. And it's not very often I can say that about a strand of tourmaline. I would be multi-buying. Your 60-second clock starts now, okay? <laughs> tourmaline is a natural gemstone. It's a natural gemstone that forms in beautiful shard-like inclusions. It can grow at any angle. It can grow in all sorts of incredible places worldwide. And it is also one of the two birthstones of October. Um, it, is, uh, it, uh, it gets its name from the Sanskrit word that uh, means uh, multicolored. And many ancient civilizations believed that this incredible gemstone um, was pa uh, passed through a rainbow and that's how it got its incredible color. Because you can get tourmaline in every conceivable, conceivable um, uh, color. Tourmaline forms a bit like aquamarine and forms of beryl, it forms in incredible uh, pegtites. And basically what you have are huge voids, huge caverns underground, which fill with molten hot liquid, which have got many different elements and chemicals in there, which are naturally forming. And when those when that molten hot kind of lava cools down, it forms tourmaline. Tourmaline comes in many, many different colours. It is a, it's an unusual gemstone in the fact that it doesn't grow at a regular pace. It'll grow and then have a rest and grow and have another little rest, which is why you get little kind of uh, marks, little lines, a bit like on the stump of a tree uh, going through the incredible gemstone. When the liquid cools, um, all of these crystals, um, 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 uh, they, they crystallize and you get these beautiful tourmaline crystals. I want to show you the most amazing, the most amazing uh, tourmaline formation. Look at this. Look at the angles at which this incredible gemstone grows. I wonder whether I can get, oh no, that's not going to come out very well. Let me show you, I don't know whether, you, mm, maybe there's another picture on here. I've got loads and loads of people coming through to get this already, which is oh, absolutely fantastic. That one there, this that's one. like the Emerald City. Yeah. This one here, let me show you. If you look at all the different angles, sorry, Michael, it's not a very good picture at all. It's not a very big picture, I should say. All the different angles in which this gemstone is growing. You can see it's growing at completely sporadic angles it's absolutely incredible yeah that's 80 dollars by the way for that um but yeah you've got you've got completely different angles you've got angles which are which are completely at right angles to each other diagonals what an erratic mm. beautiful gemstone yeah. um you can get bicolored tourmaline there are some bicolored tourmaline examples on this incredible strand and that basically means this gemstone starts to form starts to form um <coughs> at a slightly different temperature with slightly different compounds and you get that incredible color shift, that color change um, almost, it kind of shifts in color. I had 150 available. Now this is the exciting thing, this is the exciting thing. We're down to a less than 100 available. Not that many people, uh, not that many people? Not that many people have checked out. The reason is nobody, nobody, knows the price. Nobody knows the price. Now, I've got a couple of people who've checked out already with multi-bidders. That's really, really fantastic at $39.95. This is where we should be with this today. But we are going to be going much, much, much lower. What are you saying, uh, what are you saying, Fleur? It's got like a chatoyancy, but it's, it's got, got like, like a cat's a eye quality, shit, quality yeah. this one, hasn't yeah. it? It's absolutely sensational. Look at that. Now, I'm a little bit nervous about what we're about to do. It is going to sell out today. We're at 39.95. What would you like to see? Under 30 maybe, Fleur? That would be amazing, please. Yes. What about under 25 quid? What about 24.95? What about 21.95? 21.95 or 12.95? Oh 
my gosh, that is amazing. That's an agate price. Yeah, that's exactly. A, that's an agate. 12 95 is your price point. I've got 90 in baskets. Everyone's checking out loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of multi bidders. I don't have 90 left. It is selling out. You are absolutely on it today. Well done, everyone. Uh, we've had the most amazing fun already today. And I tell you something, it's only 10 o'clock. It's been absolutely brilliant. We've still got the deal of the day coming up. <laughs> Absolutely yeah. fantastic. I think with, with this gemstone as well, it's one of the gemstones choice of top jewellery houses. Oh, so if 100%. if you think of people like Van Cleef and Arpel, um, oh, Chopard, Garrard's, they will use tourmaline yeah. because yeah. it's the most colourful. Yeah. Other than sapphires, Definitely. I think when you think of the sort of like high-end jewellers, they use coloured sapphires, but I can't think of any other coloured gemstone that they would use a variety of colours. A variety of, of, exactly. And I think tourmaline <clears throat> is that one. That's why, I mean, like I say, Van Cleef and Arpel, it's one of their favourites. And when you look at top, top gemstones, as in rarity, as in value-wise, kind of how much people will pay for them, to the top, out of the top 10 gemstones, probably three or four of those are tourmaline. Yeah. So Paraba tourmaline, indicolite, chrome tourmaline, Pedanera bicolor tourmaline, mm. watermelon tourmaline, rubellite, Crisera rubellite, Sephira tourmaline. These are all members of the tourmaline family. And you're getting them today in a completely natural way, in beautiful rounds as yes. well. Yeah. And Let's talk about the fact that they're rounds. Yes, yeah. so, so easy to be able to work with. Can oh, you imagine? so I mean, easy. Obviously, um, Going back to like the uh, my geeky facts on copper, copper is present in quite a lot of coloured gemstones, yeah. especially with the blues. Yes, yes, yes. So can yes, you imagine of course. making the the demo that we've just done? Oh, with the blues. But with the blues and oh, the greens Flair, to make them idea. more floral. Yeah. You know, you've got. Oh, and the thing is with tourmaline, I think you can get different coloured agates. Of course you can. But sometimes yeah. they don't all go together. Mm -hmm. Every single one of these colours goes together. It's just seamless all the way through. Blues, blues. There's a blue. Look at that blue there. Yeah, blues, blues up here. Blue down here as well. My favourite is the chrome. I love the chrome. The too. greens. Oh, yeah, they're the stunning, green. aren't they? And yeah. I like the golds as well. Yeah. Um, I have to say as well, with the with with a with a strand of gemstones like this, if somebody said to you, "I've made you a bracelet," and you'd say, "Oh, wow, thank you very much. What is it?" Well, it's a strand of gemstones that I've used, um, and you're going to be getting pinks, blues, greens, golds. You're going to be getting um, you're going to be getting um, uh, kind of taupe colours in there. You're going to be getting heather colours. You're going to be getting mauves. I'd be thinking, gosh, that sounds a bit much. Yeah. But with a strand of tourmaline, because as Fleur says, it's all one gemstone. It's all completely natural. They all form in a similar kind of way. The colours will all go together. It's extraordinarily tonal. We are so over allocated. I've got 30 remaining and I've got 57 in baskets. Sorry, I'm just thinking the two, all, the two deal of the day strand. Well, the deal of the day strand, and then the yeah. the, the other colourway, <clears throat> um, the other the, the gemstone. How beautiful! I mean, that is. I know we've amazing. just done through the decades, haven't we? This weekend, it mm -hmm. was through the decades. That for me is an absolutely beautiful Art Deco piece. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, you're dead perfect, right. That. And you could use any colour any colour combination of metals with this. Yeah, I mean, they form in a similar way, aquamarine and tourmaline. They both form in mm. peg tights. So like in these under, underground kind of caverns almost. Mm. Maybe that's why they look so good together. I don't yeah. know. What would the rose quartz look like? Oh, with the, yeah, with the rose quartz, of course, it's going to look amazing. Very floral. Wonderful for the, um, wonderful with the uh, oh, kind of uh, floral weddings. <gasps> Great strand for favorite. autumn. That's beautiful. I that's love that. That's my favourite combination. I love that. It's absolutely gorgeous, really isn't it? Really beautiful. I've got so many multi bidders still coming through to get this. Twos, threes, and fours of these coming through to get these. Well done. Danny Jan, Collector Jody Peter, Sheila um, Kerry, Heidi, Norma, Vera, Allison. Anonymous bidder. I've got loads of collectors as well. You have all got these sitting in your baskets, plus about another 30 of you. Please, 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 can you check your baskets out? I don't want to see any of these left today. They've all got to go. You're yeah. doing absolutely brilliantly. Um, Liam's just told me what you could get those two um, strands for. Seriously? Oh my gosh, really? Is it amazing? For, Can you imagine the, for for the rose quartz? The rose quartz and these. No, you're not. Are you seriously? Oh my gosh. I just think, you know, for, for Christmas Day, because obviously oh. with Christmas Day, we want that colour. We want that... We want that kind of... Oh, Definitely. I've had another idea. Go on. Wirework Christmas tree. <gasps> Fairy lights. Oh, but like a sophisticated my gosh. The, one. Yeah, sophisticated multi Very sophisticated. Oh, yes. I'm going to count how many you're getting on the strand. Because what I'm going to what I'm going to suggest is this is an ungraduated... This is an ungraduated strand. They're all the same size. Why not graduate the colours? 
Oh, that would be beautiful. That would be yeah, nice, wouldn't beautiful. it? Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty, thirty-two, thirty-four, thirty-six, thirty-eight. 40 I think 42 44 46 there's about there's about 48 on the strands I would be graduating the color just yeah. very very simply around the neckline yeah. they're the great the size of these is perfect mm -hmm. earrings necklaces bracelets a beady bead with these would the be beady absolutely beady gorgeous a bubble bracelet yeah. with these would be absolutely gorgeous rosary that linked. right size rosary See, I think I would and just rosary perfect them because each one is so special they would give it yeah. its own little um Showcase. Yeah, absolutely, you're absolutely right, Fleur. So nice and it's not graduated in size. And producer Liam said, don't these look so much better than if they were to be faceted? And yeah. I totally agree. Yeah. When you've got a yeah. gem of this kind of quality, yeah. you want to be able to, you don't want to be distracted by the luster. No. You want to just look at the gem and appreciate the colour and appreciate its natural quality. Look at this um, one here. I mean, if you were to say that, oh, if you would say is, to look somebody, at that. Look at this that. is um, a strand of multi-gems, that would be the best ruby you've ever seen. 100%, <laughs> yeah. It? yeah. For a natural yeah. ruby. Yeah, And definitely. then like, you've got other ones that are there. So like <gasps> sapphire colours as well just a beautiful strand it's it's it, it's an epic strand i'd love to see these incorporated into trees of life i'd love mm. to see these incorporated into um in, into your autumnal jewelry i'd love to see these rosary links i'd love to see them in a bubble bracelet i'd love to see just a plain stretchy um i'd love to see these maybe in a what's the bad in, boys in, on the end uh, the these blue, no the other the other end the blue these oh, it's lapis is it yeah it's lapis oh isn't that beautiful it's beautiful isn't it it's gorgeous could you mix them in with pearls to make a... Oh, yeah. Oh, of course, yeah. With pearls, th pearls would be beautiful. Pearls and, and ruby, again, like, a very classic combination. Yeah, very, very classic combination. Yeah. And also one that you could sort of, like, look for inspiration in those big jewellery houses. Definitely. Absolutely gorgeous. Uh, 12 95 is your price point today. Still got Nicolette, Kath, Joe, Danny, Collector, Jodie, Peter, Sheely, Kerry, Norma, Vera, Alison. 23 in baskets. You are checking out, but you're taking... Oh, my word. Please, please, please do it as quickly as you can. I would say, that this is so nice for that, I would say over 85% of people have multi -bought. Definitely, yeah, because you're going to get a suite of jewellery. You oh, can make a necklace definitely. and a, you know, a necklace and bracelet with a pair of earrings as well. Um, and you've then got a piece of, a, a suite of jewellery, which is an incredibly high-end piece of jewellery, uh, suite of jewellery. Not only that, but don't you think, if you order three or four of them, each one of these strands is going to be slightly different. Yep. You can um, you can um, decide which strands you want to keep. You can send the others back if you want to. I doubt very much that you will do, but, but you can make that decision to do that if you want to. Janet, well done you. have just checked out. So is Justine and Helen and Francis Collector. Well done. Julie, you guessed the price of twelve ninety five. Well done to you, my darling. So you get this strand and you, you also get this beautiful Do you think Julie sent that text going, oh, well... Oh, I may as well. well. I may as well have a go. I'll have a go. <laughs> I'll have a go. Julie, you were right, darling. You were the first person to text him with the correct answer of twelve ninety-five. So you get the earrings and you get the strands. And I think I don't oh, know. Julie, te text us in, Julie. Yeah, Julie, text us. Well. Have you have you bought this strand as well? Oh my gosh. If you want to take those pearls out, Julie, all you need to do is cut that piece of wire out of those earrings and replace them with that and then just another piece of wire just to do the wrap at the top. And then you've got tourmaline and copper oh, earrings. Amazing. Well done, everyone. I've still got more people coming through. We do have to move on, um, but we will uh, keep you updated. Nicolette and Jackie, please check your baskets out. Deal of the day coming up in 45 minutes. Does anyone actually know where this morning's gone? It's flying, isn't it? Time flies when you haven't It's gone where, uh, Adam? It's gone to Ibiza, did you say? It's gone to Ibiza. Ooh. I'd like to go to Ibiza, actually. Have I'm a nice long lunch. At El Chiringuito's. Very nice place. Ooh. Is it nice? I've never been to Ibiza. <gasps> it's beautiful. Is it? Oh, my gosh. It's the most beautiful island. It's beautiful. Part of the Balearics. It's absolutely good. And Formentera, which is the neighbouring island, is even more beautiful. It's like being in the it's like being in the Caribbean. It's beautiful. So beautiful, gorgeous. Forty-five minutes. Those the rose quartz is going under fifteen quid. There you are. I've just completely ruined that for Liam. I don't care. I don't care. You need to know. <laughs> Amazing. Right, right. What are we doing now, love? Numero dos. Oh, what is it? Is it a kit? A little bundly, bundly, bundle. Christmas earrings. Oh, I did ask you for something Christmassy, didn't I? It's only gone and done it. Um, champagne gold coloured silver plated round copper wire. Like that a lot. 
Perfect for making your findings, your shepherd hooks. Great, yeah, because it's point 0.8. Well done. Red Jasper. Oh, I love that. That's very nice. That's a really nice shade of red. And then what would a pair of uh, Christmas earrings be, Michael, without a bit of sparkle? It would be absolutely nothing, wouldn't it? <laughs> so we've gone and put in, he's gone and put in the beautiful Swarovski Black Diamond Bicones oh. to add a bit of sparkle. Thank you very much, Lee Ham. Are you trying to go after our job, Liam? Are you trying to become a designer? I think maybe he is. <laughs> Gorgeous. Um, so a bit of sparkle. You've got your red, you've got your New Year's Eve, you've got your Christmas Day moi. Oh, my word. Do you go all out on Christmas Day outfit-wise? Uh, yes, I do. I know do a lot of people spend the day in their pyjamas. I'm but, a um, pyjama person. Are you? But well, it depends. Face I suppose, makeup pyjamas. I suppose if it, was just, if it was just the four of us, I'd probably stay in my pyjamas. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we all stay in our pyjamas, which is quite... Um, Embarrassing when we go around to my mum's and we have to. Do the walk kids past get new pajamas on Christmas Eve? Though, yes, don't they do. Yeah, they in their Christmas so at least Eve boxes. Clean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're, Lovely. They're... Um, my girls were delighted with their Christmas Eve boxes. Um, oh, they absolutely love them. Oh, uh, Christmas earrings, eighteen ninety five. That strand on its own should be twenty quid. Then you get the wire and you got the black diamond um, Shrovsky as well. The rondelles you're going to be. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not counting all of those. Or can I forty eight? I reckon. Can I add something to this kit? Could I add the last strand that we're going to play of the, the show? <gasps> oh, baby, kit? baby. Here we go. Yes, look at that garnet. <whistles> See, that's why she's a designer, Liam. <laughs> and you're a producer. <laughs> but I do, I'm sure it probably says on the details, Lee Ham. 19 what? No, it's more than that. It's way more than 19 there. On the rondelles? Oh, gosh, oh no, no, the rondelles. Oh, the rondelles. Oh, you thought, sorry, I thought you meant the Shirovsky. I think there's, is there usually 46 in those. 48, I think. Yeah, 48 of the Shirovsky, right. Oh, sorry, I thought you meant these, I thought you meant these rondelles. About just shy of 20 of your red jasper. Yeah, you could make nine mm -hmm. sets of earrings. That's a nice idea. Lovely. Well done, everyone. And then put your garnets in there as well. Gorgeous. Well done. Two pound ten each. Oh, that would be amazing. Well done, everyone. <laughs> oh, Liam, I do. I do love you, Liam. Right. Right, let's have a... <clears throat> Present earrings. Oh, no. Oh, no. I don't like it when Liam says things like that. Bear with me. Just hear me There's out. There's a story. This is going to be random. <laughs> this is going to be... Oh, no. I, I totally know what you're going to say. You're going to say that the squares of agate are the presents. Yeah, which I think is a lovely. You've seen one on the internet, yeah, where they had a big green gem at the bottom, a smaller red gem, and then the bow. Oh, so like a stack of presents. So you had them like that, and then like that, and then you had a bow at the top. How was the bow attached? Was it glued on or just wire? I quite, I like yeah. that. It's like a little stack of presents. Very Christmassy colours. You've got your little um, yellow gold plated sterling silver bows. Goodness that's gracious me, that's a bit special, that isn't it? blue in it. Yeah, that does have blue in it, doesn't it? Gorgeous. Um, well done, everybody. Here we go. Let's get those prices down for you. I... I do like, um, I do like Christmas earrings. However... Some of them are a little bit novelty, like I, I can't stand novelty ties. Mm -hmm. um, and sometimes people will wear very over the top earrings at Christmas. I think a pair of earrings made out of these, uh, out of these beautiful gemstones with the beautiful little bows on top. They're really, really lovely. They're colorful, they're nice, they're, they're, they're you know, a lovely um, marriage of um, uh, gemstones. And of course you've got so those beautiful I components should, uh, as well. Take hmm? your Christmas present back to the shop then. <laughs> Because I got you a lovely wreath of an earring with some flashing lights on them. Oh, nice. <laughs> and jingle bells. Oh, no, they don't, do they? The size of your head. Well done, Liam. <laughs> Gorgeous. Well done, everyone coming through to get those. Forty ninety five. Oh, mate. OK. Nah. There we go. Right. What are we doing now, love? When's the amazing lap is coming mm. up? 
quarter to everyone. That's beautiful. That. That is strand. amazing strand. Beautiful really, pairs really of your lapis. Oh, yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. Coming up uh, in about in about 15, 20 minutes time. We are a couple of minutes away from the Sharite as well. Let's do, before we move on to the Sharite. Oh, my gosh. That's not Ruby's always right. What? Oh, here it is. Lovely. Ruby's always right and Ombre Amethyst. Ooh. Together. Why, Why not? It's a. Ruby's it's Oasite. a. Hmm? I love Ruby's Oasite. Do you? Oh, it's a lovely gem, isn't it? What? Do, yeah. What is it you love about it? Well, you have to bear with me on this one. Oh gosh! <laughs> Don't think I can cope with any more bear with me's today. It reminds me of the Wizard of Oz. Do you know where she takes the apple off the tree? Yes. It reminds me of that because they've oh, got ruby red apples uh, yes. on the beautiful green trees. Apples. Yeah. <laughs> Only fell if someone sold your apples. Oh, that's so good. I love that scene. It's brilliant, isn't it? Ruby Zoisite and Ombre Amethyst. Absolutely gorgeous. Marie showed us as well. I can remember her showing us under a, a light source. It's a UV light. The, the, Glows bright. It pink. glows bright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The red, amazed. the yeah. red ruby part of the um, of the uh, of the ruby is always like glows. Uh, ruby does fluoresce. Um, so really, really fantastic. Well done. Oh, uh, so 82 carats of ruby is always like an ombre amethyst. There, really nice. Right. It's a stash builder. That is a stash builder. Is this Brazilian amethyst? Do you think? Do you know what? I don't know. Does it say where the amethyst is from, love? Oh no, we're doing Some more. Some of them with are really me's. like nice, like like a. Zambian amethyst. Wow, oh my that's, gosh. That's almost like some of them are like Rose de France. Pinkish yeah. Pinkish colour, aren't they? They really are, aren't they? I'd look, I'd, I mean, they, they go surprisingly mm. well together, actually, don't they? But I would be, I would be using that as a stash building exercise because yeah. they, they are, what, 750 a strand. You know, and I know, ombre amethyst like that. It's natural. And you've definitely, as Fleur says, got your Rose de France in there. Mm. That is amazing. That is amazing. Is that's that 750. Yeah, for both of them. Ruby Zoas, that's a really expensive gemstone. And it's, and it's becoming incredibly rare as well. Oh, Liam, I'm not happy with that. <laughs> oh. oh. Well done, everyone. <laughs> um, 14.95. I love, I love looking at them twisted together like that. They go so well. It Maybe is. it's because they're both natural gemstones as well. Mm. That's absolutely amazing, isn't it? 14.95. Collect it well into as well, my lovelies. Oh, I'd be getting some of those if I was at home. That's a really, really, really nice combination, I have to say. That's really lovely. Gorgeous. And well if you done, everyone. To, you could take your artistic license and say that the Ruby Zoisite is the same family as Tanzanite and have it as December's birth gemstone. Oh, come on. I like artistic that. Artistic license. That's a great bit of, uh, a great bit of uh, <laughs> manipulating the truth there. Well done. Elizabeth Collector, 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 Pauline. Loads of collectors coming through for this. Well done. Collectors from all over the country West Midlands, North Yorkshire, Glamorgan. Well done. Absolutely fantastic. Well done, everybody. At fourteen pounds and ninety-five pence, well done. Absolutely beautiful. Well done. Um, uh, collector in Glamorgan, well done. You've got two of those. Well done. Beautiful quality. Well done. That's, that's lovely. Beautiful. Okay, there we go. Talkbacks recorded, Liam. Just so you know. Yeah. Oh, what's occurring? Here we go. So, oh, are you, um, do you get your kids advent calendars? Um, not chocolate ones this year because I can't pretend, I can't trust myself any longer. No, my kids haven't got chocolate ones this year. They've got the little figure ones. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. Do you get, um, will you be getting Mark a Christmas advent calendar? Again, I can't be trusted to leave those doors locked with chocolate behind them. Okay, so are you getting him an advent calendar? No, because I'll have eaten oh, it. Oh, okay, right, fair <laughs> enough. No, I'll get in, um, I might get him an advent calendar, actually. I bought my husband one, which has got like a protein, protein snacks in it. I could get a gin one. Get a gin one. Oh, protein snacks. Yeah, for like, um, after workouts and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Basically, build those guns up, John. There's lots of advent calendars around now, yeah. isn't there? Well, the Tiffany's one is over a hundred grand. So I sent him the uh, link to that. Joking. 100 grand. Can you remember when you were a kid though and all you got was a picture and you were happy with the picture? You were happy with it. Is that a lovely picture? That's what I, get, I was happy with the picture. We get religious, we get religious ones. Yeah, happy, happy with your happy picture. With the picture. Happy with your picture of the star of Bethlehem. And now it's the chocolate. Uh, 795, will you look at that strand of Labradorites? <gasps> that is beautiful. Oh my word. See, that is a great, for me, gents bracelet as well. Amazing. 
gorgeous lavender. Look at the size mm. of them. They're huge, aren't they? I think, like I say, like a, a gents bracelet with maybe some copper elements in Definitely there as well. Definitely copper, yes. I like that idea. Brilliant. And if you could stamp names and things like that. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that's a lovely idea. The quality, they're so big, aren't they? <gasps> oh, yeah, well done. Seven ninety five, Lucy, well done to you. Anonymous bidders, well done to you as well, my lovelies. I did buy my daughter one of those beauty advent calendars. Oh, very nice. She opened it all on the first day and oh. said, oh, I need mascara. And I, need, I was like, no, I think you're supposed to. She said, oh, no, you just, out. You, you just open it all up. They do makeup ones. They do makeup too. ones. They do um, perfume ones. They do uh, Tiffany, Tiffany's do one. Beer ones, gin ones. Mm. Vodka ones, pork scratching, pork scratching ones. Really? Yeah. They sell those at um, the local supermarket. Do they? Pork scratching ones. <gasps> Amazing, hey? The famous shop that rhymes with. Oh my gosh, you're <laughs> such an idiot. Yeah, yes, the shop that's on Oxford Street, yes. A popcorn, oh yeah, they do popcorn ones. Very nice. We can you remember we had an advent calendar here and we put tin foil over it. We, we did had to poke through yeah, it, didn't we? An advent deal. Hilarious. <laughs> We're gonna Hilarious. bring that back. We're... Bring that back. Anyway, well done everyone. Gorgeous. Yes. This gentleman always reminds me of you. Oh, that's so nice and I love it. And I yeah. Oh and that's that is a gorgeous strand. <gasps> that is beautiful. amazing. Here's Adam with his lovely oh, hair. That is absolutely stunning. That's oh, a knockout strand. Oh, that is strand. amazing. Nice bit of knitwear as well. <laughs> there you go, Adam. <laughs> oh, talking about getting old, guess what I bought myself? What did you buy yourself? I'm ashamed to say it, actually. Oh, no, not one of those blanky things with the arms on. Thermal vest. Oh, I love a thermal vest. A nice Tuck it in. blend thermal vest. Tuck, Tuck it in. in. Yeah. Tuck it in. Keep yeah. it back warm. <laughs> Um, right, Kai and I graduated plain ovals. These are beautiful, all the way from Nepal. Twenty nine ninety five. That's amazing. I'd have that over an advent calendar. I'll have that over an advent calendar any, any day. Any day, any day. That is absolutely gorgeous. The silver's coming out of here. That's beautiful. Morning, all. They're also oh. doing cereal advent calendars. Oh, oh well, Leah would I like that, make, wouldn't she? I could she? make my own for the kids because you know the little mini boxes. Mm -hmm. I could just put that in the you cupboard. Could, couldn't you? you? Just put a number on it. <laughs> I don't like it. It's a great idea. Um, 17 pounds 95 pence for your kind of that is absolutely gorgeous it's stuff, isn't it? Look at the beautiful and it's quality. From Nepal as well. I know, yeah. Literally uh, mined at the top of the world, the rooftops of the world. Isn't that incredible? This one here is like a like a bicolour, like the greeny. Oh yeah, it really is, isn't it? That's gorgeous. Well done, I everyone. A beautiful green kyanite. Oh, yeah. from here. it's beautiful, isn't it? I mean, it comes in green, it comes in blue. It also comes in like a lovely peachy colour as well. Oh, does it? Yeah. Uh, my favourite is is this blue. It's absolutely mm. gorgeous. Uh, absolutely amazing. Well done, everybody. For seventeen ninety five, that is gorgeous. Star by, it's time for the Sharite. This is your Sharite selection. It's absolutely incredible. Um, it's going to be a star by. Uh, we have got prices ranging from about £40 all the way down to £15. It is amazing. It's gorgeous. Shall we, shall we start? Shall we start with a star by thingy, thingy, thingy? Let's go. This is amazing. It is. That's a, that's a beautiful showcase of Shah, right? It really is. Because usually we see like one strand a month. We don't usually see that much of it, do we? No. He has raided the, uh, the Shah right cupboard. <laughs> Look at all of this. It's amazing stuff, isn't it? It's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? I love these strands. What a collection. Look at these ones here. What a collection. Huge these are, pieces. look at these. Oh, wow. Look at that. That is absolutely amazing. 
Where are we going to start, Lee Ham, with these bad boys? We're going to take these down to a brand new low. This incredible gemstone is so um, is so unusual. It forms um, in Russia, the only place in the world where it is from. It's quite often likened to Larimar because it is a one locational gemstone. Its actual structure, which is a mix of lots of different elements, it's very, very unusual to find all of them in one place, which is why you only get it from one. This is when you uh, uh, get it from uh, one place in the world. Absolutely incredible. Um, amazing. Uh, so your beautiful Sharite that you're going to be getting here all the way from um, the River Shah in Russia. Last time this came to air, it was at 49.95. Don't you love the inclusions? Yeah. Don't you love the patinations? Don't you love the character mm. this incredible gemstone has. It's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? I always think of this gemstone as a bit like a merge between a few gemstones. So you've got like yes. a, a beautiful pearlescence. And absolutely. then you've got some sort of like moonstone-y, like shiller within totally. there as yeah, well, with definitely. the mica that's in there. And then uh, the most beautiful purples. Yeah, absolutely. It is It is the most beautiful quality. We're at 49.95. Let's get that price point down even lower, shall we? Amazing, amazing, amazing deal for you today. Here we go. 38.95. That is a brand new low. We have absolutely smashed that previous closing price out. Look at these. The even the tiny oh, ones are full of character, aren't they? I think that's the most colour saturated strand I've ever seen. Yeah, absolutely. I'd be tempted to do a bit of pearl knotting just to do a yes, necklace, Liam, yeah. saying would be enough with a strand like this. Yeah. And keep that jewellery really, really simple. And I love the um, silver beads in between. And They're nice, aren't they? We've got some silver beads coming up on, on the Fleur Day. Oh, got some brand new, fantastic. Brand new silver beads, which would go beautifully with these kind of strands. Because again, oh, each one of those is a masterpiece by itself. Yeah, and it definitely. needs to be separated from the rest of them to yeah. show that masterpiece. Gorgeous. We are absolutely smashing these prices down today. This is the highest price of the Shah Right Showcase. But FYI. There's some really big pieces of yeah. Shah Right in that yep. bundle. Look at the size of these. These have got to be the same price or lower. They've got to be $38.95 or lower. Oh, look at Do you know what? It always oh, reminds me of those um, colours. Um, seraphonite as well. It's like a totally. purple seraphonite. Yeah. Now, seraphonite is a really interesting gemstone. It, again, forms um, uh, forms in Russia, but mm. beneath, a, uh, beneath a, uh, a frozen lake. And um, you have an amazing gemstone that has got these kind of, I mean, the name Seraphonite connecting mm. it with angels. And it looks like um, it looks like feathers inside a gemstone. Sharite shares a lot of similarities mm -hmm. with Seraphonite yeah. on that basis, doesn't yeah. it? Especially with the, the ones with the large surface area, you can really see those yeah. sort of like movements of colour. It almost looks like it's alive under the surface. Totally, yes. Like when you see water running under ice and it, it looks like it's yes. moving. Yes, That's yes, what it looks yes. like it constantly moves, but without the kind of like jazz oh, yeah. hands of Labradorite. Yes, you know, absolutely. It's, it's kind of a little bit more subdued but beautiful it is oh definitely it is it is it is i think one of the most beautiful gemstones on planet earth i've got 130 carats on this incredible strand this um one. yeah that one's stunning beautiful. isn't it look at that one i mean they're all absolutely beautiful but you know you'll find one that'll just catch your eye from a certain angle 29.95 wow. gosh that's a brilliant price don't you just love gemstones that you can actually see how it's formed yes absolutely you can see how you know where it would have formed and how it would have formed yes and definitely see all those different like striations within there and yeah. how the movement of it just moving a little bit oh wow gorgeous you'd never gorgeous, be able gorgeous, to recreate well anything done. like this would you you'd never be able to, i mean resin you can recreate swirls and things mm -hmm. like that but never anything as beautiful as this i mean yeah. mother nature is just amazing she is awesome isn't she well done everybody you know one in the center of a ring maybe yeah. gorgeous so the next strand has got to be the same price or less oh my gosh the big drops that i think that's everything that that's everything that um jara is it looks like mother of pearl mm -hmm. it looks like purple mother of pearl that is a statement pendant i would i mean Look if that was set that. into jewelry I would, I would not be expecting to see this for less than £100. Can I just say as well, when this incredible gemstone launched on uh, Gems TV or, or Gemporia a number of years ago, it was launched on a weekend 
and they had a special um, showcase, uh, which I think was on the Saturday. Every single piece, ev in every single design, sold out before the price point was bought on. Look at the one that's next to it. That literally looks like it's got a feather. The other side, that one. That looks like it's got a feather that's just oh going around. Oh my and gosh. Like giving it a hug. Yeah. Like an angel wing. You're absolutely right. It's absolutely beautiful. Do you know what would go really well with oh, this? And wow. I know that it was Oh, launched. look at that recording. I wasn't here when it was launched. I'm a little bit miffed. What? Lavender Jadeite. Oh, my Did you word. miss it as well? Yes. Yes. Well, I think well, I think we need to write a letter. Okay. Yeah, let's write, write a letter. A strongly worded email. A strongly worded but email. Because J um, Lavender Jadeite is called the angel stone mm. because it's the, it has the <gasps> most connotations for heaven and earth. That with this would just go absolutely beautiful. Amazing. Yes, I think you're absolutely right. £26.95. Well done, Collector in Lanarkshire. Janice in London. Well done to you, my lovelies. Just gorgeous. I, if you I mean, want, that on its own. Wow. If you want a gemstone that's really stand out oh, and really unique, I think definitely. you can't go wrong with Shara, can yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, I'd absolutely. And even the little ones, even, oh, even this one you know here. What? Look that's at all those gorgeous strations in that one there. Can you imagine making these little tops for them? Oh! So oh my word, definitely, yeah, gorgeous. So use your <gasps> copper, because obviously copper and purple, very regal. Yes, you know, very, very much regal so. looking colours. Oh, that's gorgeous. Well done, Karen in Dartmoor. Fantastic, well done. Okie dokie, let's do some pairs. Oh, is that some faceted ones Are they well? faceted or not? They are faceted. Ooh. Oh, let's have a look at these. Oh, oh, oh wow. Look at that. Oh, oh just, my gosh. Just beautiful. I've never yeah. seen faceted, oh, wow. actually. Hey? I've never seen faceted. I don't shelf. think I have um, either. It is a really unusual mm. um, thing to have, isn't it? Now, these are beautiful. They look like beautiful flowers, don't they? they oh, are they are stunning. gorgeous, aren't they? Yeah, look I at the gorgeous striations there. Dragonfly wings. Nice. Really yes. beautiful dragonfly wings with these. Oh, that's a really lovely idea. Or well, kind of like your flower fairy. Yes. Um, yeah. uh, wings, maybe. Yeah. 55 carats of Charite. Again, absolutely gorgeous quality. Go really nice really with the lovely. deal of the day, actually, this strand. Nice. Yeah, why not? Yeah, the, what, with the um, rose quartz yeah, the one. the rose quartz one, yeah. Yeah, really that's a nice feminine. idea. And again, wouldn't matter what colour metal you put with those, because they are... They're, they're not very strong, strong colours. Mm -hmm. You know, if you were to put something like the um, lapis in there, sometimes that's dictated then you need a strong like yeah. a gold to keep it rich. This silver, rose gold or gold would look beautiful. Yeah, definitely. You're absolutely right there. Well this done. Here, This has got like a pearlescence oh, all over stuff. the surface. Yeah, beautiful it's stuff. It's like a purple moonstone. That it is. It's, oh my gosh, you're absolutely right. Twenty four ninety five for you today. Well done. They are gorgeous, aren't they? Mm. You will want to get inside this gemstone. It is, it is, it is. You know the kind of gemstone you want to, uh, you want to uh, dive inside of. It's absolutely amazing, isn't it? Just gorgeous. Well done for twenty four ninety five. What a price point for you! Absolutely gorgeous. Well done. I think you know top drilled. If as you well. wanted to really um, mix it up a little bit to put it with the garnet, because you've got the the purple and the red together would look really nice together. Mm. But you know this, although it's quite a, a beautiful. Um, sleepy colour it will go yeah. against a really strong colour like the Absolutely, garnet as well yes. or equally with well, white pearls would be beautiful for sure for sure look at this one i've got more people coming through check your baskets out well done so this strand is coming up next it's got to be 24.95 or less it's crazy we're yeah we're, yeah we're currently on 55 carats we're now going to do these plain pairs Hang on. So this this strand is seventy four carats in size, right? Mm -hmm. This is almost twenty carats bigger, right? And it's got to be twenty four ninety five or less. Um, Liam, that that doesn't make a lot of sense. I'll be honest with you. Beautiful shower. Right? Look at that. Isn't it gorgeous? This one's like um, you know those licorice. Sweet, so you just get the, the purple with the licorice inside. Yes. So it reminds me of. It really is, isn't it? This shouldn't be going lower than $24.95, surely. $39.95 is your lowest price, really. That's where we should be going. That's where we should not be going below. Hmm. All the way down, it's almost 20 carats bigger than the previous strand. And look at this. 
I love the fact it's been unfastened. I like I like the smoothness. I like the fact you can really look into the gemstone mm -hmm. and you can see all those gorgeous inclusions inside the gem, all those different, all those different striations, which as Fleur quite rightly says, gives you a really like, a really good idea as to how this incredible gemstone forms. Yeah, back of that one there. Look at, Look at that. that. Just that hint of that, that swirl of purple yeah, that's coming beautiful, through. beautiful, isn't it? It's absolutely gorgeous. Collector, well done to you. Janice, well done to you. Sharite, a gem so never really knowingly, you know, going below kind of 30 pounds. No. Uh, we, are, we are really, really going as low as we possibly can today. So it's absolutely fantastic. And well I, done. I, I think this is almost like, you know, almost like your textbook. You know, because you've got all that big surface area. You yeah. Can, if you were to look at this in a textbook, you know, you'll see that kind of swirls yeah. and those beautiful markings within there. And this is what you're seeing on every single one of these strands. You're seeing those markings, that beautiful, like I say, that like mother of pearl almost. I it's would, mica, isn't it? The, is it yes, mica? yes, it will be the mica inside the gemstone. I would be using something like gallery wide just to give it a little Ooh, kind of coronet yes. around yeah. the top. Yeah. Um, and that for me would be enough of a... Uh, kind of like a regal look. Yeah. You don't want too much wire touching this gemstone. You don't want too much interfering with it because it is such a showcase. Right, which one's now? Right, this strand is gorgeous. There's, they've got this strand, sorry, they've, you've got this gemstone here. Now, this one here, I've got a favorite. This here looks, wow. like, a, looks like a pressed flower. Doesn't it? That one there looks oh, like wow, a pressed, yeah. a pressed flower. Do you know what these remind me of color-wise as well? A lot of pansies are kind of black yes. and purple, yeah. aren't they? Yeah, they are. They've got this really, really lovely. Look at this one with all these different fibers at, at different angles. A little bit like tourmaline. It's got these kind of tourmalated um, inclusions mm -hmm. running through it. They're really impressive. Oh wow, all over it. They're just gorgeous, I aren't they? I love the one in the middle, that, that again, that pearlescent sheen that goes, yes. that sort of like covers. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Beautifully polished as is... well, isn't it? You know, the, the sheen, yes. the, the polishing, because I think we forget about all the elements Definitely. that have to go into these yeah. gemstones before they can even be put onto this strand. Look at this one here, it's like a solid purple colour. It's absolutely gorgeous, like a solid purple gemstone. It's absolutely gorgeous. If we can get enough people with this in their baskets, we're going to do a clearance price on this. If we can get enough people with this in their baskets, this is going to be a clearance price. It should not be lower than $24.95. Should not be going any lower than $24.95. But if we can see enough people with this in their baskets, we're going to take it below 20 quid. I, I need to see you there. I have to see you there to warrant this incredible price point. Loads and loads and loads of people coming through. That's really great to see. I need to see more of you with this in your baskets. And if we see enough people, we will be taking this below 20 pounds. For sure, right. A gemstone, which is unusual to get it under kind of 39 uh, or 34.95. Loads of people there. Justin, Janice, Jane, Sarah, Jackie, Collector, Karen, Maureen. Well done. I can see loads of you there. This is great to see. We don't have loads of this available. Let's get it really, really low, shall we? All the way down. Losing a lot of money, honey. But do you know what? We're making friends. 19 pounds, 95 pence. That is amazing. That's what counts. You're absolutely right, Leeham. Friends. Yeah? Friends. Yeah, I mean, jewelry maker is going to be completely bankrupt, but we'll have loads of friends. Candy Lynn, just, well done um, to you as well, my lovelies. Just watch it, because I've only cut it with my shears. It's not being filed, not but just to, you know, to take a piece of copper just to oh emulate the shape. Just to put, put like, behind, behind oh. and just to sit it on there so that the copper then reflects oh, the purple words. back up onto it as well. It's oh. very rough cut, but you can see how it would but just... But it's absolutely gorgeous. How oh, just a little bit flirt. of wire that you would be able to just make <gasps> wire that onto there oh, with that copper. Oh, I love it. I think it's, it'd be a beautiful combination Wouldn't it of just? the two. You've got loads of people coming through to get this. Oh, do you know what? That looks amazing, Fleur. Oh, well done, everyone. Jane, Jacqueline, Melissa, Hayley, Coral, Lynn, well done to you as well. Karen, well done. Collector, oh, this is brilliant. What a fantastic strand. Well done, everyone. We're under 20 pounds. Well done. Um, actually, this was the dinner of the day. Sorry, I'm just, I'm just yeah. kind of... Yeah, you just trace round it and then cut round. Oh, my gosh. That dinner of the day is amazing. I've got 70 of today's dinner of the day. It's aquamarine kites. <whistles> Beautiful. Beautiful. So that's going to be coming up in, in about 10 minutes time. Wow. Last shot, right? 
They're not. I wouldn't call these that. I would take that off the dent. <laughs> I love the way you are totally regretting that yes, in yes, your voice. Yeah. They've got to go under twen under twen under twenty pounds. That's yes, like Lehan. That Ninety-five carats, Michael. The only one you need to be looking at is that one there. These are wow. perfect cufflinks. These are your cufflinks. Oh yes, all day long. How beautiful would they be? Uh, astonishing. Uh, astonishing. Uh, astonishing. <laughs> Amazing. Superb. Now, what did I say to you? What did I say to you during my Facebook Live today? What did I say to you first thing today? Charite ranging from about £40 down to about 15 quid. Okay, um, <clears throat> we've got to do it for 95 carats. Mm. 1495. Wow. These are not nuggets. They are individual yeah. pieces. They're individual pendants. They're cufflinks, as yeah. you say. Yeah. And they're absolutely amazing. Two, four, six, eight on the strand. 95 carats of charite between eight gemstones makes each one of these an absolute whopper. On that beautiful necklace you've made there, that lovely amethyst necklace, mm -hmm. I would be putting these charites kind yeah. of sporadically yes. throughout the necklace yeah. and, 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 you know, yeah. loving the effect of them. They would go beautifully together. One on a piece of flex right, you yeah. know, just one, you know, in the middle of a necklace. Absolutely gorgeous. How many of these do we have, um, Leham? 40 available. A load of people coming through to get these. Well done. 14.95. The colour on these, my word, they're absolutely stunning, aren't they? I would have a garnet bracelet with one of those just in the centre. <gasps> oh, that's a lovely idea. Here it is. Oh, wow. They are gorgeous. These should be disappearing. I don't know how we've got any of these left, actually. 14.95 for Charite. Oh, my word. Look it's almost 100 one carats. One. Look at that one. If you bubble wrapped that one so you can see the whole face of it, because you're looking at only the, the slimmest part of it. Yeah. That one on the end there, you've got all that movement and shift of colour and, and swirls that's Amazing. there. Amazing. Oh, look at that really lovely kind beautiful. of cloud formation you're getting there. Isn't it beautiful? It's the most gorgeous quality. Well done. Jacqueline, Wendy, Barbara, Collector, Collector, Linda. Oh, it's absolutely amazing. Look at that. Look at the beautiful... Sh oh, wow. Gorgeous. Well done. Don't miss out. Oh, that's this stunning. This one's got some reds in it as well. It, it really does. Has um, 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 It really does, doesn't it? Some beautiful reds. I love all this kind of fancy cutting. Gorgeous. I've got another star by coming up now. It's time for beautiful lapis. This is an amazing strand. These are real showcase lapis lazuli. <laughs> I've had an amazing stretch. Just give you that warning though. Don't give it, yeah, don't stretch too far, otherwise you, you do get cramp. You get cramp, and yeah, then that's do. it, spoil, spoil the stretch. Yeah, spoil the stretch. Thank you, Liam, that's enough from you. Right, so, this strand of lapis lazuli. Lapis lazuli, a gemstone pretty much worshipped by the ancient Egyptians. Mm. A gemstone of the pharaohs, a gemstone which is more than just a gemstone, a gemstone which is uh, more than just a gemstone. It, it surpasses gemstone notoriety. It is one of the most important, most prevalent gemstones in, in our world's history. It is absolutely... <laughs> Ooh, we've directed Claire! Get to Hello! Me. Hello! Oh my gosh. I, come, 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 on, come, on, come on, come on, come on, come on. How um, are you? How are you? I'm good, how are you? Oh, I'm good, thank my you. word, this is Claire back from her oh. travels. Oh, it's so good to see you, darling. How are you? I'm all right. Have you missed us? Oh, yeah, of course. But weird, but good? Yes. Yes. I think so. I'm not really sure what's going on this last week, to be honest. <laughs> You've been but, everywhere. Yeah. It's so good but, to see you. It's good to see you too. Oh. Yeah. It's going to be like you never left. I know it is. Back oh, where you belong in the See you in a bit, love. <laughs> um, you have got here. 
you have got here the most amazing strand of lapis lazuli, a gemstone which is um, known for its value, a gemstone which has been used and ground down to uh, making a pigment which um, helped to paint um, the ceiling of the Sistine Chapel. It was, yeah. yeah. A gemstone which was at the time um, the most expensive pigment the most is expensive pigment in the world to dye fabrics, to dye paint. It was shipped from uh, the Middle East over to uh, Europe um, and was the most expensive pigment you could get. Um, today, we are at this. 8 95 And as well, this is... This is like legitimate an artisan gemstone because totally. it's, it's from a very small region isn't it it you know, really it, is especially this one you know it's a and it can only be mined by hand because it yeah. is so isolated and yeah. remote when you think of when you think of those amazing um like the tutankhamun death mask that kind of yeah. thing you see that vivid blue and everybody used to think that it was like enamels or something of course like it that it was on there it's not it's, Lapis it's lazuli. This, just this gemstone that's yeah. given that beautiful and it's still that vivid blue now you see it in lots of artifacts in, in you really ancient do. egypt there's an, a new tutankhamun he's on tour he's on tour yeah he's tutankhamun's coming. on tour is it is it the sax gallery he's going to uh, yes it is yes. yeah yeah. And have you seen yesterday? I found out that there's a Troy exhibition at the British Museum. No. Starting next, not next week, the week after. No way. Until March, yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so that'll be amazing. Definitely going to have to go to yeah. that. That's going to be amazing. Eight ninety five today for your lapis lazuli. That's amazing. <laughs> oh dear me. Um, Do you know, I Fifty carats one. in total. I'm loving the the vibrancy of this blue because sometimes lapis can be darker. It absolutely can I be. I yeah. love this one. That's so 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 vibrant. Yeah, definitely. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Well done. Um, Eight ninety five. Well done. Yeah, Tutankhamun on tour, playing all the big uh, hits. <laughs> what like an Egyptian? The sand dance and many many more. The snake charmer. <laughs> hey, <laughs> did the snake charmer one? Snake charmer. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, well done, 8.95, fantastic, absolutely amazing. <laughs> Tutankhamu, oh, I keep spiking myself today with the temporary strands. Naughty little thinkers. So, deal of the day, deal of the day. Boom, boom. Thank you, Michael. Uh, did you have a nice little break, Michael? Yeah, it was grand. Thing. Did you do anything fun on your break? Uh, I called a friend. Called a friend? Aww. Oh, that's Dad. nice. What did you say to the friend? Oh, a friend in need. Oh. a bit of a... A bit of a laugh and a joke. Oh, yeah, that's, nice. that's good. Well done. That's a very good friend oh, thing to do, darling. Yes. So your good deed oh. for the day. Yes. Good deed for the day. So yeah, deed of the day coming up. Very excited about that. Yes, thank you. Oh, for goodness sake, Liam. Liam is really uh, discombobulated today, and he's cracking the whip. Rainbow moonstone graduated faceted nuggets. Here they are. Beautiful Shella. Look at those beauties. Oh, they're nice, aren't they? <gasps> oh. uh, right, what uh, what price do you reckon it's going to be today? Surely not. Yeah, eight ninety five. There you wow. go, everyone. Look lovely with the labradorite that we did earlier. You know the big chunks. Oh, the big rondos. chunks. Yes, yeah. of course they really would, wouldn't they? Or with, or with the um, lapis that we just done, because you've got yes. the blues coming through the rainbows. I like that idea. Guest designer Fleur Hastings strikes again. Still some of the multicolour tourmalines if you want to add those onto your order. I've got about I've got about five left if you want to add it onto your order. You're gonna be lucky to get that, Fleur. I'm gonna go in the break again. I didn't realise there's any left. Yeah. Your beautiful tourmaline five mil rounds that we took down to the amazing price of just $12.95. Absolutely superb. The best tourmaline. Gorgeous. Well done. Um, here's your uh, beautiful uh, rainbow uh, moonstone for just 8 95 Fantastic. Well done. Do not go anywhere because we've got your dinner of the day, which of course is the aquamarine and the rose quartz. I've got 70 of the aquamarine. They're all going to go. They're absolutely beautiful. Coming up in just a couple of seconds. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? 
You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Jewelry Maker course gift vouchers are now available. You can choose from a bronze, silver or gold voucher. Each voucher is worth a different amount that entitles you to book towards a course of your choice. For more information, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Hello everyone, hope you can join myself and presenter Eleanor this Tuesday for the morning show, the 5th of November, for the second part of my Symbols Findings launch. This amazing range of findings has really caught everyone's imagination. And this Tuesday is all about the super duos. So we've got four different colours, we have got six different findings, and would you believe it, 16 brand new super duo colours. So that's this Tuesday, the 5th of November, myself and Eleanor for the morning show from 8 a.m. We'll see you then. Are you new to Jewelry Maker? Shop with us for the first time and you'll receive a free gift. The free gift includes two beautiful gemstone strands in an organza bag, plus a DVD ideal for jewelry making newbies, featuring tutorials essential for getting started and so much more. As long as you qualify as a new customer and haven't shopped with us before, then your free gift will automatically be added to your order when you make your first purchase with us. It's really that simple. Gemstone strands are selected at random, so gemstone size, shape and colour will vary for each new customer. Why stop there? Once you receive your new free gift, we'd love to see what you create. Share your designs with us via our Facebook page and join our creative community of jewellery makers. Start your jewellery making journey with us today. Create. Wear. Share. Did you know, no matter how many times you purchase with Jewelry Maker in the same day, you'll only be charged one fee of postage and packaging. Select our standard delivery for just $3.95, or if you'd like to receive your goods sooner, upgrade to our premium option for $5.95. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. When the presenter informs you that the pre-order service is available on an item, this is your chance to pop it into your online basket or speak to one of our brilliant call centre team members and be one of the first to secure your purchase. You can watch our Jewellery Maker show every day on our website by clicking the Watch and Buy Online link in the top right hand corner of our homepage. Our Jewellery Maker community is a fantastic platform to share, learn, chat and make new friends. So why not like our Facebook page and join over 64,000 like-minded people. Move the chocolate out of the way. <laughs> Deal of the day. Deal of the day. Oh, oh. This is off. Got amazing. To Deal of the day. Hey. And after the, you got to do Deal of the day again. Okay. Deal of the day. 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 Boom. Oh. There we go. So Deal of the day today. It's wonderful. Ah. But. But. And it's a but, and I don't like doing, I don't like, I don't like bringing you, I don't like being the bearer of bad news. It's beautiful. We love you. It's an amazing price. It is. But, 70 available. That is it. 70. 
I'm sorry, you know, I, uh, they are not going to be available this evening. Mm -hmm. uh, but, uh, to all intents and purposes, they're, gonna, they're not going to make it t through the next kind of um, five minutes or so. They will have completely sold out. This is a strand of aquamarine kites. Look at that colour. Consider there's only 70. Consider how quickly these are going to go. Your minute clock starts now. Do you know what this colour reminds me of? What does it remind you of? Kingfisher blue jadeite. Oh. Because you've got that bluish with that tint <clears throat> of green there as well. Like a kingfisher cut. It's absolutely beautiful. Oh, wow. Especially this one. That one there. I would pay the whole, for the whole strand for that one there. Now this one here, that one. It is stunning, isn't it? It is absolutely beautiful. I like the fact that they're not three-dimensional kites. Mm. I like the fact that they're flat on the back because of course they're going to sit nice and flat. They're, they're, they're basically cabochons with a drill hole at the top. So mm. if you, you can use them as cabochons which they would look stunning. The copper sheet kind of idea that you came up with earlier on, I love. I love that idea. Yeah, with a copper. Look at that. Underneath. Look at that, for goodness sake. That is absolutely... Can you imagine a whole necklace yeah. made with stuff like and that? And with the copper sheet that was in the kits, you'd be able to do both strands like that and oh more. Oh, my gosh. I've left copper left over. 70 available. These are all ready starting to allocate. It's no great surprise. You are getting genuine aquamarine from Brazil, 95 carats. Now, can I just say, normally the big, big, big carat weights of aquamarine come from South Africa. You are getting these enormous carat weights today from Brazil, making these very, very, um, uh, making these very, very special indeed. Um, you've got two, four, six, eight, nine on the strand. I love the way these look. I love the way these sit. I would have to mix these up with, yes, the rose quartz. I'd have to mix them up with the tourmaline as well that we did earlier on. Oh, my gosh. With jadeite, I would yes. oh, yeah. I would love to put these with jadeite. They yeah. are stunning, aren't they? Yeah, they are. They're absolutely beautiful. They are. They're so unusual. I mean, you have had kite shapes before, but they've been drilled the other way around. Yes, so absolutely. So they've gone yeah. through the widest part of the kite. Yeah. And I love this. this. This, to me, is a very art deco Oh, definitely, yes. With those beautiful angles that are in there. Or they've either been completely flat or they've been completely three-dimensional, mm -hmm. so they would roll. Mm -hmm. What's nice about these is they're flat on the back, they're rounded on mm -hmm. the front, so they have that lovely bit of luster as the light bends across the top of the gemstone. But they're also going to sit nice and flat against your decolletage. Loads of people coming through for these. Um, the jewellery that our in-house designers have made... The pendant and earring set that have been made here, I love the fact we put it with gold, but the, um, but the pendant and earring set that you've got here, I mean, that's got to be 50, 50 60 pounds worth mm. of jewellery right there. Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? It is, yeah, it's beautiful. Like you say, you, you know, you've used one, and yes. like a pair in yes. the earrings. Yes, it's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? Say you sold those for fifty pounds. You would, you could, you could, you could pretty much make, you could pretty much make three suites of jewellery like that using one strand, and you'll be selling the jewellery for in excess of, um, you know, in one hundred and fifty pounds. The price of the entire strand today, forty two ninety five, but that's not your deal of the day price. Now Fleur is, um, is can desperate. I borrow the rose quartz one? I just want to see if yes, something will work. Yes, of course work. you can. Because I'm thinking mm. maybe you could make a base for this and have it as a collar so you would bead where the beading thread is now, yeah. but then put some wire behind it and sort of like encapsulate the beads going underneath as well so that it would really fan out into that's like an Egyptian a style idea. collar. Yes, that's and then a just really sort of fill nice it in with idea. seed beads or mm. wire just to fill in the, the areas around in between each uh -huh. one and have it as like one big collar piece because that would look. Why not? Amazing. We're at forty-two ninety-five. The price is nowhere near where we are. How about buy one, get one free with a bit of money saved as well? No. Nineteen 
95. Wow. I have 70 available. They are all going to go. Well done, everyone. That is absolutely your final prize. Um, How many carrots did you say in each one? Roughly uh, was nine? A, ten. Ab about 10 and a half carrots per gemstone. And it's natural as well, Flo, which makes it mm. even more better, doesn't it? It, it, it makes it, it even better. You know, the fact that they're all completely natural. They're not filled, they're not dyed, they're not heated. They're all completely natural. Jackie, Sally, Linda, Sheila, Margaret, Melissa, Cheryl's got two, Linda, Anne in beading, um, Anne, our uh, beading buddy, well done to you, anonymous bidders collector in Kent, collector in West Midlands, collector in East Lothian, collector in Leicestershire, um, uh, Christine, well done to you as well. I have got so many people coming through to get this. That is absolutely amazing. Rebecca, Karen, Ella, Collector in Leicestershire, Collector in Lanarkshire, well done, oh my word, you are flying through to get this, Collector in Gloucestershire, well done to you as well, um, oh my word, there's so many, uh, Jane in Essex, Helen Joanne, well done to you as well, Rebecca in Essex, well done to you as well, more people coming through, more collectors coming through in, um, in Essex, East Lothian, well done in West Midlands, well done to you as well, another collector coming through, Linda, well done to you in the West Midlands. I've got loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of people coming through to get that, that's amazing. I wouldn't be shocked if I saw five mil rounds for that price yeah definitely but the fact yeah. that these are cut and graduated into these amazing shapes I mean, because obviously mm. a round is a little bit more easier because of it's, course it's, you know it, it can be done easier mm. these have not only got those beautiful shapes but they've got like that cabbage on top like you say yeah. they're, they're absolutely beautiful and they're yeah, polished stunning. i i watched a a little video on how gemstones are polished and I was amazed at the diff like when we polish metal mm. we go through different grits and of course. to get to the final these have had the same yeah, process. It's definitely. not just a quick no. <laughs> rub with the cloth and there you go. Yes, yeah, exactly. they, These have actually been polished like metal. Yes, yes, it yes. It must take me. hours and hours to get um, a strand, you know, ready for for sale. I, I, absolutely, and I would definitely be putting these with the tourmaline. Uh, I've got, I think I've got two of the tourmaline left. If you want to add it onto your order, Alison's got two. Collector and Gloucestershire's got two. K Angela, well done to you. Collector Leslie Jane, collector, collector. Oh my word, so many collectors. If you don't check out, you are going to miss out now. Well done to everyone. Collector in Essex, well done to you as well. More people coming through. Merseyside, well done to you as well. Yorkshire, South Yorkshire, that's great. Well done. But please, please, please do check out. That is absolutely amazing. What a, a ring. Beautiful ring. Yeah, I like that idea actually. I think that's a lovely idea. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. That that. Yeah, beautiful ring. What a statement that with gallery wire, I would use this with gallery wire because the gallery wire prongs will cover that top drill hole anyway. Yeah. And because you've got an opaque gemstone there, you can't see the drill hole anyway. So it doesn't matter that the drill hole is, you know, is there. It will co be completely covered. If you wanted to make it into a wire work, when you, as Claire and all the other wire workers will tell you, that drill hole's there for stability. Yes, of course. If you need it. Yeah, absolutely. That's amazing, isn't it? Sandra, Collector in Essex, Angela, well done to you as well. More people coming through. That's great. Well done. We're under twenty pounds. They are absolutely. I think that's superb. a steal of the day. That really do think that's a steal of the day. It really is a steal of the day, isn't Not it? Not a deal it's completely of the day. Natural aquamarine. Yeah. Ninety-five carats in total. You could see bead around it if you wanted to. That's a really nice way of setting with it. And um, I, I do like um, the idea of setting it with this copper sheet, though. Yeah. The copper sheet that we did earlier on in those gorgeous kits. This is. Look at this. Look at the border around these. Isn't that gorgeous? Hang on. Look at that. Look at the gorgeous border around them. They're beautiful, aren't they? You could literally just glue that on there, couldn't you, if you wanted yeah. to? Yeah. Nothing, uh, nothing to stop you doing that. Gorgeous, well done. More, more people coming through. That's really, really fantastic. Do you know what I well love done. about this strand as well? It shows you those different chemicals that go into this because yeah. you've got the ferric and the ferrous acid, I mean, Absolutely. The, the, the iron, so you can see the blues and the greens. It's aquamarine, people always think that it's watery blue. Yeah. And it's not. It can, you can get cloudy aquamarine, of course you can get you green can. aquamarine. Of course you this can. This is that kind of happy medium, I mm. think, between those two. Yeah, definitely. It's absolutely beautiful. If you like gemstones with interest, this is the one for you. Well done, Helen. Well done, MC as well. More people coming through. That's fantastic. Well done. They're gorgeous, aren't they? We're at 19.95. So many people think that these are absolutely gorgeous, and I'm so glad that you agree with us. Um, uh, believe you and I, you are you are not on your own. They're absolutely gorgeous, aren't they? Well done. I've got loads of people with us in their baskets. Please check your baskets out, everybody. There's a small. I mean, I've got a few a few people still coming through on the phone lines. A, sm a tiny, tiny, tiny queue. Denise, why don't you just checked out on the phone lines? That's great to see. Well done. Maria's just checked out on the phone lines. Well done, my lovely. 
absolutely fantastic we've got the rose quartz version coming up in just a couple of seconds as well that's really exciting but on the whole <laughs> an absolute steal of a deal that is absolutely gorgeous I don't know where else you'd be able to get a deal like this I honestly don't think there's anywhere else you could get a deal like that that is absolutely beautiful that's amazing and Liam said, uh, if you do know anywhere that else where, uh, anywhere else where you can get a deal like this, uh, do let Liam know because he will eat his hat. What hat are we talking about? A party hat? A cap? A beanie. A beanie? A chocolate hat? Is there such thing as a chocolate hat? I reckon I could fashion you a, ha a, um, a ham hat. A hat made out of a pack of wafer thin ham. What do you reckon, Michael? Hang on. I reckon I could. I'd get a pack of a family pack of ham, and I'd uh, and I'd stitch it together maybe with some cooked spaghetti, and then you could eat that, couldn't he? No. No. It'd be a bit flat, like my hair. Flat. <laughs> what, a, bit of flat a flat ham hat. And it'd be absolutely amazing. <laughs> Leslie's messaging. Wowie, wowie, wowie. Uh, got the tourmaline and the aquamarine. Oh, Leslie. Oh. oh, Leslie. Leslie, are you going to get the rose quartz? Are you going to make it a? Uh, are you going to make it a hat trick? If you Why not? A ring, hey? If it's pointing towards you, it means you have got a kite. Yeah. If it's pointing away from you, it means you haven't got a kite. A kite. Hmm. Oh yes, if you're taken or not oh, taken, yeah. could you do it with the kite? Yes, I have a kite or what? Well, mind you, it's not the kind of thing people. It's not the kind of thing people get kind of upset about. You could just ask them whether they've got a kite. So if you've got a kite, what are you doing, Flair? Well, I've just taken the um, the flower bit, out of the one that we made as a demo, and I'm just they're too tightly packed on there, Placing but it would it. fit. It would fit within there mm. beautifully. Cut it up if you want to. Oh, oh gosh, you don't have to ask her twice, do you? Gee whiz, like a rat up a drain pipe. <laughs> Gee whiz, it's mine now, it's my strand now. So let's do the rose quartz now. Why don't you, uh, shy, oh my word, Shyamala. 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 Oh no, it's Shyamala. Oh. It's Shyamala. Shyamala? Yeah, Shyamala's lovely. What a lovely name. A beautiful she is. Is she? Yes, yeah, Beautiful is. she is. Beautiful she is. Uh, well done, everyone. Awesome. <laughs> I took one off and then right. I just crimped the end. Thank you. Okie dokie, pig and a pokey. 115 carats, so even more here. Two, four, six, eight, ten. There's 11 on this strand, including the one that Fleur has nicked off there. Yeah, I've just got one here. Oh, that's nice wire. What colour is that? Rose gold plated. Oh my gosh, you... Where do you find that? In my bag. <laughs> Jeez. I may have taken it out of the... Um... So earlier on, if you were watching, you'd be able to get the tourmaline and the rose quartz for under £30. I still don't think that, that we can do this. The tourmaline was £12.95. What, uh, what do you mean, we can't, Liam? No, 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 no. You said we can't. What is... You really need to think about these things before you tell them to us, mate, because if you don't... No, seriously, if we're not allowed to, it's a brand new strand. If we're not allowed to, we can't. We can't do it. Well, Liam said, well, we are. He's kicking off in there. You're going to avoid management, what, for the rest of your life? He doesn't even care. Look at him. I don't know what, I'd, oh, he's hiding. You, you do realise you are on camera there. You, you were being filmed then. He's just, he just loves it, doesn't he, old Liam? Right, should we take the price point down? That means you're gonna be able to get the rose quartz and the tourmaline for under 30 pounds. So we've got to go low. Amazing, here we go. 14.95, wow. really brand good. new. That is fantastic. Brand new strut. Brand new strut. Double <laughs> Look at that. Oh my gosh, Flo, I love that. So that's one of the smallest ones. So I'd use one of the larger ones so it's sat a little bit lower down. Yes, please. Amazing. Incredible. There you go. That's your beautiful rose quartz 
inside that beautiful piece of um, uh, metal uh, um, uh, copper sheet. Absolutely gorgeous. Well done. $14.95. That's a brilliant deal. Well done. I would definitely be getting the tourmaline as well if there's any left. In fact, the tourmaline might have completely sold out, actually. I don't know. Uh, well done to Winifred. Uh, well done to Helen Joanne. Well done to uh, Linda and Melissa and Collector and Sally and Kay and Jackie. Jackie! Well done to Linda and Rebecca and Collector and Maureen and Madeline and uh, loads of you. Well done. Oh my goodness me, <laughs> you're doing absolutely brilliantly. Well done, everybody. That's absolutely tremendous, isn't it? Jennifer had a bad and a bad bad. I was just to that album yesterday. Really? It's a good, uh, it's a good. Beautiful South. South. Beautiful South. But I wasn't, I was listening to Paul Heaton's greatest hits. So Paul Heaton, was, then what's her name? It was, um, what's her name? Oh, I, don't, I, I, I don't know her name. I wouldn't know it. I don't think. I can't remember what her name is. Can't remember. Uh, but yeah, anyway, uh, fourteen ninety five for your gorgeous uh, rose quartz version, and everything that we've been saying, like wearing them in a ring, mm -hmm. um, uh, gluing them onto your um, uh, gluing them onto your um, uh, metal sheet, also making them into that Art Deco design. I really yeah. like that idea. I think that would look, that would go really well. Really, that'd well. be really really lovely, wouldn't it? Gorgeous. Well done, everybody. Stunning. Sorry, say that again, lovely. Multicolour opal. Oh, yeah. Ten oh. minutes time. I was looking at that. I didn't realise that was opal. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Beautiful. It's beautiful, isn't it? Mm. Okay. Beautiful. Ten minutes time. And then we've got the appetite coming up at 12.45. Oh, no. 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock, okay, and we've also got coming up at 12.45, so this is 12 o'clock, multicolour appetite. Just about to, just about to. So there's your appetite, okay, and then we've got the garnet coming up. Sorry, I was holding that in a rather, uh, yeah. Uh, so then we've got the beautiful garnet coming up at 12.45. Can I quickly show something as well and say thank you? Yes! To, is it Katie Reed's yeah. mum? Yeah, yeah. Katie Reed's mum made us all one of these little bags. Look how gorgeous they are. And inside, I did have to eat the sweets because they were branded. Ah. Oh, no. But look, tissue holders. Oh, well. that's adorable. The little tissues. Isn't it absolutely gorgeous? And it says, look, handmade with love. Oh, my gosh. That's really Isn't sweet. Isn't it beautiful? Yeah. It's really, really gorgeous. They're really So lovely. thank you so much. It's so thoughtful, so beautiful. Mm. So Never. Liam has decided, and he keeps harping on about this, and I'm interested to see what he's actually going to come out with, so I've got no idea what, what he's about to say. He said, for the, also, for the last hour, everything is now on. Oh. Really? The more interest that you show for everything coming up in the 12 o'clock hour... Really? If you put it all on pre-order? Oh, my gosh, what have you done? What? Oh, what have you done? <laughs> he's an animal. Oh, oh, I like those. Oh, what's that? Oh, I like oh. that. No, it's Bohemian that... cotton cord. Oh. oh, no, don't install an update. I don't want that. The whole of the hour is on pre-order. That's amazing. What's that one there? With the, that one there? That? that? Fossil Jasper. Black oh. Fossil Jasper. Oh, my gosh, that's gorgeous. Ooh. Oh. Was that another tourmaline strand as well? Opposite uh, it? The, one, the third one along, by either side that, that one. What's that? Multicolour fluorite. Oh, that's lovely. Put those in your baskets, please, so I can see them. <laughs> yeah. He has gone completely. Uh, Dalmatian Jasper, Sapphire, Kambaba Jasper. Um, wow. Gorgeous kit, clear quartz, seed beads. What's that? Coated polychrome sage citrus fire polish beads. Oh my word, that sounds delicious. I like that cord. The cord's nice, isn't yes, it? Yes, me too. Really it's beautiful, nice. isn't it? Really beautiful Bohemian cord. cord. Or everything for the 12 o'clock hour is on pre-order. And the more interests that we see, that we have, are the ones that we're going to be playing. So there we go. Fill your boots. If there's no interest, then we won't play them. We'll just sit here in silence for the last hour <laughs> of the show, OK? Lovely. My uh, school teacher used to make us do that. Hmm? She used to make us do that one. Miss Wright. Miss Wright. Sit there. Yes. Sit there the whole time in silence, because if I was wasting her time, she was going to waste mine. Wonderful. Were her words. <laughs> right, uh, Lee Ham. <clears throat> yes, we can. Perfect match for the deal of the day. Oh, my <gasps> gosh. Wow. Oh, it's a double doubler, trubler. Can you remember the um, chandelier that I made on the chainmail products? I can. 
Wouldn't these be amazing? Yes, they would. Oh my word. I'm gonna find a from the chandelier. She's called Sia because she can't see her because of that big fringe. Because of the big fringe. I love her voice. She has got a beautiful voice. Mm. She's a bit weird though. Did you hear all of that? Did everyone hear all of that? I hope so. I, I heard every note, Carol. Every uh, note. I heard every note. Me and Michael heard every ah! note. Every note of the one. Other than the right ones. Perfect <laughs> deal of the day match. 198 carats of clear quartz. Gee, willikers, that is a big carrot weight. Look at the rainbow on the bottom one. See the rainbows? Oh my word. Yeah, it is like a. There should be £49.90 together. Mate, you can't even. What's wrong with you? He's like a child that's had a few too many sweets. I think he has. How many, how many sugars have you had today, Lovely? Oh. <laughs> okay, so these should be £49.90 all together, making them about 25 quid each, okay? How about you pay for one? You get one for a fiver. Yes. yes. Go on then, Lee Ham. That sounds, that sounds absolutely brilliant. Here we go. 29 95 That is a bargain, and that what is. What you need to do with them is you need to wire wrap them and pop them on your Christmas tree behind your fairy lights. Oh, my word. That's a lovely idea. Because they would look amazing. Idea. Yeah. And then use them as earrings afterwards. Yes. Pop them in your window. Pop it. Oh, I don't you love them? Look at the size of them. They're enormous, aren't they? They're absolutely love incredible. This one. That one. What are you laughing at, Liam? He's gone. Oh, what's wrong with him? Can't, can't you mute Carol's mic when she starts singing? She's got a wonderful voice. Charlie, keep your thoughts to yourself, I think, love. Do you right. know what happens to your voice? Jewel box heaven. Do you know when we show some gemstones and we say it's not as good on the camera as it is in real life? Yes. She's got the voice of an angel. In Carol, the studio. all my dogs are tilting their heads when you started singing. Now I have two crying at the TV. Well, that you've got highly strung dogs. <laughs> Carol, right. Carol, my ears are bleeding. Well, you've got very weak ears. <laughs> I'm, here to... I'm gonna sing from the chandelier. From the chandelier. <laughs> Carol, we love you, but I've now got every dog on Dartmoor in Buckyard and probably a few sheep too. <laughs> oh, sorry. Hashtag sorry, not sorry. Uh, well done, everyone. Twenty nine ninety five. Collector Cheryl, Maureen, Melissa, Leslie, Kirsten, Julie. All right, Liam. Isn't that funny, mate? You have the voice of an angel. Thanks, love. Good face for radio, as my dad would say. <laughs> He's nice, isn't he? Lovely. Big Dave. Uh, right, let's move on. Let's do number six. Ooh, 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 <gasps> ooh, ah! Oh, where have these been hiding? I, I don't know. any of these. I want these. These I want are these. beautiful. Pearl-coated chalcedony. These are awesome. Oh, they're like pendulums, aren't they? They're absolutely incredible. They're gorgeous, aren't they? They're absolutely gorgeous, aren't they? Look at that. Oh, they've got that beautiful pearlescent coating on. Oh, now Fleur, what would you do? Oh, she's having a sip, hang on. <laughs> what would you do with these, darling? Hmm? What would you do with these? Oh, gosh. Uh, hmm? I'd have them as pendants. Would you? Yeah, and long, like, nearly a metre's worth of chain. Oh, yes, that sounds great. I love that thought. Oh, that just, they, yeah, that is just, they, they are so beautiful and long, aren't they? They're absolutely gorgeous. Look at the big, long quality on there. How many facets do you reckon it's got, Fleur? <laughs> oh, I was trying to catch her again before she had a quick What's sip of her that? coffee. Uh, well done. somebody else's coffee. Oh, you got someone else's <laughs> coffee? <laughs> oh, what's Neary made? Oh, right. There you go. Uh, so a pack of two of these today. What's the price, Liam? Gee whiz. Wow. Get on with it, Liam. Here's your price. Gee whiz. 
twelve ninety five. They're absolutely. Oh, beautiful. look at that! What was that? Sorry, L. Lovely L. Don't listen to them, Carol. You gently lulled my baby to sleep with that hauntingly beautiful voice of yours. Ha ha. Hauntingly. Well, I would I would say Kate Bush has got a haunting she voice. She has got a haunting and voice. And I love Kate Bush. Yes. So Enya. Hmm? Enya. Enya. Send away, send away, send away. Who else has got the haunted like, man? Haunting. One as well, well done everyone. Loads of people there. Who's the lady that sang the yeah. rugby world cup? She's got quite a haunting voice as well. I don't Is it know. Kiri Kerry Ticana well? Yes. Yes. Uh, Carrie Tikanawa, she's amazing. Uh, she's from New Zealand, isn't she? What's this? Oh, wrong one. Is this Jadeite? <laughs> oh. Ooh la la. Oh, I think they'll have to put this with the deal of the deal day. Deal of the day, deal of the day. Boo, boo. Definitely with today's deal of the days. Deals of our days, deals of our lives. That looks of course it works, Liam. He says that looks really nice in a surprised way. Of course it looks great. Look at this one here. Look at the clarity on that one there. Gee whiz. Um, yeah, look at the go gorgeous clarity. They're beautiful, aren't they? Well done, everyone. <laughs> Excuse me. Beautiful quality. Well done, everybody. Call us now when you... Uh, I'll tell you what they go well with size-wise as well. They look exactly the same size as that beautiful Labradorite we did earlier yes, on. Yes, they would. They go beautiful. Oh, that. my word. Don't you love all these different... It's a whole journey of aquamarine here. <laughs> you can get these and the deal of the day for under 35 quid. Oh. That's amazing. Well done. £12.95 for those. Oh, that's a gorgeous yeah, strand. It's my birth gemstone, and I used to get really disheartened because, obviously, when you think of opal, they've got so many different opals. Yeah. I used to say, all I've got is, like, a, a nice sparkly blue stone. But then when you see how aquamarine can look... Oh, gosh, ..from yeah. either different locations... Definitely. ..or different sort of, like, elements that have been, you know, that have been there when it's formed... Absolutely. It's, it's a beautiful... Beautiful gemstone. That's a really great price as well. Twelve ninety five. It's a proper, proper bargain. That, that is well nice done, everyone. That would go nice with the um, rose quartz as well. Do of course, yes, quartz of course, one? it will go with the rose quartz. Of course, it will. Of course <laughs> it will. There we go. Well done. Well, have we got Ollie back, have we? Oh, well, that's nice to see. Oh, lovely. There we go. Look at We're those. Having like Ooh. a whistle stop tour of directors. We have, haven't we? Everything from the twelve o'clock hours now on pre order, and the more people who get involved on pre orders the more items we'll play. If, um, if no one comes Carol in for sing. anything, then we're just going to sit here in silence for the last hour, OK? No, you could sing. You could do renditions. Or I could sing. Yes, if you don't come in through and get things on pre-order, <laughs> I will just sing for the final hour. Christmas carols. Carol's greatest hits. Yes. Which include, uh, I've got a lovely bunch of coconuts. Deck the halls. Deck the halls. And also... Um, What's the one where she goes really high? Loving you is That's easy because it. it's beautiful. That's Because you're beautiful, one. whatever it is. Yeah. Don't know who sang her. <laughs> la, la, la. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Do it. No, definitely not. Well done, everyone. La, 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 la. <laughs> oh, Michael. Squeaky chair. Were you having to... Uh, <laughs> you having to... Yeah. Okay. Look at her. <laughs> Oh, look at these. I yeah, want nice. these. I love them. These are like, do you know when you see Herkimer quartz and it has the double points? It's double terminated, yeah. yeah. We had some that's... Herkimer quartz earlier on. Were you not on the show? No. It was only 8 o'clock hour, oh, I think, right. yeah. But that's, yeah. that reminds me of these. Yeah, it really is like Herkimer quartz, isn't it? They're like beautiful pencils. They're what gorgeous, aren't they? You have any breakfast? Your crisps? Yeah, because I that... forgot my breakfast. Oh, mate. I had to take Neve to the yard at half past six this morning because she's got yard duty at college and her friend was picking up at quarter to seven. Oh. Hence why my hair looks a mess because oh, I didn't have time. Oh, dude. Uh, well done. <laughs> uh, clear quartz graduated faceted centre drill double terminated uh, points. Gorgeous. Um, beautiful. Look at that. Oh, my word. I would want them all wire wrapped so they're all yeah. kind of pointing different directions. Isn't that gorgeous? No way, that's a brilliant wow. price. Here we go, all the way down, everyone. Fourteen ninety-five. We need more. And they're great for spinning. I've got 24 available. Oh, I love them. Give them a bit of a, a spinneroonie. 
They're gorgeous, aren't they? Beautiful. I would have it in the window. Yeah, oh, oh without a shadow of a doubt, yeah. And if you loosely put them on to some, something that flex right above a radiator so the heat will turn <gasps> the them. The heat will turn them, yes, of course. And then you'll get rainbows all over your room. Just make sure when you go out that you take it down, though, because you don't yes. want to uh, yeah, no, concentrate any that. rainbows and start any fires. <laughs> Gorgeous. Here we go. This is from Annette. Carol, I'd love you to sing the Donna Summer part of her debut with Barbara Streisand. Oh, oh I saw her duet. Uh, enough is enough. I can do the first bit. You could do the second bit. Well, all I know is enough is enough. Enough is enough is enough. I can go on. I can go on. You don't know it. It's raining. It's boring. That's how it starts. Oh, I didn't know. Okay. Yeah. That's Barbara oh, Streisand, thought... and then Donna didn't... Summer comes in and but does didn't the Didn't Didn't Donna... Donna? 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 Donna Summer do... Um, I Feel Love. Yes, she did. I feel love. I feel love. 14.95, well done, everybody. Yeah, you're channeling some sort of like inner Scylla as well then. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, You definitely. were channeling the inner... Oh, Scylla Black, the most amazing Black. voice. She did have a beautiful voice. Step inside, love. I love that song. Uh, hi, all. I heard some howling. Have you got Chrissy in the dog? Uh, Chrissy the dog with you? No, that was um, that was Michael singing. <laughs> Ooh, burns. Well done, everyone. I ain't taking that. <laughs> right, what are we doing now, love? Come on. Yeah, come on, let's do it. Twelve. Here we go. Look at this bundle. Bundle, bundle, bundleicious. So this here is we your go. Marla. This is a Marla. Marla, bundle. Marla, Marla. Uh, so a Marla necklace is uh, similar to a rosary yeah, yeah, bead like, yeah, design. Yeah, 108 beads um, knotted together with mm -hmm. marker beads and a guru bead, but you need 108 beads. Mm -hmm. Because these are 8 mil rounds, or faceted rounds, mm -hmm. you're going to get over 108 on those three strands. Oh, definitely. They're lovely, really lovely kind of black grape colour, aren't they? They're gorgeous. All completely natural, all the way from Brazil, really? They look like Zambian amethyst to me, but anyway... Anyway, they're going to be yours today for $24.95. What? Each strand? Each strand, $24.95. For all three? All three? Wow. $24.95 for all three of them. That's amazing. That's just over £8 a strand. Absolutely incredible. Triple, treble deal for your beautiful amethyst. Well done, everyone. Oh, that's a great deal, isn't it? Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Well done. I, th I, th I think that's amazing. Twenty four mm. twenty four ninety five for three is amazing. You well, think about what a popular and useful gemstone amethyst is as well. Fleur. If you did six stretchy bracelets and sold them at fifteen pounds each. Oh my God! You see what six fifteen? Gee whiz! Six fifteen. Six times ten is sixty. It's going to be about. Oh, look at you, human abacus. <laughs> oh, you got a calculator. Okay, memory wire bracelets. Ollie, Ollie, yeah, but well, Ollie is uh, a bright spark. Well, no, it's just that I, no, no, Liam, don't get me wrong. You used a calculator to work out kind of how many ear pairs of earrings you could make from like, I don't know, 20, do 20 not... gemstones. <laughs> so I, I'm not going to expect you to know. But yeah. we, we do get lazy though, don't we, with maths and writing. Totally. You, know, you, you have to try and hand write yeah. something. Your hand gets cramped straight and you yeah, your definitely. hand writing goes rubbish. <laughs> Go on then, Michael. Liam also thought that um, Wolverine was played by Phil Jackman. <laughs> Phil Jackman? <laughs> Phil Jackman. You thought Wolverine was played by a man called Phil Jackman. Who's Phil Jackman? No one Does he even Jackman. exist? <laughs> oh, Phil. Phil Jackman. <laughs> well done, everyone. 24.95. I can see there's like, going to be some Liam-isms. 15, did you down. say? Okay, all right. <laughs> Star by coming up on the Opal. I have to say, opal, as you said earlier when it comes in all colours of the rainbow, multicolour opal, this is an absolutely gorgeous strand, isn't it? It works really nicely together. Mm. So you've got like those beautiful, um, like, I see, I would, when they're next to that that kind of really, really nice um, neon -y colour, they mm. look almost like storm grey. But when you take them away, they'll be mm. beautiful blue. Yeah, they really will be, won't they? 
You get this lovely kind of china blue, then you get the more kind of vivid blues and the sky blues. They are absolutely gorgeous. And when when you're doing um, when you're doing your craft stores, you'll quite often find there'll be certain there'll, there'll be certain colours which will go more. Uh, which will sell more readily than other colours um, of jewellery. And those colours tend to be purple, greens and blues. Every shade of blue um, uh, um, has something different to offer. I love it with today's deal of the day, of which there are about 20 chances left for your deal of the day. Very, very, very limited. Uh, yeah, absolutely gorgeous. You've also got coming up, can I show you, in about 20 minutes, this amazing opportunity for appetite. Yeah. It is absolutely stunning. It's just so, it's so bright, it's so beautiful. It's on pre-order right now if you wanna add it onto your order. Okay, so you've got the opportunity to come through and get uh, this incredible strand, which will go with so much that we've already bought you today. Also, it looks great with the copper. You know, we mm. bought you the copper sheet today. It looks amazing mm. alongside copper. It's got that lovely, um, it's got that lovely um, uh, kind of contrast between the warmth and the mm. and the coolness of the blue. And um, so we're at nineteen pounds ninety five pence. Absolutely amazing. And we should never be taking it lower than nineteen ninety five. However. However, it is jewellery maker. We are going to be bringing you the best possible price today. Let's get that price point down a little bit more for you. You've got Namibian, Australian, and Peruvian opal. Ooh. Three different, no, not even just three different locations, three different continents. The Australasia, um, South America, and of course, um, uh, Africa. That's amazing. The logistics of getting all of those together. <laughs> You're absolutely right, yeah. That's incredible. It is incredible, isn't it? Yeah, and then we bring it to you for less than a tenner. That's amazing. Nine ninety five for you today. Well done. From three different continents, you've got the most amazing um, um, uh, um, uh, multicolour opal graduated faceted rondelles. Look at this Just one beautiful. here. This one's like a, it's alive. That's beautiful. Yeah, they are that amazing, one. aren't they? Yeah. You're right, it is well, completely aligned, it's beautiful, beautiful isn't that it? that one is just, that stand out, that it's got one. so much coming on there, hasn't it? Well done, everybody. Do you know, a lot of my friends are going on holiday in for Christmas. It seems to be the new thing that they go away to somewhere warmer for Christmas. Who's a they? A lot of my friends at school. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, there's oh, quite wow, a few of them amazing. are going to, like, Tenerife. Winter and, sunshine, uh, winter basically, sunshine. Yeah. Can you imagine this as a beautiful bracelet or an anklet? Mm. Just a few of those as little, little charms. Oh, how really, lovely. Really, really beautiful. Yeah, I think I think it is, it is, it is kind of becoming the norm, people going away just after Christmas or over the Christmas um, uh, season just to get a bit of um oh they're going to the Canaries are they Liam on Boxing Day Very oh that nice. sounds nice leaving you all on your own <clears throat> goodness me my mum goes to India for two months your mum goes to India for two wow. months when Go, uh, in, uh, New Year's Day Wow. For two months? Yeah. Oh, amazing. Maybe like eight times in the past ten years since you've done that. <gasps> That's amazing. That'd be amazing, wouldn't it? Bit of winter sunshine. Why not? Mm. That's gorgeous. Well done, everyone. 15, 13, unlucky for some. Mm. Amethyst Rondells. Oh, lovely. That is a really, really lovely strand of Amethyst. Very saturated, isn't it? Ooh. That's lovely. It's going to be on and gone, is it, Liam? I think that has to go with the Shah right that we did the last oh, hour. Oh, yes, with the Shah right. Definitely, 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 definitely. Because it's all the way down to just... Seven ninety five. There you go. Absolutely amazing. Hardly any of these available. Had about six different endings that song, didn't it? <laughs> Seven ninety five. Well done, genius in London. Absolutely fantastic. Um, I can't stop looking at that appetite in the bottom corner as well. Mm, it's absolutely it's gorgeous, isn't it? isn't it? Do you know that it would yeah. go well with this actually? Because the, the, the greens and the um, and the sky blues. Yeah. Oh, definitely. Why not? Yeah, gorgeous. Seven ninety five for that. Linda, well done to you as well. Kay, Lynn. I oh, know, yes, I keep saying 15. Well done, that's pretty much gone. <laughs> oh. Look at that. They're unusual, aren't they? I know. That's why I was drawn to them. Thank See, you, uh, Liam. These could be your marker beads for the three strand. Oh, Marla. If you're Marla. Oh, yes. See? See? So here's your eight mil faceted rounds for your mm. amethyst we did earlier on. And the, these big bad boys could be your marker beads. That would be bad a beautiful boys. Marla. Mm. That would be a really nice Marla. Gorgeous. Mm. Absolutely gorgeous. 
Yeah, defo, defo, defo. Um, so this strand here, believe it or not, it's going under a tenner. So you've got wow. all four strands today for £34, what? 90. That's oh. awesome. That, what a beautiful Christmas present as well. A Marlowe necklace, somebody, yes, definitely. A Marla, you know, even just, you know, if it's not for the, you know, the, the religious, religious reasons, you know, just a yes. beautiful piece mm. of jewellery to wear. Definitely. Really beautiful. They're absolutely gorgeous, aren't they? I'd love to see a ring made out of one of these, you yeah. know, a lovely spinner ring maybe, because the, 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 the facets on these are so mm. beautiful and contemporary, aren't yeah. they? I would love yeah. to see a beautiful wire work ring. And I think it would have to be in copper for me. Yeah. See, you, I, I should have put, I nearly put it on today, actually i did a snakeskin jasper square and riveted it into a copper ring oh my and gosh that sounds really, amazing really beautiful and you yeah. could do that with something like this definitely oh yeah so that it would sit just in the middle mm -hmm. and just be a gentle hug from the copper oh gentle hug well done everyone gorgeous 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 9.95 9.95 let's do some citrine rondels oh, again these are really big rondels aren't they they are nice. Six by three to nine by five. Ooh. I love citrine. Me too. It's the gem of happiness. It's one of the two birthstones of November. We're in November. It's November the 4th. I know both my husband and my middle son's birthday. Oh. Marcus's birthday in two days' time. My sister and brother-in-law, both November. Yeah. It, it is a, it's a popular time of year. What was happening uh, nine months prior to that? Uh, no idea. November. December, January, February. Oh, Valentine's. There you are. <laughs> ah, Valentine's, uh, that is. Uh, but anyway, uh, so Citrine graduated plain rondelles. Uh, again, with a gem like this, isn't it nice when it's when it's unfaceted? Mm. It's, it's just really nice yeah. and shiny. Can you put it with a garnet for me? Say again. Put it with a garnet. Oh, gosh, yes, absolutely put it with a garnet. That with some gold. Yeah, like definitely. Gold oh, yeah, look at that. <clears throat> That's nice. Yeah, our garnet's coming up. That's going to be an absolute whopper cheeky. It's coming up at 12.45. It's coming up in an hour's time. It'd also go beautifully with that amazing appetite. Yeah, yeah, you're absolutely right. Oh, my gosh. That is your winter holiday, winter sun oh, holiday, isn't it? Winter sunshine, jumping on a plane and going to the Maldives. Oh, my mm. word. Where you can swim to the bar for a cocktail. I've always oh. wanted to swim to the bar. Can you imagine that? Would you like to do that, Michael? Is that for our honeymoon? Did you? A pool bar, isn't it? Yeah. A pool bar? Mm. That sounds amazing. Did you have a drink with an umbrella in it as well? Sparklers oh, and all sorts of I'm stuff coming out on the top of it. Mm. Yeah. No, you've got to have a drink. If you're going to swim to a bar... You, you need want, to make it worth it. Yeah. You need an umbrella in your drink. Oh. <laughs> At least. Seriously? We're going to give away the garnet if you can guess the price point on it. First person to text in. First person to text in with their customer number. And the correct price of what price this is going to be today wins this strand of garnet. It's on pre-order. Oh. I was going to say, is that the price? Because <laughs> then you're just telling them. That's not a really uh, okay, good so it's not the price, which is 19.95. That's hilarious <laughs> if it was the actual price. It's not the price on the website. Um, so it's got to be lower than that. We don't take prices up here at Jewelry Maker. That would be rubbish. Can you imagine that if we did that? Or can you imagine if we were just fixed price? That price would be such... elevation! <laughs> that, would be, that would be absolutely dreadful. That would be a terrible television idea, wouldn't it? <laughs> fixed price or uh, even better, price elevation. You could have a price you could escalator. Do it. You could do it by way of kind of punishing people. If enough people don't come through and get something, you punish them by taking the price up. Jewelry Maker's price hike! <laughs> Jewelry makers no, price hike. You're in the studio. Get on the price hike. Doing the, the yeah. voiceover. Pete Opal. <laughs> Look at this. Really? I did. I'd never guess that was Opal. No, me neither. I'd have gone with Rhodochrosite. Yes, me too. They look like sweets. Oh, Janice has won. Janice, well done. Jackie, you got it wrong. Judith, you got it wrong. Judith, you got it right, but you were the second person in. Oh, so mm. stop texting in. Stop texting in. Stop texting in. We keep texting it, but no, because no one's going to win anything. Oh, okay, you can keep texting it. No, but it's, someone's, it's won, so it's pointless. Someone's won. He's not got the idea Lee of Ham. this, has he? <laughs> Gee whiz. <laughs> Peach Opal. I've never seen a strand of Opal like this before, have nope. you? Nope, never. And it's going to be yours today. <laughs> 
Oh, I just love the idea of us taking prices up. 16.95, but if you come through and get this in 20 seconds time, it's going to be 759 pounds <laughs> and 86 pence. So be quick! <laughs> oh, dear me. 16.95, well done, everybody. You know what what a great do? deal. If we yeah. had a bigger studio, we could have some sort of like crystal maze set up. So oh. we would have to do like get clues. Oh, And wow. then if we, if we failed, the price stays up. Only us. Only we can make the price come, come down. down by... Sort doing of clues oh, or on I a hamster wheel that. running on a hamster wheel Run! or maybe gladiators could get the oh, pugilist yeah. sticks only if we could get john anderson with his whistle yeah 16.95 well done collector well done to susan fantastic well done they look like sweets don't they they're gorgeous Think, Liam, the longer you take Liam, to come in, the really higher the price. Idea, I think most Just time, don't think about it. <laughs> most times over like this, we usually see them in faceted uh, rondelles, don't we? You're right, we That's do. probably what through us off so much. But the colour's different, don't you think? It's more of a coral. It is more of a corally coral. colour, isn't it? It is more of a corally colour. Beautiful, well done. £16.95, pence. well done, everyone. <laughs> uh, amazing, well done. Beautiful. Can I just say, who's been... Who's been Pushing their face up against the the window. Leham. You couldn't this. reach that. Oh, Leham, you put your face near the bottom of the glass yeah. today. Yeah, probably got, producer Tom. Yeah, I've got about ten of these strands. Why? Because I love, I absolutely love them. I love the family, and I love the different colours. And again, like the tourmaline strand, they all go together so beautifully. I've got lots of different sizes. Do. This is Beryl. Hello, Beryl. Hello. Um, 170 carats of multicolour Beryl. You've got a 38 centimetre strand. They're all 8 mil rounds. They are absolutely gorgeous. I would be graduating them by colour. I'd be putting them into their own little camps. You've I've got this amazing blue. Yeah, yeah, it's gorgeous, yeah, isn't it? That never one there. Had one like that. Proper, 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 proper blue. Uh, proper. Oh, Ooh. Both with the deal of Ooh, the days. Oh, yes, with the deals of my days. Oh, wow. Steal of a deal that was, wasn't it? Is there an American program called Days of Our Lives? Yes. Every time I keep getting Joey Tribbiani, tri Joey, Joey, whatever his name, Tribbiani is in it. All right. From Friends. But it is an actual program. Dr. Drake Ramora, isn't it? <laughs> isn't that the character he plays? Uh, but yeah, there is an actual program called Days of Our Lives. Mm. It's pretty bad. Uh, well done, 14 pounds and 95 pence for your gorgeous multicolor barrel plane, eight millimeter rounds, they are gorgeous. Bit of pearl knotting, great for your Marla style necklaces. Yeah, definitely Particularly as I've got some larger barrels coming up, hopefully. Oh! Nice. Oh, baby, baby. Oh, baby, baby. I love the peach one. I love the, the green. The greens are, yeah. What? They're absolutely gorgeous, aren't they? Look how beautiful. Big the pink is on that one. That's a really yeah. beautiful. They're gorgeous, aren't they? <gasps> Multicolour barrel slabs. There they are. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Oh, I like those a lot. <clears throat> 100 carats more. <gasps> no, seriously. What? Check out the price. Check, check. Here we go. Oh, you're going to love this. You're going to absolutely love this. Look at this. 24, 27, no, 12. 12 pounds and 95 pence today. That is yours. Absolutely amazing. I love the Morganite colours in here. They're mm. beautiful. They're so pinky, peachy, aren't they? Mm. They're gorgeous. Absolutely. Oh, look at that lovely bicolour one as well. That's really lovely, isn't it? Oh, yeah, really, really nice. The whole family, you're right, uh, Flair, is really lovely, isn't it? It is. It's a beautiful family of gemstones. Mm. And again, like that tourmaline, like I said, you know, it just goes so gorgeous together. It reminds me of um, Kath Kits and Tinsets. Yes. This has got lovely um, Schiller on. Look at that one. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, baby. Gorgeous. Well done. 12 95 Regina in New York. They're going to go to New York. Well done to you, my darling. Fantastic. Well done. £12.95. We could, all, we could all go Christmas shopping in New York and drop it off her. Do you know what? Regina, do you fancy that? I think Regina yeah. lives outside of New York in the middle of nowhere. That's all right, though. That's fine. We could do that, though, couldn't we? We can get the bus into New York. Couldn't we? Yeah. 
get the subway. Yeah. I don't like them. Do you not? After watching the Joker. Yeah, I can't know one about sandwiches. In what? Sandwiches. You don't like sandwiches? I don't like Subway sandwiches. Oh, right. Why not? No. Oh, I love them. No. I love them. That, that, I don't like that Italian ham. Um, barrel. Mm. Do you not I like Subway like either, the, the, Ollie? The herby bread. Ooh. Herby bread? Ooh. Oh, I know I have the wrap. Oh, no. I have the chicken tikka wrap. Or the chicken teriyaki, that's Although, nice. Although, I think everybody that works in Subway, they are like artists, the way that they fold it all in. And they're nothing amazing. ever falls out of No, that, they're that amazing. $8.95, look at that multicolour barrel in regular teeth. They are gorgeous, aren't they? They're beautiful, aren't they? They're, they're really nice. See, I'd like oh, that. Other sandwich the... shops are available, everyone. Yes, they are, yeah. Um, I'd like that in a three-strand necklace. Yes, absolutely. Beautiful that's a lovely idea. Gorgeous, $8.95, well done, look at that. Liam's a fan of the meatball mar mar mariana, mar mar marinara, marinara, marinara. Mar mar marinara. So it's basically a, a buntain burner. It's basically a uh, meatball sandwich. With tomato sauce. With tomato sauce, some, you have some uh, melted cheese on top. Oh, and no, that's not a sandwich. In a bun. That's not uh, a sandwich. Well done, Eight ninety-five. absolutely gorgeous. They're beautiful, aren't they? Well done. Yes. I'm getting really hungry now. We also do McDonald's and Burger King just for... Yeah, yeah okay, fine. Yeah. Yeah. And Pratt. Yeah, Pratt. And KFC. Pratt, 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 Pratt. And KFC. There's no KFCs around by me. <gasps> wow, late gorgeous. show. Eight o'clock. Wow. Is that... Is that... Turquoise? Or... Uh, is that... Chrysocola. Cola. Hessonite Garnet. Rose Quartz Garnet. That oh. garnet is very, very, very nice. That is lovely. Gorgeous colours there. Absolutely amazing. I love that. I really like those. Lee Ham is producing the show. It's Lee Ham again. Uh, they're coming up at the eight o'clock hour. Mm, yeah. Oh, it is multicolour yeah. barrel. You're right. Blues. Ew. It's not Chrysocola like you just said it was. It's African turquoise. <gasps> Amazing. Every single strand, guaranteed. Under 15 Ooh. quid. What? They're long it's strands, It's only 50 though. of each. That's amazing. Look how long they are. Don't stop believing. Ding, ding, ding. There we go. Ding, ding, ding. It's a very odd song, that, isn't it? The lyrics are very odd. Mm. Multicolour appetite. <whistles> Here they are. Multicolour appetite. Multicolour appetite. This is coming up straight after the break. It's an amazing strand. It's an amazing price. Been lots of interest on the pre-order pieces. <laughs> Everything from the last order is on pre-order, so you may as well just come through and get it. The more people who come through and get things, the, uh, the more we'll play. Garnet coming up at 12.45. Can't wait. The five polished beads have been very, very popular. Uh, yes, yeah, so have a look on the website. See what we're playing in the last hour. Uh, hopefully, and, and uh, just come through and get it because it's all on pre-order. And of course, we've got the kit coming up in the next hour as well. Do not go anywhere. We'll see you in a couple of malls. Did you know that if you go to jewelrymaker.com and sign up to our mailing list, then you'll receive 10% off your first order with us. We'll also keep you updated with special offers, themed shows, program guides, and jewelry maker tutorials. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. 
Hello everyone, hope you can join myself and presenter Eleanor this Tuesday for the morning show, the 5th of November, for the second part of my Symbols Findings launch. This amazing range of findings has really caught everyone's imagination. And this Tuesday is all about the super duos. So we've got four different colors, we have got six different findings, and would you believe it, 16 brand new Super Duo colors. So that's this Tuesday, the 5th of November, myself and Eleanor for the morning show from 8 a.m. We'll see you then. At Jewelry Maker, we are always looking at ways to provide you with a fantastic shopping experience. With this in mind, we'd like to welcome you to our new pre-order option. Selected items throughout the day will be put on display and made available for pre-order. When the presenter informs you that the pre-order service is available on an item, this is your chance to pop it into your online basket or speak to one of our brilliant call centre team members and be one of the first to secure your purchase. Love Jewelry Maker but don't have an account? You can now purchase items on the Jewelry Maker website through our guest checkout. To do so, select the products you wish to purchase and head over to the shopping basket. Simply enter your email address and select continue as guest below. After this, the checkout process is simple. Select your quantity and delivery option and then check out securely. Enter your billing details in either a credit card or PayPal account and proceed to payment. From here, you still have the option to create an account if you wish, making shopping online easier for you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. At Jewelry Maker, we are always looking at ways to provide you with a fantastic shopping experience. With this in mind, we'd like to welcome you to our new pre-order option. Selected items throughout the day will be put on display and made available for pre-order. When the presenter informs you that the pre-order service is available on an item, this is your chance to pop it into your online basket or speak to one of our brilliant call centre team members and be one of the first to secure your purchase. Our brand new Get Started with Jewelry Maker page has been created to provide help and guidance for jewelry making newbies. If you need design suggestions, hints and tips, or help with perfecting your jewelry designs, we're here to help. Head over to facebook.com slash getstartedwithjm where our talented in-house designers are happy to answer your jewelry making questions, offer inspiration, and get you started in your jewelry making journey. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Star by 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 this is an amazing strand. It's fact. It's a very long strand, actually. Do you know what? I'm going to get the ruler of truth. I want to see. <clears throat> it says it's 32 centimetres. Give over. 36 I've got. You know? 32 has got to be the absolute minimum uh, length you're going to be getting here. That is the most amazing strand of appetite, isn't it, Fleur? Look at all those gorgeous colours. Absolutely. The, the neon is just out of this world. Do you know what I would do? I would like to mix all these up. I'd love to pick them up completely blind. I think that would be absolutely an amazing thing to do. The, the mix of colours is, is sensational, mm. isn't it? Or do them as stacker bracelets so they sit side by side. So you could Ooh. have the, this beautiful, like, yellowy tone, and it's then gorgeous. I go to the green, and then the sky, and then the, and then the neon. Oh, my word. But yeah, yeah, that's lovely. The recording is absolutely beautiful. It's um, really showcasing those colours beautifully. You've got neon appetite, sky blue appetite, yellow appetite, and kind of everything in between as well. You've got a very gentle kind of lemon beryl uh, kind of... Uh, mm. 
um, uh, yellowy colour, which of course are these. And then you've got this kind of sphene colour here. They are absolutely amazing. They look gorgeous together, don't they? All these colours. Look at that. Yeah, what this blue, this is your favourite, this kind of like sky sea blue, like an aqua mm. appetite almost. I don't know what my favourite is. I, I love the mix of all of these together. The neon's amazing. As a strand, that is such a gorgeous strand. I think that neon blue it looks like it could have come off of like Moana. Like, yes. Like, it, you know, when you see the high definition colours. Well, yeah, you're absolutely right. It's a high definition um, uh, appetite colour you're mm. getting there. Would you? That's a nice idea. Mm. Liam said you'd take four from each colour. So four of the lovely kind of sphene colour, then the neon, then the lighter yellow, and then the mm. beautiful sky blue, and then put them in the middle of a sliding class bracelet. I think that's a lovely idea. Why Appetite is not a birthstone, I don't know, because I really am a believer that this should be a birthstone. It's just, it's such an exciting gemstone. Um, this is beautiful, top quality Appetite you're gonna be getting here. It has been available on pre-order, and it has been going, so very, very exciting. Very, very excited. Your price today, under 20 quid. Wow. Amazing, 1995. Mm. And don't forget, this is approximately a 36 centimeter strand of appetite you're gonna be getting here. Well done, everybody. That is a really tremendously low price. I love, I just love all the colors, flow. It's yeah. such an exciting palette to work with, isn't it? I'd love to do a chain, one of the chain mail bracelets, like a, a gemstone spine, and then just stitch these down through the middle. Oh so you've gosh, got that, that ridge lovely. of color that goes through the middle. Yes, oh, how wonderful. Well done, we're under 20 pounds for that today. Well done, 50 carats of your multicolor appetite. That is absolutely gorgeous. Look at this one here, it's like a cinnamon. Like a cinnamon colour, Yeah, one. there's some lovely Beautiful kind of, colors. almost like um, your sphen colours in here, which can mm. range from kind of these gorgeous yellowy greens to your kind of reds, your yeah. orangey reds. It, it Fleur's absolutely right. It's just gorgeous, isn't it? Well done. More people coming through. Check your baskets out, everybody. Please don't leave this in your baskets. Um, that is amazing. We only started, excuse me, <coughs> we only started with 32 of this. It is going to sell. Well done, you're doing absolutely brilliantly. You're doing fantastic, well done. What a gorgeous collection of gemstones. Such a great price for a 36 uh, uh, centimeter strand. Judith, well done to you, you need to check out. Coral needs to check out, well done. If you check out, you're taking us down into really, really, really limited um, limited quantities, I, that's gorgeous. I love the story as well, that where you find appetite, you tend to find dinosaurs. Dinosaur bones, yes. Which I think is just a really cool story. You know, if you sell your jewellery, obviously not a lot of people will have heard of appetite. Mm -hmm. So it's lovely to have a story that you can sort of like relate to. Absolutely, you yes, know, definitely. So it's nice to say what chemical compositions everything are mm -hmm. and how it grows, but mm. that is something that can like coagulate it all together yeah. into something that you then go, actually, I really Actually, like by the way, yeah. yeah, gorgeous, great. Fantastic, well done everyone. Keep coming through for that, well done, gorgeous. Okay, now coming up in about 45 minutes time, we have this. Oh my word. This is garnet. I, I reckon this is some of the best garnet ever. Mm. We, uh, the price for this strand today is, it's amazing. It does not make one ounce of sense. It's amazing. I can't wait to bring you this. It's coming up at about quarter to one gorgeous absolutely gorgeous beautiful right okay let's do the kit i love the jewelry you've made today oh thank you i think it's absolutely gorgeous it's big it's chunky it's got personality it's it's mixed media which i always love i love a bit of mixed media um and uh it gives you the opportunity to make some really bold uh, pieces of jewellery which are full of character. Now, this kit is going to give you two gigantic carrot weight strands of gemstones. You've got the most beautiful strand of aqua quartzite and you've also uh, got an amazing strand of amethyst as well. These are two really lovely strands, aren't they? They are. And like you said, they're <coughs> big and they're bold and they're 
they're easy to work with because they're rounds, so you don't mm. have to think about them. Of course. Them. I mean, I've rosary linked both of them with just with the. I used some one mil wire from Love the, the previous done. kit at nine o'clock, um, but it just gives those big pieces of copper because you've got a big pendant like that. You don't want a little oh, wow. fine chain to go with it. You no. know, you want something. If you've got something like that, it's a statement piece. You need, mm. needs to be beautiful put together with a statement. What about the aqua? So you've used the aqua on the uh, pendant there, haven't you? I've used it on, really the, uh, on the on the uh, pendant, and then I've used it in the necklace, which has oh, got gosh, the, yes, at the um, end. The five, the, the four oh. point star as well. So again, that again, a big piece of um, copper, Gosh. which is then you know you can make into a pendant. Doesn't that blue look work so beautifully with the uh, with the copper? Yeah, it does. Yeah. It's really really nice. Really lovely. But that's not it. You're getting something else now. I don't think you weren't giving this, were no, you? I wasn't giving this now. Oh, you know the little four. You know the four point star that you made. Mm -hmm. I'd love to see, I would love to have seen this nestled yeah, in that, that would be beautiful design. In there. You are getting the most beautiful Amatrine tumble. It is absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. So you've got the most beautiful Amatrine. You've got the gorgeous purples. You've got the gorgeous um, uh, oranges as well. It is absolutely stunning. Amatrine is the perfect example of when two gemstones become one. Um, you've got amethyst and citrine, uh, which become one gemstone. Gee whiz, it was only a matter of time before he started singing the Spice Girls. I thought Girls. you were going to start. I did think No, I'm not going to sing anymore. I'm, I'm, I'm getting so much you... stick for singing. No, I thought you were going to start then. Forget it. I won't, I won't entertain you. Mm -hmm. I'll just do the job in hand. All right. <laughs> Get it. Dare you. Get it. $22.95, that is for your strands and for your incredible um, am amatrine I'd as well. That that. I'd pay that for that strand of amethyst, because that's yeah. a big strand of amethyst. $19.95 is completely believable for that yeah. strand of amethyst. And then, of yeah. course, you're going to be getting the quartzite and the, and, and the um, amatrine uh, uh, tumble for about three quid. That's absolutely brilliant. That's an absolute bargain. A bargain, bargain, bargain. You also need some metal. Let's do the copper that we played in the nine o'clock <coughs> hour. It does seem about, yeah, it seems like it's a very, very uh, long time ago, doesn't it? Time flies when you're having fun, doesn't it? So, copper sheet. Copper sheet, and you've got your beautiful uh, base metal findings as well. So two of your 0.4 millimeter thickness, Michael. Stop trying to steal the limelight by waving at this copper. Sh there he is. Where am I? I don't know. Can You're I there see? somewhere, mate. I don't know. Oh, I don't. Dude, I've no idea. Oh. Hello. There he is. Hello. <laughs> no, no, no. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Okay, so you've got your two, your two sheets of uh, copper sheet, which are 0.4 millimeter uh, gauge, and then you get your 21 piece findings pack, which is your base metal uh, findings pack as well, which is amazing. Uh, 19 pounds and 95 pence, absolutely glorious, isn't it? Well done, do give us a call for that. Bye boy, uh, fantastic, well done. Oh, hello, look at those findings, and look at what can be achieved. That's the thing with these kits, isn't it, um, Flair? What yeah. can be achieved? Yeah, with the metal, it's, um the world's your oyster. The world is your oyster. Because there's, there's so much you can oh, sorry. do. Sorry, I'm, I'm just going to say there's so much you can make. There is so much you can make. Marsh, you're in Nebraska. There's a first person through. That's nice. That's a beautiful pendant, isn't it? Yeah, so it's a, this is a fold-formed version of the one in the first kit. Yes, so yes. So this one is making that single line fold first and then spiralling it around yeah. the mandrel. So it's exactly the same, but it just sort of like start with the, the simple one and then move on. Yeah. And then you've got your, your fallen leaves. That's really, really nice, isn't it? I isn't that gorgeous? I sell so many of those. I'm, I'm sure you do. We're under 20 pounds, aren't we? They're just gorgeous, aren't they? Um, and, and you can make bigger versions of that and make them into like a, almost like a, a, a kind of a sculptural piece on its yeah. own, can't yeah, you? Yes, so I've got a big piece at home, which I, I curved. Aww lots of different ways. Fold forming is um, it's quite a, it's a relatively new technique as in somebody put their name to it and then said this is what you can do. It has been used for quite a long time I'm sure it forging, has. but it's the guy's name is Charles Lutonbrain who um, 
made made it his own really right you know and, and wrote the books and showed everybody how to do these amazing folds and there's so much you can do with, yeah like i say with metal and who knew that you could take you know a sheet of metal and turn it into something that's 3d and move it around just by Gosh. using a hammer that's all i've used is a hammer to yeah. turn that into that you know it's um it's quite um, unbelievable how how you can move it is pretty incredible and that's the double sided so when i open that out in a minute you'll see that oh, it's like flared wow. out inside and we will see that in a few moments what do you want to do lee ham do you want to do the demo now perfect okay sorry yeah, we'll okay. see it now Fleur, if that's all no right no problem at all demo so, I'm not going to do any of the annealing. Like I said, on the 6th of October, I showed you how to anneal metal yep. and it's on the fold form in DVD. So what we need to do to start with, we need to take a piece of metal. So you can see I've not taken very much. And this is actually too wide, but um, not very much metal at all from one of my sheets to mm. actually make one of these uh, beautiful pendants. What I'm going to do to start with is I'm going to bend it in half. So what I'm going to do is use the edge of my block and I'm just going to bend it in Ooh. half, okay? So all I'm doing is just bringing that together. Now, like I say, I've annealed this so it is very malleable. I'm now going to take my, just a, a little rawhide hammer, but you would use your whammer, the mm. nylon side. And all I'm going to do is just fold oh, that down. Oh, yeah. Whack it. <laughs> okay, so now I've got this. And now what I can do if I wanted to is just straighten this edge up a little bit. So I'm just going to quickly cut. So using the snips that we had earlier. Lovely. Just, and you can see this is going through two lots of Yeah, that's amazing. Now. So very easy to do. Just keep nibbling away till nibble, you get nibble. to the end. Mm -hmm. Just be careful with these really curly bits because they can be quite sharp. Yes, okay? I can imagine. Yeah. So now what we're going to do to make... The way you hit the metal depends on where it's going to move. Okay. Okay. So you can see on this one here, I've hit the outside edge. So I've hit the open side. So if I just bring this over, yeah. this bit started life like this. Uh -huh. So if I was to hit, when I hit this edge, mm -hmm. it's going to stretch this side of course, all the way yeah. around. And this side's going to sort of like concertina up. Mm -hmm. So this actually if I, if I opened it out would be smaller than this it's just because it's moved the metal around okay, yeah if I was to hit the other edge then it would obviously make a different kind mm. of look to the piece so what I'm going to do to start with I'm going to show you how to start with this mm -hmm. so we're going to take a hammer that's a cross peen hammer so the cross section here so the edge you can see it's almost like a cheese wedge ah so you can see that it's sitting across to the handle mm -hmm. okay so this is sitting this way the handle sitting this way so okay. it's like a cross section yeah so we need this this hammer now if we were to hit the ha the metal with this side mm -hmm. what's going to happen is um it's going to if you stand on like a tomato mm -hmm. and it spreads out like that whereas if you chop a um, tomato mm -hmm. with a knife mm -hmm. you chop down don't you yes okay so it's the same sort of principle so when i hit with this end the metal's going to spread north to south. Yeah. When I hit with this end, it's going to spread 360. Cool. Okay, okay that's so a really good... Um, in, so if you hammer in texture or something like that, if you start with a circle, when you hammer it, you actually make that circle larger. Mm. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start by starting the middle and where I'm looking to hammer, and this may be really noisy, I apologise. I'm looking to hammer just on the edge here. So I'm not hammering on this fold. Mm. I'm going to hammer on this edge. So I'm going to hammer this way first. And then I'm going to hammer that way, okay? Okay. So I'm going to start to spread this metal around, okay? So I'm going to hold it in the middle, taking my hammer, and I've got to make sure that the hammer is um, horizontal. Because I want this to turn, I'm going to mm. tell you all this before I start because it's going to be really noisy. Yeah. As it starts to turn the metal, I need to turn the metal but keep the hammer straight. Okay. Okay? So here we go. Now, just that's one little section, but can you see how oh, it started to yes. spread? So that metal now is starting oh, to spread that's awesome. out and it's starting to go longer. Yeah, okay? lovely. So again, we'll go over it again. You see, I'm just, all yeah, I'm doing yeah, is just yeah. pivoting that metal around. So again, let me show you again. Lovely. You can see how it's starting to grow That's longer so here. Cool. And it's no longer now straight where it was straight before. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So we're going to turn this around now. So I'm not trying to go up up the way. Yeah. You're not strong hammering when you're mm. hammering away from you. Always hammer towards you. So 
again. Lovely. So that's just one one pass either side. Uh -huh. So this one's obviously had two. So you can so you can see now how it's starting to stretch yeah, lovely. this metal over. So what you would do is you turn this over, you do exactly the same on the other side. Mm -hmm. You could do it like twice, I would say. Then you need to anneal it. Okay. okay. So this is when it's been done twice. So this is now annealed oh, because wow. if you keep hitting metal, you will you'll snap it. Okay. You'll break it. So it needs to be annealed. You can't over anneal a piece of metal. You could just keep heating it up to that dark cherry red. Don't melt it, but mm. take it to that dark cherry red. Yeah. And then it will go back to that nice relaxed form, and you can start hitting it again. So this is again. So if I just show you on this little bit here. And you can see where, where I've actually heated it. Yep. You can see the, the colours that are yeah. coming through. So again, let's just, let's just hit this little bit here. And you can see how it's now starting to shorten this side and elongate this side. And that's all just with a hammer. Wow. So you would carry on going. Now, if you wanted to do the pendant that's on, sorry, Michael, this pendant here, this pendant, you would stop at this stage. Mm -hmm. So that's hammered the outside edge as well. Yeah. And then all you would do is just start to twist it and turn it with your hands. And you can see it's because it's annealed. Yeah, it's, it's it, really easy can, to do. And this is technically a 0.8, isn't it? Because it's two lots of 0.5. And then what you would do is mm. open it up and frill out the sides. Yeah, lovely. What we're going to do is we're going to go a little bit further. So this is about three or four times now where I've hammered it so you can wow. see it's starting to yeah. come around and you, you've got to keep the faith you keep mm -hmm. thinking it's never going to go around it's never going to meet together but mm -hmm. it will so keep going till we get to this okay so you can see how <sighs> much we spread that metal out so this metal on the edge is a lot thinner than it mm. was to start with but it's still it's still okay to sort of like open and use as a pendant so what we need to do now is gently open this up so all I'm doing is I've just got um this comes in your um What's it called? Gem setting kit. Gem setting, sorry. Mm, yeah, like thank a burnisher, you. Gem isn't setting, it? yeah, like a burnisher. So all we've got to do is just open this. Now, always make sure that you've got metal between you mm. and this, because this is sharp. If you're trying to do it like this, it's going to go straight into your finger. Oh. So always make sure that you've got metal between you and the whatever you're opening with. I mean, a lot of people will say about opening it with a knife. I don't open it with no a knife. No way. Um, I always use one of these, and it may take me a little bit longer. But I'll uh, I'll get there eventually. Yeah, and yeah. it's a lot safer. But you can see how this is now opening that up. That is awesome. It's like so beautiful. Opening a clamshell. Yeah, 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 like an oyster almost. Yeah. yeah. So you can see now how we can start to open that up into there. So you can you can open this up as much or as little as you want. So we're going to get to that point there. Let's open that part. And you can see all I'm doing is just going around. And opening all the way. Now, what I did is I put two drill holes here and here. So I would probably stop at this point and put two drill holes in just so that I can um, open this up. But if we open this one out a little bit more than the one that we've got there. Yeah, lovely. So let's get some um, pliers. Okay. So let's let's go in and just, again, just using your hands. Oh, and wow. We can just frill, frill this out a little bit more. And you can see then mm -hmm. how you can create different flow. looks, different looks to this piece. This this could be almost like a poppy. Yeah. By the time you've yeah, finished, you're you know, absolutely you could, right. Yeah. You can make you could put gemstones in in the inside so that if it turned on its side, if it's like a brooch, you could have that mm -hmm. as well. But yeah, just just have a go at it. It yeah. really is the most amazing thing to do to take it's a piece gorgeous. of copper from from this into something that you can do Oh, like wow. Yes, I think that's fantastic, Flo. If I want to do a square shape, how would I do a square shape? Would I kind of like... So, over? like the one that's on the end, like the four-pointed like star? Like square like that. So you'd have to, you wouldn't be able to, it wouldn't go into a square. It has to, you have to have a have longer a thin or a curve yeah. um, mm -hmm. for it to be able to stretch one side. But you can make squares like that one, which is where you, um, you turn it into triangles and then you open it out and then you push those, those inner triangles in as well. <sighs> Gorgeous. Yep. Can you yes, do it with silver? You can. You can do it with silver as well. Silver work hardens faster than copper. Um, 
so you will just have to keep a kneel in it um and don't try and clean it until you've finished it and the other thing yeah. to note is i don't quench my pieces in between um annealing them yeah i put them on a steel block till they cool down because any water that's in here if it gets onto your tools which are steel they're going to rust yeah so i just have i have lots of different stages so when i made all these they were all in different stages and so i just literally just take one off of the uh, you know a steel block to cool it down mm -hmm. but just have a go obviously don't touch anything that's hot but then um, you know, just have a go at it and just see how you can start to move that metal. Just even just a little bit. Yeah. It's an amazing, amazing thing to start with. That's amazing. Thank you so That's much, okay. Blair. Isn't that a brilliant medium? And what I love about it is how how um, the designs look totally unachievable. Yeah. But in actual fact, they are completely, completely. achievable. Anyone can have a go. I mean, if you've got older kids, if you've got older kids, if you've got teenage kids, give that they could do this with you. I mean, honestly, so and every piece do. is going to be unique. You could set pearls. I love that set, idea. Set you could make a piece there. which looks like a little uh, pea pod. Yes, yeah, like a pea pod. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And then put so little you pearls just pop, in there. Pop little, um, you just pop a gemstone in there, just feed them through and just make them all like that. I love that. Isn't that beautiful? Gorgeous. Yeah, you could put the tumble in there yeah. if you made it a bit bigger, couldn't you? Yeah. Nice. Right, we've got... Uh, oh, dear me. Right, OK, here we go. So, Bohemian Chord. I love this. Bohemian Chord. Here we go. I see a little silhouette of a man. It's... Oh, what's happened to my... Oh, no, hang on. My mic's come down my top. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Hang on. You hold that. You hold that. Thank you. It's really, really pretty. You see lots of different things that you can do with this. Yeah, definitely. Nice bracelet, nice, um, uh, uh, nice bracelet, nice um, uh, necklace maybe. Yeah. I wonder if you could use I it the like same that. as paracord. As paracord. Oh, I don't see why not. Or yeah. climbing cord. Climbing cord, yes, yeah. maybe. That Gemma and, I know Kaleshna and, and Gemma have both mm. worked with that in the past, haven't they? Mm. It's a thick cord, so it's, it, it, it's, it's got loads of cords within it. It's a bit like paracord in that respect. It's not hollow. Can you see that? I bet you could probably splice it together, actually. Yeah. That's really, really lovely, isn't it? Two ninety five for a metre of bohemian cotton cord. If you just want to do really, really simple kind of knotted jewellery, then you absolutely could do with this. I mean, that's a really, a really lovely kind of knotted piece. Um, and you can and you can kind of you know I mean just just really really lovely if you wanted to pipe around any cushions that you've got or anything like that or kind of upcycle maybe a blazer or a cardigan something like that that's a nice idea stick it on your shoes <laughs> really maybe Liam I don't know um, but it is tie it is backs. okay curtain tie backs curtain tie backs room. nice but it is big enough if you wanted to kind of make just little bracelets with that and, you, and, and just use the bead um, and just use the bead caps. Uh, so, sorry, not the bead caps, the, uh, the, end, uh, the bell caps on the end of these. That would be absolutely gorgeous. Lovely. I like that. I like that a lot. Well done. Yeah, you could do the um, seed beads. Oh we're, oh, we're a box behind, I see. These have been very popular. These are probably one of our biggest selling uh, varieties of seed bead. They are white lined crystal AB. They are gorgeous. They're 11 O's. They're amazing. The uh, the quality you're getting here is absolutely amazing, and you use them by all means as a as a seed bead, or just use them as a bead. Uh, just use them as a bead. Um, they are absolutely gorgeous stuff in wedding um, mm -hmm. um, wedding um, uh, um, sweets, or to make your own cards, to make your own Christmas cards, and you can stitch these onto yeah. Christmas cards. You know, with the They'd really lovely, lovely snow scenes. They'd be really nice with the snow scenes, wouldn't they? They would, wouldn't they? They really... What about icicles or snowflakes, small but maybe? Mighty. Hmm? They're small but mighty. Yes, absolutely. Though they, though they be small, they be mighty. They're absolutely gorgeous. If I just kind of put some... There we go. I'll just put some out here. I mean, that is just literally just a few. And you could make it easily make a little mm. icicle scene or maybe a little snowflake and oh, just stick it onto your Christmas cards. Is it Patty that did Why the beautiful not? flowers? Are they on the... Oh, probably. You know, the beautiful oh, flower wow. piece that Patty did with the little... They look like forget-me-nots. Oh, yes. Oh. Is, that, is it on the front? I don't know. It must be... Yeah. 
I don't think oh, it is there. It no, but it be, was in here for it, ages, yeah, wasn't it, was, it? It used to be here, yeah. Yeah, oh, I don't know where it is. Two ninety five for these. Absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful. Well done, everybody coming That's, through to get these. Yeah. Here it is. This is it. Gorgeous. There we go. These yeah. little ones here. Really, really lovely. Yeah, look at that. I mean, you're getting thousands in this tube, so enough to... Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, beautiful, it's true. Fire polish, fire polish, fire polish, bead beads. Fire polish, fire polish, fire polish, bead beads. What's the daisy? Here we go. So, fire polish beads. These have gone very well on pre-order, by the way. Oh, well, it's a Lynn. Um, oh, that was for the last one. Oh, well done. Uh, polychrome sage citrus fire polish beads. Ooh, yeah. I don't know. I've never seen fire polish beads before. Have you not? Oh, nope. they're lovely. We do them in lots of different colours, lots of different kind of finishes as well. Look at the price. Look at the price. Boom, boom. Look at the price. Look at the price. Boom, boom. One ninety-five. Wow. There you go. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Yeah. Um, traditionally, you use them with your seed beads, but by all means, you know, you don't have to at all. Uh, they're made from uh, crystal. Uh, Jane's got two. Regina, well done to you. Uh, Sally, Sharon, Susan, Sally, Miss, Helen, Collector. Well done, everybody. Miss, hello, Miss, in Nottinghamshire. They look um, like, um, do you know you see those lovely beetles with all the iridescent greens? Oh, they're like little stag beetles, aren't yes. they? Yes, yeah. Yeah, yeah like I do those. know that. Yeah. I, I thought they looked a, a, a little bit like jazzy olives. Jazzy olives, yeah. Oh. Maybe your, oli your olives have gone off if they've gone. <laughs> yes, <laughs> exactly, yes. Edge. <laughs> oh, do you know, I had a whole bowl of olives on uh, Saturday night. Oh. Marcus loves olives. I could, yeah, Pippa loves olives. Yeah, oh, yeah. Because yeah. they said that you only get them, you get the taste for them when you're older. Yeah. But he knows. No, he no, 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 Pippi them. loves them too. They're really kind of buttery and I don't like them. salty and... I don't like black olives, but um, green olives, I oh, absolutely love it. Yeah, you're totally different, oh, yeah. Right. No, Gorgeous. Know you what, sorry, you don't like olives, Michael? Olive no. like... I eat olive the feta cheese that comes oil. with them. Well, they are olives, mate. Like olive oil, but not olives. Purple, so I, I saw cold. something about olive oil. Apparently, a good olive oil, you can actually drink it like a wine. Oh, it's oh, that nice. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I'm not no, sure about that. Satin cord. Oh, I like I like oh. dipping bread in oil and balsamic. And balsamic. Oh yeah. Oh gee. When it makes willikers. you cough because you've got too much balsamic yes. on there. Oh. <laughs> yes, gorgeous. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it's absolutely amazing though. Purple satin one mil cord. Gorgeous. Amazing. Did it, did it, did it, did it, pound. Did it, did it, did it, pound. 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 Y'all ready for this? <laughs> <laughs> One pound for your purple satin cord. Well, do you know what? The price was so low, my bra strap just came down. <laughs> That's how low the price was there. Wow. Steady on. Uh, gorgeous. One pound. One pound. Can we do what? What are you doing? One pound. Well done, everyone. Oh, dear me. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, well done, everyone. Pound, pound. Uh, well done, uh, Margaret. Elizabeth's got four loads. Brenda's got two loads. Patricia, Mavis. Well done to you as well, darling. Yeah. Hang on, it's not Drew. Oh, gosh. We're, we're a box behind the numbers that you're saying. No, this is 15, so we're a box in front of the numbers. I don't know, mate. Oh. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Druzy! I love Druzy. Oh, no, I'm not singing that, thank you. That's someone else's, that's someone else's gag. I'm not going to sing that. Gag. I've got two. Gag. Ah, oh, there you go. You had one job to doesn't, do, doesn't, <laughs> Don't they sing Ruby four times in the song? Not, not Ruby, three Ruby, times. Ruby, 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 yeah. 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 So it needs to be. Oh my gosh. Here we go. So, uh, Druzy, 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 Druzy. There we go. Uh, so, purple and black Druzy. It's gorgeous, isn't it? I'm just going to give them a bit of a turn. Look at the sparkle. Oh my word. They are absolutely gorgeous, aren't they? They are to die for. Uh, beautiful. Eight pounds uh, for both of these strands. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Absolutely beautiful. Eight pounds. Eight 
gorgeous, aren't they beautiful? Oh, wow, amazing. There we go, look at these, aren't they gorgeous? Look at that sparkle. Oh, wow, look at that, isn't that gorgeous? Look at that, beautiful. Look at that. Oh, wow. Look at that gorgeous sparkle. Look and this is Druzy inside, I know, aren't they beautiful? They're little caves. They with, are like little treasures. magical caves. Caves of wonder. They are beautiful, aren't they? <gasps> Look at oh. that one there. That one there is. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Amazing, that's lovely, that isn't one. it? They're, I mean, they're all absolutely gorgeous. But, yeah, there are a few which you'll just look at and go, oh, yes, that, that's the one for me. Gorgeous. Well done. Eight pounds for you today. Isabel's got three of the well done, my, uh, my lovely. That's absolutely gorgeous. They are stunning. They are stunning. They are, they are really gorgeous. That's gorgeous. Well done. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Well done. Eight pounds, everyone. Beautiful. Right, move on. Moving on. Up. We're moving on out. I really don't like them, people. Think and stop me. We are about 15 minutes away from the g g g g g g g g g garnet. You don't like them, people? Don't like them, people. No, I'm allergic to them. What? Come out in a rash. Yeah. M people. M people? No. You don't like Heather Small? No. No. No, I don't like her voice. Ah, her voice is very odd. You had to stand by the hero with Do you know the other one? Vanilla, yeah, do a Lisa Stansfield, I don't like her either. Been around the world and I, yeah, yeah. I can't find my baby. I don't know and I don't know why. Talk about Chris May not be a lady, but I'm a woman. <laughs> <laughs> Blue lace agate, plain rounds. Oh. Um, eight mil plain rounds you're going to be getting here. Who's related to Lisa Stansfield? Someone's related. Oh, it's Ollie. Related to Lisa Stansfield. There you are. As in the singer. £19.95. pence. Beautiful stripes of uh, blue lace agate. They are gorgeous, aren't they? I'm related to Sheila Hancock. John Thor. No, you're yes, not. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. How? She married, before she married John Thor, she married my great... Uncle. Wow. Yeah. Oh, so I love Sheila Hancock. I was always Auntie Sheila. Auntie I Sheila's love Sheila time. Hancock. Yeah. Um, under £20, well done. The for natural blues, I go, Carol, your Heather Small impression is the best ever. Lol. <laughs> <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> 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 you've got to imagine you've got a hot potato in your mouth. <laughs> you can't do fun, boy. It's hard to fail. Boy, it's hard to hear on your phone. Look at the time. <laughs> yeah, 25 too. That's the time. That's the time. Right, come on, mate. Oh, great. Well done, mate. Yeah. Oh, these are the ones oh, that you I saw. saw. I saw. <laughs> oh, they're beautiful. <laughs> Look at these. <laughs> Multicolour fluorite graduated faceted cubes. They are amazing, aren't they? I love all the facets on these. They're such an They're interesting beautiful. strand. Fourteen ninety-five. Oh blue. my word. Which side is it? Is it? Oh no, it's the other side. That one there. Blue? Like blue. There are some gorgeous colours here. Two left, two left, two left, two left. Who's going to get it? Who's going to get it? Who's going to get it? Christine, Debbie, Lana, who's going to get it? Who's going to get it? Who's going to get one of those oh, last I ones? I have missed a trick, actually, with something. We've been Why? talking about summer holiday, or well, yeah. winter holidays. Yeah. We've not had an Alicante. I'm not doing Alicante today. No oh, way. you've got to do Alicante. I'm going to get in trouble. Li Liam's not heard Alicante. No, I'll get in trouble. <laughs> I, I, oh, I don't know. I'm getting trouble for not focusing on the job in hand. Fourteen ninety-five. Well done. Amazing. Well done. Beautiful blues and blues and greens and purples. But you're right. The blues are the most exciting, the most unusual colours, aren't they? I, I absolutely love this. They're gorgeous. Look at this one. They're amazing. That one there is gorgeous. Oh, absolutely stunning. Yeah. Yeah, strand. let's do it. Zebra quartzite. 
Zebra quartzite, did he just say? Mm. I'm sure he said that. What colour is it, love? Oh, blue. Oh, aqua. I thought, I thought he, he said, said zebra. zebra. I thought he said zebra. Here we go. Aqua quartzite. <sighs> look at that. Oh, will you look at that? Aqua quartzite puffy ovals. Oh, Again, that. that'd go lovely with the garnet. That oh, got definitely. Really yeah, nice. the reds strong, look amazing, don't yeah, they? A strong colour of the strong colour. Yeah, that is really, really nice, isn't it? Look at that. They look absolutely sensational together. Look at that. Do you know what you'd need is a pair of earrings, just, just two yeah. for an earring, and then maybe put a garnet top and a garnet bottom. Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous that would be. Yeah, definitely. And I charge that for, for one pair of earrings. Oh, they, I, yeah, absolutely. And they're so rich, aren't they? The colours mm. look amazing together. It would be wonderful to get all of these um, in the same, um, uh, to get all of these in the same, in the same kind of suite of jewellery. The colours mm. really work well together and they're so affordable. Well, the quartzites are. Do you reckon that the garnet's going to be affordable, everyone? Yaha! Mm. 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 Yaha! It's going to be absolutely amazing. Can you smell spring onions? I can smell spring onions. I don't know no. what is going on there. I can smell spring onions. Shall we what? Oh, what for this? Do you know what? Clearance price. C -c 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 Clearance. Oh, my word. You're ready for this. Seven pounds for your gorgeous aqua quartzite. Oh my word, well done, well done, well done, well done, well done. Right, okay, what are we doing now? <laughs> Lapis! Lapis loves you like. Come here, mate. Get off. Lapis loves you like. Do I know any up to date songs? Not really, no. No. I, I, yeah, I'm not singing Lewis Capaldi. We're gonna get, we're gonna get, we're gonna get done, aren't we? <laughs> gonna get done. Gonna get done. Uh, lapis lazuli. Telling on you. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm, I'd be more. So, uh, lapis lazuli graduated plain ovals. Oh, these are really nice. nice. These are gorgeous. These are really nice. I Again love. With the garnet. Oh, I love that look. Really look pretty that. those. Isn't that gorgeous? I love these. They're stunning. And don't you love the pyrite inclusions? Mm. Oh, wow. And again, like the other one, it's kind of like a, a brighter blue, like a really nice yeah. royal blue rather yeah. than a really dark blue. Some yeah. lapis can be too dark. Absolutely. They are gorgeous, aren't they? They are absolutely beautiful, those. Oh, yeah, they are and gorgeous. And again, you know, with the, with the garnet or, you know... Um, oh, wow. With the fluorite that we've just done, mm. they'd look nice with the fluorite. Yeah, you're right. They would, wouldn't they? Let's get Do the fluorite. We, we don't back see out. a lot of pyrite anymore. I'm thinking of pyrite. We don't see a lot of look at that. pyrite strands, do yeah, we? Yeah, We used to have a, quite a lot of pyrite, and it goes so beautiful. If you've got any pyrite in your stash, then oh my gosh, it, goes it so really gorgeous. it brings out. It brings out. Oh, it would oh, go really well with the. Do you know what I tell you? Go with the crystal um, what I showed you this fire morning. beads. Oh, with the pearls. Oh yeah. my gosh, yes. Yeah. Oh, oh. Ooh, oh, you're yeah, you're going to love them. You're going to love... Well, you can say if you, you want. You can say. Yeah, go on. I don't know. I don't know gold pearls, but like gold. Gold pearls. Gold pearls coming up on Fleur Day, which is the 22nd Second. Second of November. <laughs> I think they're on the late show. Yeah, we're just oh, discussing them gosh, after amazing. the show what we're going to do. Morganite. Yeah, baby. Wow. Look at these. Look at the size of them. Wow, 145 carats of genuine morganite. That is absolutely amazing stuff. That's a pen there. Each one of those is a pendant. Definitely, 100%. On this round, 2, 4, uh, two, four 6, 8, 10, 12, 14. So it's about 16 on the strand there. Yeah, they are really, really <gasps> nice. The, um, 80 day. quid. Yes, definitely. Let's get that price point down for you, shall we? Look at them with today's deal of the day. Of course, they're going to go together because they're both barrels. Aren't they? Yes. <laughs> Look at those! Beautiful together. 
Amazing. $39.95 for the Morganite. That's 145 carats of genuine Morganite. That is a huge carat weight. Again, with a gem like Morganite, especially when it's got a colour as striking as this, nice to keep it unfaceted. Nice to have it just really lovely and high polished. It's really, really beautiful, isn't it? I love the peachy tones yeah, to this as well. I love those kind of like that peachy undertone. But again, go beautiful with a Sharite. Yes, absolutely. Any of those Sharite strands that we did. Mm -hmm. but I mean, for me particularly, the um, Rondelles. Yes, gorgeous. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, with Sharite, it would go so well because, of course, they've got two very complementing colours, but you've also got... Uh, kind of zones and kind of beautiful striations within your Morganite, which will go beautifully with the uh, with the beautiful Sharite, wouldn't mm. it? Well done, thirty nine ninety five. Absolutely fantastic. Well done. Let's do next. What's, um, what's the other strand? Some is that another opal strand? Say again. The, is that another opal strand that's on the this? Table? It looks like dendrites. Oh. oh, is it a dendrite? Oh, wow. That's beautiful. It's beautiful, isn't it? I love dendrite agate, dendrite opal, any dendritic mm. gemstone. I think they're absolutely. Oh, it's dendrite opal, is it? I love really it. Beautiful. You basically got a gemstone like an agate or an opal, which mm. has got dendritic inclusions in it, which look like tiny little black plants um, mm. going through the gemstone. It is, oh, I think it always looks like a snowy landscape mm. with a with an outcrop of um, you know um, uh, trees. Yeah. Um, they're absolutely beautiful. Oh, look at that. It's the way it those like inclusions. You'd are see like, like in Canada or oh, like de yeah, is definitely, that kind of thing, yeah, yeah, yeah. That kind of, Beautiful landscapes it reminds you of, of like this. the wilderness. Yeah, with um, with 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 uh, it's it's a be it's a totally unisex yeah, gemstone, is. isn't it? It really is a great gemstone if you want to evoke that kind of winter wonderland mm. kind of quality. They're just oh, they're just I think so exciting. It's a very elegant. I think if you were to wear something like that, somebody would. I know you shouldn't judge a book by, book by its cover, but if you were to wear something like this, I think people would think. Oh, that's an elegant person. Yeah. Because this gemstone is such an elegant gemstone. It's like a grey marl, isn't it? It's a really lovely, sophisticated palette you're going to be getting here, full of kind of different um, different tones, different layers, different levels. The blacks, which you've got, are fleeting. They're not completely... I mean, on a couple of them, they are. They are more prominent than, than in others. But a lovely, neutral palette to wear for everywhere. Anyone could get away with wearing this. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's not as simple as being a black and white and grey gemstone. It's got everything in between. It's got that wonderful texture it's got kind of what looks like living plants within it I, I, I just love it yeah really nice that with a beautiful cashmere jumper yeah absolutely yeah gorgeous would look? it would look stunning yeah. wouldn't it you're so right Fleur Nancy Lynn Helen well done to you my lovelies fantastic gorgeous gorgeous I've got some black frosted doozy uh I'll pop that there uh this one here it is oh that is nice. That's a nice. That is nice. I love the um, the finish. Yeah, frosted frosted finish is nice, isn't it? So I would, put, I would put high shine copper with that. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Just to really make probably make little like bead caps for them. Yeah, that would be a really nice contrast to the kind of the the mm. frostiness, wouldn't it? Look at this one here. This one looks like. Do you know when you see sound waves? Yeah, it looks like yeah. oh waves. my gosh, you're absolutely right. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? That yeah. is a really cool one, that one. I like that too. That, yeah, yeah, definitely that one. And the, the lines and the kind of the chevrons that you get going through this gemstone is really beautiful. What is so effective about this gem as well as the contrast between that frostiness and then the druzy, it, it brings out that definition even more. That's give itself an, its own bead cap. It has, isn't it? Oh, that's so clever. Look, there's your druzy as well, which is a, such a stark contrast. Oh, look at that one. That's incredible. It's such a stark contrast to that really beautiful frosted quality, mm. isn't it? Looks almost like granite as well, doesn't it? You like It totally a, does, yeah. Great gents jewellery. You know, if you've yeah. got some um, Eslon going through, knotted into place, oh maybe like gosh, a marla style amazing, bracelet, yeah. um, or maybe just one on a cord. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. 4 95 for you today. Well done. Let's do some bolt ring clasps. Oh, yes. Lovely. And then it'll be time for the garnet, I think, my lovelies. Okay. Bolt ring clasps. These are, these are absolutely invaluable. Bolt ring clasps are something which... Oh, lost my... There they are. Here we go. Here we go. So bolt ring clasps. Uh, so rose gold plated sterling silver. You're getting 10 in the pack. 10 in the pack. Rose gold plated sterling silver. Here we go. Let's get that price point all the way down for you today. This is my favorite size to make charms with. 
Aren't they perfect? Absolutely perfect yeah. chance because if you put it next to a five mil jump ring, which you could make that kind of stretchy yeah, yeah, bracelet yeah. with them all in, it's going to disappear. It just keeps straight in. Yeah, yeah, yeah perfect. For um, a bracelet, maybe for a little flower girl, which is going to yeah. be a little bit more delicate, perfect. Yeah. I personally would probably use these, yeah, for charms or for mm -hmm. smaller bracelets. Necklaces, you might want a slightly larger bolt and clasp. You don't mm -hmm. have to, but you might want one that's slightly larger. Uh, but that's a brilliant price. Three ninety-five, making each one of these thirty-nine pence. They would Amazing. go well with a star buy, actually. It's time for the garnet. We've been talking about this strand all show. I have got about 300 available. The price is amazing. Prepare yourselves. This, I think, is one of the best star buys that we've ever done in the 12 o'clock hour. Don't go anywhere. It's coming up right now. Garnet is the world's most amazing genuine gemstone. It is an ancient gemstone. It is a gemstone which is known as the bringer of light. It's the gemstone which is um, unbelievably um, uh, beautiful. It is, it is a reasonably readily available gemstone. And I tell you something, it's a really easy gemstone to get wrong. Really easy gemstone to get wrong. There's a lot of substandard rubbish garnet out there that's being sold on the high street. And my pleasure is, is when we come uh, to Jewelry Maker and, and we bring you uh, that really beautiful gem quality garnet, which has not only got that gorgeous color, but it hits the clarity as well. And that's exactly what you are getting here. It is absolutely beautiful. Now, I've got about 300 of this. It is, it is a big old quantity, but, 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 potentially, all 300 could go before the end of the show, okay? And the reason for that is it's got the quality, it's got the clarity, it's a really popular gemstone, but most importantly, the price point is ridiculous. We asked you um, last hour to text in what you thought the price point was going to be. We have price points all over the shop. You know, 20 quid, 24.95, uh, even under 20 pounds, which is absolutely brilliant. One person, the first person who texted in right with the correct answer was Janice. Janice, you're going to get this strand completely free of charge, which is amazing. By all means, though, do come through and get the strand as well, because I honestly think that you are going to want to multi-buy. OK, now we're going to give you a minute clock to prepare yourselves. It is, in my opinion, it is the best star buy that we could ever offer you in the 12 o'clock hour. Um, let's start that 60 second clock. The reason why I think it's such a great star buy is it's instantly accessible. It is going to be one of the most affordable ways of buying garnet that you've ever, ever experienced. It is going to be such a, it is going to be such an affordable star buy. I love being able to bring natural gemstones to Airflare that are mm -hmm. not only beautiful, that are not only cut in these beautiful shapes and drilled, and ready to use, but they are accessible. They are, mm -hmm. they, it, it, it surpasses everybody's expectations. Yeah. And that's exactly what we've got here, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, you definitely have. And you've got a gemstone that if you were to ask somebody, um, you know, what gemstone is it and you show them, then garnet is one of those gemstones yeah. that is like at the forefront of people's minds when you mm. say a natural gemstone. For me, this is just got so many, it ticks so many boxes. Oh, I love making historic jewellery. Yeah. It's one of the most historic jewellery pieces of, you know, gemstones that you can be Absolutely, used. yeah. Goes perfectly with other gemstones or just by itself. You know, Definitely. it's strong enough to stay by itself, but it will work as a support in that to other yeah. beautiful gemstones as well. The straight away, have a look at this. 42 carats of genuine, beautiful, natural Indian garnet. Yours today, 19.95. We are under 20 pounds. It's absolutely brilliant. It's incredible. I've got about 300 and I want them all to go today. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. The clock is still there. Why is it still there, Liam? because in one minute's time, we are going to take the price point down to your actual price. It's not your deal today. We are going to go lower. You have got a minute to basically come through and get this, as many of these as you can. Start checking out, start putting this in your baskets because it is going low. We have already decided how low we're gonna go. We're gonna go far, far, far lower than where we should be going. How much lower do you think we should be going? Do you think any other day of the week, by the way, 
This 30 centimeter strand of garnet, I don't think would be selling too far away from 1995. Oh. Maybe 1795. Yeah. I mean, 1495 would be brilliant. Do you not think that garnet is one of those strands that somebody at home maybe think, no, I don't think it's for me. I don't like red. Get this one home. Oh it's my so gosh! Many, you get lost looking into garnet. You garnet really, is, really do. It's one of the best gemstone families. Love it ever. You've got those beautiful. You've got like gorgeous pinks and purples oh, coming through this it's one. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's, it's like it's on fire. You literally yeah. look into it, and it's like. Alice in Wonderland, you get lost in it. You're absolutely right, Flynn. With genuine freshwater culture pearls, you've got the most historic, yeah. uh, the most yeah. historic gemstone combination you could mm -hmm. ever wish for. Loads of people with us in their baskets. The phone lines, I've already got lots and lots of people on the phone lines here. 40% already gone. Here is your incredible price point today. We're gonna take the price down. Check your baskets out. You are not going to, you are not Ooh. going to, oh my word. You, you absolutely have to be multi buying. You are not gonna be disappointed today. All the way down. Seven ninety five. I thought it was going to be a few pound more than that. No, thought... seven ninety five. Seven pounds ninety five pence for what I think is top top quality gem quality garnet. It is absolutely up there with some of the best you will ever be able to find, and so much better than so much of the garnet you yeah. find on oh, the high yeah. street. It's oh too dark. my word! Some of it's far too dark. It's absolutely. But if you if you treat yourself once a week to a nice wow. bottle of wine, mm. don't have that bottle of wine. Buy this strand. Buy this and strand you will, instead. You will yeah, fall in definitely. Love with garnet as a, oh. as a family, you will fall in love with you this gemstone. You are absolutely right because it's it is. I can't. It's very difficult to sort of like describe the colour of it and, yeah. and the feel of it. It's, <gasps> it's such a oh, regal gemstone. It, it totally is. It's absolutely amazing. I've got about a four minute queue on the phone lines at the minute. We did say to get in early. Um, oh, half the quantity is gone. That's absolutely amazing. Well done. Loads and loads of multi bidders coming through to get this now. I'm so excited for you. Well done. I, I would take that over a ruby. I would take a garnet oh, over a ruby. Yeah. I, I, um, yeah, I think it's down to personal preference, but do you know what? I think in this particular case, I think you're absolutely right. I've got 90 seconds left on the show. I've still got loads of people trying to come through and get this. If you're on the phone lines, I'm going to guarantee that you can get this strand, but you have to stay where you are. Do not hang the phone up when the show ends keep hold keep hanging on the phone lines i've got so many multi bidders well done everybody um well over well over 80 90 percent of people are multi buying that's absolutely fantastic well done Flo. you've been amazing today thanks darling thank you it's been great to have you on with us today chuck chucky egg um you've got alison tarry and jenny cleary on the mid show today that's going to be loads of fun oh that's going to be absolutely fantastic um uh, so do make sure you come through and get these items as quickly as you can keep hanging on the phone line to that anybody who's on the phone lines now stay where you are do not hang up um and um micro faceted beauties coming up brand new four strands coming up at eight o'clock this evening keep coming through for that gorgeous garnet by the way i've still got a load of quantity left but you've just got to hang on the um phone lines there well done so you've got uh, your garnet you've got your um african turquoise you've got your multicolor barrel and you've got your other garnet as well beautiful quality um, thank you so much, Flair. Thank you. It's been awesome. Thank you very thank much. You. Keep coming through for your gorgeous garnet. Um, don't hang up the lines. We will be there to answer your call within the next couple of seconds. See you in a bit, guys, and tune in for the mid-show. Did you know that if you go to jewelrymaker.com and sign up to our mailing list, then you'll receive 10% off your first order with us. We'll also keep you updated with special offers, themed shows, program guides, and jewelry maker tutorials. Jewelry Maker. Create, wear, share.